What's up, everybody? Oh, it's dark in my room. I don't want to open my curtains because the heat is just going to be killing me today again. Oh, so, ladies and gents, gents and gentle ladies, thank you very much for hanging, for hanging out, for coming in. I guess. Uh, I should be able to stream six days in a row this week, which I'm really looking forward to. Okay, we got Aoi. I was like, we miss Aoi. But no. We can only go straight. Good to know. Any... No? So we're in the... A underwater path-ish, and we got booby-trapped by... Arukeri Moon again. And now they are playing tricks on us. There, it's Saki. Saki. Oh no. Is this it for me? Pull yourself together, Saki. Saki, is it? What is it, Saki? What's wrong? He's talked to her at least until the end of the camping trip. Saki, wake up! Oh, is that you, Aoi? Thank goodness. You're with us now? What? what? Takuma and Agum are here too? What am I? Um, did I, did I say something or... No, you didn't. Oh, uh, yeah. It's fine then. Keep hiding something? I admit I'm curious, but more importantly... Glad you're alright, Saki. The worst for him. Well, the thing is, she started badmouthing me out of nowhere. I knew it. A fake floor mon pair too. Why are all of you here? When I came to, I was by myself. I've been going around looking for everyone. Looks like all of us were separated somehow. Got separated from Takuma too! And me from Aoi. I was so upset. Really? That doesn't sound good. Do you think Miyuki and Haru got caught up in this too? Yeah. We better hurry and, f and look for them. The others too, of course. Yes, yes, you're right. We need to find them right away. Oh, it's Floramon. Oh, hey, Saki, we found the others. Yeah, that's right. They're your good friends. Friends help each other out of trouble. But you're hiding a big old secret from those good friends, aren't you? Ugh. That's no good, Saki. Real friends don't keep secrets from each other. You'll be all alone again before you know it. Oh, alone again? No, I hate being alone. What's wrong with having a secret? What? Are we? Everyone has things they can't reveal, even to their best friends. Relationships where you have to say everything are just suffocating. <laughs> and she disappeared. So that was fake. Looked like Florimon, but it was someone else in disguise. Aoi, thank you so much. Don't mention it, Saki. Okay, what are the... Go back, go straight. Anti light crystal. I like we're up against many lights, though. Are you really? Thank you. Don't mention it. This sort of thing is only is nothing for a friend. You two have encounters like that too. Yeah, Takuma helped me get through mine. I just threw my two cents in. Oh, he didn't give up, so she was able to meet up with Labramoon. I see. I can't just sit here feeling sorry for myself. Definitely find the real Flora Moon that give our Kenny Moon something to cry about. Yeah! Uh, let's go to the right. Oh, Saki, thank goodness you're alright, Flora Moon. You the real one? Of course I am, can't you tell? Yeah, my bad. Don't sweat it. I'm sure you've been through a lot, so... You're wide open! The heck she is! Ah, your friends are here too? And me too, huh? There he goes. 
You can go, Agumon. I think Saki's more important. You okay, Saki? Yeah. Thanks to Labrum and Agumon here. Hehe. <laughs> That's right, just leave it to us. <laughs> what a sick joke. You're not wrong there. What do you think? My plan to play the baits went off without a hitch, don't you think? <laughs> I guess. We were pretty worried about you getting hurt. This is enough to phase me. I had faith that Agumon and Labramon would protect me. Besides, Flora might be facing the same kind of enemy attack, so I'll do anything if I can find her quickly. I got you. Still, don't do anything risky, okay? Sure. That's enough for me, if I'm being honest. It's pretty freaked out back there. I can only go back, okay? Ah, it's Floramon. Where did you go, Saki? I was worried. Sorry, I was alone before I knew it. Of course, I looked for you. You're always like this. I'm sick of how selfish you always get. Huh, Floramon? Always the same. Move in to the beat of your own drum, regardless of others. You might be having fun, but what about the troubles you cause for everyone else? Hey, stop. Don't say that. You know that none of them can stand how narcissistic you are. That's why everyone around you disappears one after another. Stop, please, stop, I'm begging you. You don't know a single thing about Saki, Takuma. Saki may seem flighty, but she really pays attention to all kinds of things. Anyone who knows her gets that much. Don't talk like you have any clue about it. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> you okay, Saki? Yeah. I think so, somehow. Takuma, thank you. Takuma. Okay, one is go back and the other is go straight. Go to the right, I mean. Must go to the right, right, let's go to the right. Another one. Oh, it's Floramon. Saki, I finally found you. Uh, yeah, you are Floramon, aren't you? What an awful thing to say. Any idea how much I suffered after getting separated from you? Sorry. Ah, could you know? This is you we're talking about here. What? You don't give a crap about any anything or anybody else. You just do whatever you want. You really think I get along with the kids like that? Perish the thought. You're always acting like you're the center of the universe. That's why people hate you. No, stop. Do you think it's time you recognize it? There isn't a person alive that likes you. That's enough out of you, excuse me? Saki's self-centered? She doesn't care about others? That's just your biased opinion. Saki isn't selfish, just straightforward. She never lies to herself. I, lacks, I like Saki way more than someone like you who pretends to be something they're not. Huh. Huh. Fake floor moon, run away again. Oh, we, oh, we, I. Yes, I understand. Just take your time. Aoi and Saki really are close now. Traps like this are nothing with those two around. Side path? I think we're gonna go straight forward, right? Yeah. Maybe I should have gone to the side path, actually. Ah, Saki, I finally found you! I was looking all over for you, thank goodness. Hold up, there's two floor of them. Be careful now, that uh, one's a fake. She's lying, Saki, I'm the real one, you've gotta believe me. Jeez, I can't tell the difference, which one is the real one? Can you tell Takuma? Mm, let's see. Just like with Aoi, maybe talking to them will help figure it out.
Everyone knows how close you are to IOE, right? That's true. We're always hanging out together before we sneak in the music room. Got it. In that case... You guys are... Yeah, you guys are just too different. I bet you two will never be friends. You say, and you two chat for ages before you sleep. Like two page ease in a pot. <laughs> That's formal for you. You know, it's through and through. When you're right, you're right. Good one, Saki. Huh. So that's your true face, Seedromon. Damn. If it comes to this, I'll have to use force. We're up to bad Agumon. I'll throw the pain of being tricked right back in your face. We have a bigger pool of... Um... friends now. Let me see. No chests. No chests. One chest here. situation. Condition procedure will defeat it. I'd say I like that very much, honestly. Also, Dos. That creative Jake. Creatives Jake? Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Thank you for the follow. That's one down. I'm doing good. I'm good doing good. It's just F's. It's just hot. 
in here. Uh, let's see. This game is great. I love Digimon Survive. my chest can help you out with your graphics slash branding for your stream like emotes logos overlay screens and more no you can't i do my own uh, screens overlays and everything Chest is open, iceberg. gonna go bad. Join my Discord if you use explanation mark Discord, the link will be in there. Baskets. And it's turn.
least everyone leveled, except for Agumon. He was way too high level. Saki! Not a heart attack. But I was so, so worried about you. I'm so glad I found you again. <laughs> yeah, I'm happy to see you too, Floramon. Aoi. Felt the same way when I reunited with Labramon. Yeah! That great, Takuma? Sure is. Still, everyone is dead tired by the looks of it still. Can't blame them. Between being isolated and that mental attack, that was rough. Aoi, Saki, you two rest here. I'm going to go look for the others. Sure, I'm totally on board for that. I'm about to fall down from exhaustion. Me too, to be honest. Thank you, Takuma. Leave it to me. Come on, let's go, Agumon. Whoa, what? The, an earthquake? No, that's... not that. Someone's fighting. Fight? Then some of our friends must be there. Let's go find out. No probs, no probs. <laughs> Is the battle over already? Takuma, that's... I've never seen that thing before. It looks at us. It isn't going to attack us, is it? I wonder if it's on our side. Who's that, I wonder? Ah, wait! Woohoo! Hey, wait up, Takuma! Look, Takuma, it's Miyuki and Haru. Really? The other creature still bothers me, but those two take priority. Are you guys okay? Not hurt anywhere? We're fine. She protected us. She? You mean that beast? Renamon. Renamon. Must be the one we just saw. You know her from before? Nope. See, what about you, Agumon? Have you seen her before? Sorry, can say that I have. Hmm. Don't know if she is a friend or foe, but at least she saved us. She reminds me of Garurumon, but Garurumon is our enemy. Yeah, but... I hope she's one of the neutral ones, at least. We don't need any more enemies. Whoops, I better focus on the guys in front of me first. Need to walk? Yeah, she's not even injured. Then head that way. Aoi and Saki are right over there. I'll go look for the others. Come on, Agumon. Aye aye! Hmm. What's this? Energy seed. Seed boost. Okay, side path or go straight. Did I ever give her equipment? Yeah. Let's just go straight. Straight up! Mew. Ah, Takuma, over there, you see Mew. You're right, come on, let's go. Mew, are you okay? Oh, Takuma, Agumon, Mew, what's wrong? Why are you crying? Oh no, are you okay? Are you hurt? No, I'm not injured or anything. I just had a fight with Shakomon. Fight with Shakomon, but why? It just, she starts saying really nasty things out of the blue, so... It's too weird to imagine anyone yet, anyone as buddy-buddy as them having a fight. Guessing that wasn't a real Shakomon. Shakamon, why would he s Why would he such awful things out of the blue? Uh, why would he say such things out of the blue like that? Don't worry, that wasn't the real Shakamon. The real one? Yeah, fakes like that showed up for me, Aoi and Saki too. They're all resting now. Char changed into their partners and said terrible things. All for Arakenimon's trap. But, but that looked like Shakumon to me. 
they all look exactly the same as the real deal. The rest of us got tricked too. Talking to them makes the difference clear. It's okay, Mew. We'll find the real Shakamon. Yeah. Yeah, I'll search out the real Shakamon. Yeah! The real one. It's one of the worst traps you could lay. Let's go to the right. Ah, look, it's Shakamon, Mew. You still hanging around? You're too weak to be here on your own, Mew. Get your brother to protect you. Ah, but he isn't here now, huh? Too bad. Don't need Kaido. I can do just fine on my own. Haha, <laughs> you mean your spirit power? No, that's a total sham. Urgh. You're just ignoring your insignificance. Just accept it. Let yourself be protected. No, stop. I don't want to be protected forever. Worry me, the Shakamon's a phony. The Shakamon that hangs out with you would never deny your power. He knows how strong you are. There's no way he'd call you insignificant. Yeah, you're right. But then this is... Huh. Just a fake. Despaired. Oh, yeah, that's good. He said such awful things to me. If Kaito were here, he'd be fine pace on the floor. So true. If Kaito was here, that is. Oh, Shakamon. Miu. Are you really Shakamon? What about you? Are you the real Miu? What? Lying about spare power, laughing when you're frightened, pretending to like things you hate and hate things you like. You don't show the real you, but that's... That's not... Liar, you haven't said a word of truth. Every inch of you is a lie. Someone like that real Mew? What does it mean to be real? Wait, no, I'm not... I'm not lying or anything. She's never told the truth? Shakamon would never say that to Mew. Takuma. The feelings she holds for Shakamon are real. Shakamon would know be that better than anyone. Worry me, this guy's total fraud. Huh. <laughs> ah, he disappeared. Mio you okay? Yeah, thanks, Takuma. Takuma! <clears throat> oh, I should have actually checked if there was anything hidden. And this looks like. Let's go back real quick. Oh. Uh... Now we're back at the first place. So what goes straight brings us back here. Let's hurry, somewhere else. Shakamon's waiting for us. Yeah, we gotta go, go, go! Uh, fake Shakamon. Look, there's Shakamon. Ah, Mew, I'm so happy to see you're safe. Shakamon, you re like the real one. You okay? You're not hurt or anything, are you? I'm fine. <laughs> oh, Mew. Fake. You can't do anything like that, right? You're just a normal, silly little girl. No way. It's possible to lie about yourself. You'll be found out eventually. Actually, I bet they already figured out, figured you out. Just give up and act like a normal girl. But, but I don't want that. I mean, if I don't do this, I'll be on my own. But you're already a loner. Not a single person gives a damn about you. I guess that's not totally true. Some people are crazy interested in you. There's your brother. Then there's that guy who. Stop it already! No, no. I don't want to remember. Don't say things to make me remember. It's okay, Mew. You know you're not alone. Mew has more than just Taiko. Taiko? Taiko, sure. Taiko. Kaito! She has me and the rest of us. There's Agumon, of course, and more than anything, she got Shakamon. 
And a real shakamon would never call me something like a loner. Yeah. Yeah, you're totally right. Huh. Heh. <laughs> Angry face. Ah, he disappeared. Come on, let's keep going. I'm heading into the wrong directions, but I want to check that one room with the camera real quick. This is a fucking maze, yo. Let's see, I think we went to the right or the left last time. I think right, I always go with right. Oh, no, we did not go to the right last time. Because if we did go right last time, we would have already found Shakamon. That sucks. Oh, Miu, I'm so glad you're with Takuma and the others. You okay? You're not hurt, are you? Jeez. Shako Mono became Shako Stereo? <sighs> He's just a fake. He who smelt it, dealt it. You're the fake. Takuma, I'm supposed to tell them apart. Hmm, let's see here. There must be something like the others to help tell them apart. No Mew is strong. Not doubt her feelings. The real Shakamon wouldn't doubt you. Your feelings should get through to Mew. That works. Hey Shakamon, you know I freaking love you. Oh yeah, I love you too, Mew. Where'd that come from, Mew? Okay, that's not gonna help. Seem off the mark. Come with me now, otherwise I'm gonna get yelled at by Arikenimon. Be in trouble if I don't sacrifice any human children. What? This Shakamon's giving me the heebie-jeebies. This can only be the left one. This one. Knew you'd figure it out, Mew. Good job. Fake one ran away. Damn it. Could at least ask him where our kingdom is. But what's that sound? Someone must be fighting. I'm gonna look. You you head that way and join with Ayui. Got it. Let's go, Agumon. This time we didn't even see it transform into uh Cedramon. Is that Minoru? Minoru. Shoot Takuma, you okay? And Agumon is with you, what luck. Look, Falcon! Goodness, pardon me, Agumon, I appreciate the assistance. Sorry, man, but can you guys jump in here already? Someone showed me this weird freaking illusion and I'm totally drained. Okay, I'm coming. Come to save ya! I'm surprised that Minoru didn't have any issues here. Oh, what the fuck is that red one? Uh, I can bring two others. I think I'm bringing Flora... ...and... ...Shako. There's a chest behind Cedramon there. Did I even get anything good from the last chest? I don't remember. Okay, two chests again. Um, Pokemon is fast, so we're sending him this way. In the meantime, I'm gonna go move forward with Akimon, attack, pepper breath. Mm. 
Doom stay like that for now. Select the choke. Evolution. Veginary. Oh, this one actually attacks. Okay, good to know. Hey, Kaito is gonna appear. Yo, check it out, Kaito. Our buddies are fighting over there. We're late to the party. I can see that. Come on, let's join them. Nice. I'm surprised we didn't have to do that entire illusion ordeal with... Uh... I keep forgetting uh, Alchemon's uh, guy's name because I'm a dummy. Movement speed up. Um, do I evolve yet? No, wait. Actually, maybe... We do not wait. Tentamon appeared. What a great fucking combo. Pepper Breath. Kill this guy. Transform. It's Tyranomon. Shucker! Nice counter. That's what we like to see. Evolution. Attack, fire breath. Kill that. And turn. Super short burn. didn't notice because I'm a dummy.
Dragon Moon getting destroyed. Yeah, it's fine. I'll let uh, Daedra Moon uh, move past the Cedar Moon. So you can uh, move for miles. Throws me, what a dick. As long as I don't crit, we should be fine. Speed break. Okay, nice. Diatri Moon. That's what it's called. Book toss! Critical nice. Victory. My oh, that's so bad. My capture card has been frozen this entire time. Jesus Christ. Oh, that's bad. Uh, it's not like anything important happened. Phew, ha, see that? See how tough we are? Thanks, Takuma. You really pulled my butt out of the fire there. Indeed, I share his gratitude. You're very welcome. Glad the two of you are safe. That illusion you mentioned. Did the fake Pokemon appear to Yumi and Noru? Yeah, he had a real mouth on him, so we ended up throwing down. And I saw him arguing with the double corner. I was certainly taken aback. Right, and that's when the real Falcomol showed up. Still, they both look the same and even hawk the same. But in the end, I chose the right one. You guess if you, I do say so myself. A guess? You mean to say that was dumb luck? It ain't dumb if it works, right? Real talk, I was more convinced by the fake. Ha <laughs> I cannot be. I couldn't tell the difference. You can tell the difference, Minoru? For Falkmon? Sit down, you lout. Have you any idea how worried I was about you? Yeah, what was that for? I picked the right one, didn't I? It's Minoru for you. Still gotta feel a little bad for Falkmon. Hey, Takuma. Whoa, it's you, Kaido. Glad to see your guys are safe. Who cares about me? What about Mew? You seen her anyway? He's been like this the whole time. You gotta do something, Takuma. Now, just calm down, Kaido. I'm sure Mew... Sick of his brother's freakouts? Mew? Oh, thank God. Freaking worried. You're so damn annoying. Stay on your side of the cave! <laughs> it's not like you weren't worried about him either, Mew. I, I wasn't everyone. You found each other. Oh man, what a relief. You guys are good too? Now that's what I'm talking about. So you saw the vision too, huh, Minoru? I did too. 
I think we all saw them. It was terrible. What the heck was that? It's like I couldn't tell my ass from my elbow in there. Messed with my head big time. It was probably an enemy attack. I can't even... Who knew they could attack like that? Did they make you see something... Did they make you see something strange, Mew? How are you feeling? I'm okay. You worry too much, Kaido. Really? For real now? Really real? You're such a pain. I said I'm fine. <laughs> is it just me, or is this waterway changing shape the further we go in? Some of these parts weren't here before, and others seem to have up and disappeared. You think it might be the gas doing this? I don't want to see an awful vision like that ever again. You got that right. Gotta get out of this place and do something about that big baddie. You mean our honeymoon? Yeah, still. Shoot, I can't catch a whiff of where she is. In that case, our safe's best is finding our way out of here. Ain't the idea of running with our tails between our legs, but you ain't wrong. The exit is right past here. If our minds are made up, I suggest we... Hold on a sec. Is this everyone? Aren't we missing a head or two? Let's see. Shuji! Jeez, that guy looked pretty close to Kraken. Hope it ain't come to that, but... We have to look for him right now. Better hurry. Let's all go together. We're all in this together. <laughs> It'll be bad if we get separated again. We need to lock this down together. If we in a hurry, then we ought to split up and cover more ground. He's right, we can't leave Shuji alone when he's like that. We have to find him soon. Yeah, but... It'll be okay. If another fake shows up, we can just beat them over ourselves. Fair enough. Let's split it up and look for Shuji. It's up to you, us, guys. It's up to us! <sighs> I'm dying of the heat here. The flying flies are flying them. Okay, let's see. Go to the right, go to the left. Pretty sure we're not gonna be able to uh, get to Shuji on time. Look to uh, search any cranny. What's that? Was there something in the water? What is this? Good luck charm? Huh? Isn't that mine? Seriously, but why? How did it end up here? So it belongs to you? Here you go. Thank you. What is it? It's so little and cute. Why is it here? It's supposed to be in my closet back in my room. Is this important to you? Kaido gave it to me. Don't get it twisted. It's just something he gave me when I was having a rough time. So I guess it's important. Don't get your panties in a tie. Something like that. Oh, 
Oh, Takuma, look over there. Isn't that Shuji? You're right, Lopmo's with him. Shoot, they're on the other side of the waterway. Gotta find a way around. Hey, Shuji, Lopmo, I... I dad. Shuji, Shuji! He's swirling around Shuji and he looks... He's looking at a vision. You have to hurry, Takuma. This looks pretty dangerous. Yeah, you're right. You have to head over to the other side. Vexing Ella Hurti Crystal. Go right, go straight. Jesus Christ, go right, I guess. Because that's where he was. Aoi, have you found Shuji? No, not yet, sorry. It's been... it's nothing to call just here. We better hurry. Look somewhere else. What the? A CD? Oh, Takuma, that's... no. How could... why is it in this place like this? Is it yours, Aoi? Yes, it is. See here? There's a sticker with my name on it. Oh, yeah. Well, here you go. Thank you. What is it? It's so shiny! This is a CD of a classic rock band that my father gave to me. I recommend other music to me, but for some reason these are the only songs I liked. It is born to you? Well, yes, it's my fav It's a favorite of mine. The lyrics say, Fear not the path you've chosen, those who hinder were frozen. That's stuck in my head. <laughs> I know it sounds kind of dark. I mean, what can I say? At any rate, thank you for finding it, Takuma. Now the question is, do we go right, or do we... No, we can only go right. Okay, good to know. Always talk to them. Saki, any luck over here? Nope, I haven't found anything. Where could he be? We just have to keep on looking. Don't worry. I'm sure we'll find him. I'll look somewhere else. Mm-hmm. I'll look around here a little more, sure. Huh? Is there something in the water? What's this? Some papers? Oh, this is the name of a hospital near my house. Wait, that's Saki's name written. No! Oh, Saki. Did you see it, Takuma? I mean, I saw your name on it, but okay, it's not too bad. What's going on? You guys fighting? And uh, no, no, not at all. Takuma was just acting like a pervert. What? No, I wasn't. Christine Wizard, welcome to the stream. Thank you for the follow. What? No, I wasn't. Wow, what a perf. Perf! Perf! <laughs> Stop it, I'm not, I swear. She totally dodged the question. Oh well, I'll, uh, I'll try asking again when the time is right. Must probably have something to do with her uh, physical state or something. Okay, so to the right, it was not. Things over there, Minoru. Ain't found nothing. What about you, Takuma? Nothing. Well, as long as we keep looking together, we'll definitely find him soon. Yeah, no point in giving up now. We'll look somewhere else. Sure, I'll keep looking around here for a bit. I'll leave it to you. Huh. Is there something in the water? They all respond the same way. Is there something in the water? Nani? What the? Is this a door or something? What? Hey, Takuma, that's... Why, my action figure... Why is my action figure in a place like this? Well, this is yours, Minoru? Here, take it. Uh, thanks, man. What is it? Totem of some sort? It's an action figure of a Saturday morning superhero 
that was on TV before I was born. I'm sure I left it on my desk back home. Is this important to you? It's the first thing my dad ever gave me. This might have been the start of everything, now that I think about it. <laughs> Thanks for picking it up, my man. Little bit of history on everybody. We went left. Was that a path back? Where Minoru was? Go right. Oh, okay. Well, good to know. Now we haven't been missing anyone. Except for Shuji. Well, what else can we say? Shuji, Shuji. Where could Shuji be? Yo, Takuma! Inaru, guys. Hey, we didn't see Kaido, though. Didn't find Shuji anywhere, either did I. Doesn't sound as if anyone's seen him. It's the only place left to look, huh? My extra fish gear is disappearing. Oh, so is my CD. And my chart. Whoa. Good luck, Charm is. What? They were all illusions, then? Lame-ass trick. Visions, I see. So that's why only the camera could see them. From what everyone said, they were all important things from their lives back home. But not Kaido's, though. Maybe I missed Kaido somewhere. But I think I went it everywhere. Oh, look over there, Shuji and Lopmon. You're right, hey, Shuji. Shuji! Yo, are you deaf or something? Shuji. Hey, Shuji. 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 Can't he hear us? We're not that far away, are we? Hey. Doesn't he look like he's walking kind of wobbly? Is he heading further inside? Hey man, something's wrong with your boy. You're right, come on guys, we need to go after him. Shuji! No answer, maybe he didn't hear me. Looks like he can't hear Lopin either. Maybe I should get closer. Shuji, are you okay? Ah! Oh, it's, it's you, Takuma. Thank goodness we were able to find you. You're not hurt, are you? No, no, I'm fine. It's nothing. You sure? You're sweating like a pig and you're as pale as a ghost. Ugh. Shuji, Shuji, shut up. All you must stay away from me. I'm scared. What are these things? Leave me alone. I wonder if Shuji saw longer our vision than the rest of us. So, his reaction would be understandable. It's been that way from the start. Suspicions may be rough to watch, but the memory of one may be even hard to stomach. Sorry, I lost my head there for a second. I'm better now. Yeah, I'm okay. I have to be. So none of us are sacrificed, and we can all go home. It's just, yo, maybe spineless cowards, but I'm fine now. Please don't worry. Or am I fine? Really? Maybe something's wrong with me. Don't worry about it, Shuji. We were doing just fine before you showed up. Wait, what? That cannot be a... The teeth? Must not have read that correctly, did I? Need someone like me. Um... I see. Yeah. You need someone like me. Did I just make things worse? Obviously. Do you seriously have no idea what sh you should or shouldn't say? Yet you want to make it feel better, but there's such a thing as time and place. I'm sorry. I think that guy's lost it. Better watch him, Kaido. Lost it? You think he's, his screws finally came loose? Well, <laughs> yeah, well, I can't say how things will go from here. I guess that's up to him. So there ain't nothing we can do. So we're going to talk to someone who knows more about this world. The enemy, right? That's right. Now that I think about it, I hate to say it, but our Rukenimon is the only one that seems like she'd actually listen. Blood goes straight to Garurumon's head, making him go berserk. At that point, he won't listen to friend or foe. Rukenimon seems like the better choice. Agreed. I sensed an intelligence that's needed for this kind of discussion. So those guys are dead set on sacrificing kids. How can we make them talk? Those bastards only see us sacrifice, right? You doubt they all listen to what a bunch of sacrifice have to say, is that it? Yeah, I'd say not. That's why we've got to be the ones doing the stomping. 
It sounded like a gangster. Bet we could make a simple conversation work. Yeah, what she said. But you... What to do, what to do, hmm. We have to try to talk. That's the only way to avoid a fight. Still, I doubt those guys are eager for a sit-down. I see a fight in our future. Then again, we don't know a thing about them. Can't say anything for sure. <sighs> Let's see. Okay, this is a moral path. We won't know the best course of action until we find them. We don't know a thing about our opponents after all. Don't we though? Those guys seem... Those guys serve up humans kid, human kids as sacrifices. Jesus, I can't English today. Still, there may be some circumstances we're missing. Circumstances? And what pray tell would justify serving up kids like me? I mean... So that means we have to run in and... Run in there, all guns blazing. Especially considering we have no idea what the deal is on their end. Uh, well, guess that's true. I'm done for either plan, Takuma. But maybe we should get everyone on the same page. We're all over the place right now. No way we can have a talk while we're like this. That's true. Uh, hey, Shuji, aren't you going to join in on the discussion? Stop it, I told you to stay away. Uh, I, I am so... I can't take it anymore, I'm sick of all this. Shuji? What's wrong? Shut up, shut up, shut up! Uh, Dad, you're wrong. You're wrong, I... I. It's going on with his luster ship. No, but it doesn't look good, does it? In the world, he's just staring at thin air and talking to himself. Uh -huh. Ah, stop, please stop, I'm begging you. Uh. Holy hell, he's fast. He went off on his own? Damn it. Now who's the one dividing us? We have to follow him. He's going crazy! Guys, I found Shuji. Ah! Hey, yo, you scared me. What the heck? What's wrong, Shuji? What do you mean? You guys don't see that? I don't see anything. Look right there. How can you guys act so calm? Nothing there, right? Yes, nothing, but... What's the deal? Is something wrong with the guy? He's freaking me out. Hey, Kaido, I think he's at the end of his tether. Yeah. Hey, Takuma? Yeah, why are you speaking so softly? Drakmon said that Shiji might have lost it. I have to agree. You shouldn't talk about him like that. Clearly, things can't go on like this. We have to do something. No, if I can't stay here any longer. What the... What's wrong? Goodness gracious, calm yourself, Shuji. Stay here, Miyu. Hey, don't treat me like a kid. Let's do what Kaido says for now, Miyu. Wouldn't it be best to leave him alone? You're right, but what was that about? There's nothing, right? Yeah, what the heck? Visions. Visions, guys. Illusions. <sighs> can't hear it anymore. You can't see or hear it anymore. What the heck was that? Our vision? I uh, think about it. I've heard that voice before. Arikenimon, no doubt about it. That was Arikenimon's voice. I know. I'm okay. Let that vision destroy me. Or maybe, maybe I'm seeing a vision right now. Which is it? Things can't go on like this. My dad would be so disappointed to me. As a leader, I have to make sure no one gets sacrificed. If I do, I, I can, I can live up to my dad's expectations. This experience is all for me. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> With this story in any college entry interview will be a breeze. I can get into a good university as my big brother. Dad will have to praise me then. Yeah, that's why I can't go down here. I won't lose to a vision like that. But I said I'm useless. No, I'm fine. Shuji, what's wrong? Yeah, not the visions. I won't. I'll never. Ah! He freaking ran off again. What the heck is he? What the heck? Where the heck is he going? Oh, he's looking a little shaky on his feet. Shuji, please come back, Shuji. Looks like he didn't hear us. What should we do? We can't just leave him like that. Let's go after him. He's our trap. He is the trap.
there's actually something here. An X heal. Ooh, now this is something else. You think so? Mm -hmm, I think so. Okay, might as well take it with us. Takamai's full Chuji. Wait, really? Yeah, over here, hurry. Something's really wrong with the guy. We gotta chase him down quick. Got it. What should I do? <laughs> you, you're our Kenny Moon. What do you want? The enemy's here, our Kenny Moon. Guys, that poor thing, totally unaware that you've been separated from the pack. I have to write talk. I'm here to talk. You're intelligent, right? Let's talk it out, okay? You insist. Go on, then talk. Ah, fantastic. Instead of fighting us, all of you would rather go back to your own world, yes? Yes, exactly. Just want to get home safely, that's all. I never want to hurt anyone with you. If that's the case, then I suppose I can let you go home. Really? However... You need to provide some compensation in return. That sounds reasonable, yes? You anything, just name it. We need a sacrifice, a single one will do. So give us just one person. <laughs> really? Just one? <laughs> oh, dumbass. Shuji? Just one, right? Right, Arakanimon? Is Arakanimon there? Shuji? Where exactly? No one there. Jeez, man. Our boy's freaking lost it, hasn't he? Arakanimon is not there, then who's he talking to? Must be seeing another illusion. Snap out of it, Shuji. Just one. Just one. Who the choose? No. I I can't. There's no way I can make that choice. Where are you going? I know. Me. It should be me. That would work, right, Arukanimon? After I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, let's go, guys. Answer me, Arukenimum. I'll be the sacrifice. Take me. What admirable spirit still. Is that what you really want, my dear boy? You lack courage. And your sense of justice is nothing special, don't you think? You're just frightened, and you want to leave this place behind. You'd rather pass the buck onto someone else. Isn't that true? No doubt about it, he's still stuck in an illusion. One just for him. Just what is the... What, just what... Just what the enemy wants. Are you kidding me? Having issues today, Yordi. That sense, Arakenimon? She just seen a vision of Arakenimon. Why didn't I realize it before? Thought something was wrong. Those fakes seemed more likely they were buying time. Arakenimon was aiming for Shuji from the start. She lured him away from us and kept showing him these visions. He's been seeing something like this whole time and we had no idea. Shuji, wait for me, please. Ah, Lopmon ran off on his own. After him, we have to rescue Shuji. Lopmon's going after him. If we follow, we're sure to catch them. No. I want to save everyone. That's all I need. My dad will finally be proud of me. More... Way more than my brother. Uh, uh. Well then, if you really feel that way, why don't we let this one do the honors? Mega Sea Dragon. Wow. No, not that. Stay away. See? Now there's your true colors. You're afraid of death, aren't you? Of course I am. Who wouldn't be? No, I don't want to die. On a place like this. No! It's okay, Shuji. I'll protect you. Oops. I'm so sorry, dear. I'm afraid you're of no use here. <sighs> you won't beat me. Ah! It's your idea of protecting me? Don't make promises unless you can deliver, you useless thing. <laughs> fight better if you were... And fight better! If you were better at fighting, I might not be in this mess. You can't even evolve. Maybe you'd be of some use if you could. Yeah, be able to feed our enemies if you could do that. Enemies, anyone who looks down on me. You should just erase them all. My dad, even my brother, everyone. I... 
Why am I so hopeless? Is this all I really am? Wonder if Lopmon is gonna do dark evolution. They actually kick Lopmon. Wow. Yeah. Ah, uh, Lopmon. What's with the black folk? Is it coming out of Lopmon? That's bad news. Bad news? What do you mean? I don't know. It's just I can't tell. It's bad. First, we've got to stop Shuji. If all of us hold him back, then maybe. Now that's far enough, my dears. Our Kenimon? Something quite amusing is about to begin. Be good little kids and stay put, would you? Screw that! If you won't get out of the way, we're going right through you. My, that brutish grunting of yours hasn't changed one bit, I see. Oh, Mega Seedermon! Is it my turn now? Another one? Still. We, we can handle it if we work together, right? You know it. I'll fight too. Yeah, let's help out Mew. <sighs> How irritating. Every last one of you. Still, it would be even more irritating if you were to perish here. Enjoy your playtime, Mega Seedramon. Just don't quite kill them, okay? Got it. Hey, you looking down on us? We just have to clean that guy's clock, right? <laughs> oh, by all means, do it if you can. Between you and that boy over there, that's just ju uh, that's just double the show for me. We have to go all out, guys. Beat this guy and save Shuji. Let's go, Agumon. Yeah. Only three? <sighs> Fuck my life, would ya? Mega Moon is... Vaccine, I think. Not vaccine. Data. So... Drag Moon, and then we're bringing Falco Moon. In case we need chests. Mega Moon feed it. Agum dies. Oh, good lord. have a look around. Ah, that's not much better. Fuck. I'm gonna have Minoru do all the walking with Falkmon again. And then evolution. I hate to do it, but I'm sending Agumon away from them. I think I'm keeping Dragmon over here. I'm not gonna evolve, I'm just gonna let them slowly move. And same goes with Labramon. Marching fishies! Take out this guy here. 
as soon as I can at least. That lava I'm going to move this way. The electric shock is fine. Go on, hurry up and evolve. We'll show them we're not useless. Stop it, Shuji. It hurts and I'm scared. I don't like this. I'm the one in pain. I'm the one who's scared. All because you can't evolve. Yeah, everything is your fault. You're the reason they call me useless. What's with the black fog? I don't know. It's just, I can't, I can't tell this is bad. Don't do it, Lopmon. Bad feeling. Yeah, it's unmistakable. Nothing strong or trustworthy about it. Those senseless eyes, that moaning. Is he going berserk? You did it. I knew you could do it if you tried. Now show them. Show them I'm not useless. Transformed. Is that the... The evolution Drakmon? That's Wendigomon. Get away, Kaido. That thing is trouble. Lopmon probably turned into that as a reaction to Shuji's rage. This is bad. Our words aren't going to get through to him. He took down such a huge enemy in a single blow. <laughs> yes, that's the way. Crush all the villains looking down on me. Oh no, run away. He's gonna crush Yuji, Shuji. Huh? Why are you coming over here? Whoa, stop. It's me. Don't you recognize me? No, of course not. Stop! Ah! Yeah. It. It ate Shuji? I don't believe it. This can't be happening. Oh, <laughs> dinner served. That's all she wrote for this one. Ta-ta! I'll deal with the rest of you next time. Ah, wrote. Hurts. Hurts. Help me. Destroy. Destroy all. Ah. Oh no. Now it's looking at us. The rest of us are in danger at this rate. But can we really fight against Lokmon? No, there's no time to worry about that. All we can do is protect ourselves. We have to fight. Let's go, everyone. <sighs> I wonder if I could have saved him if I kill when nah, I don't think I could have killed Thingy. Wait, are all the chests gone? Oh, that is crazy. I didn't expect to actually lose all the chests. Agumon dies. There's a new chest there, at least. Let me have a look around. Probably due to me being greedy and wanting all the chests, I guess. Move. Just a wolf. I 
Uh, I'm keeping Agmon slightly here, actually. Ventimon's vaccine. Agmon after the Tentamon. The stats on Wendy Gomon anyway. 2263. Damn. 25. I'm sending four among. ASQ, I'm sending four among along with uh, Hawkmon. Or, uh, that is actually not too bad. Can I not? I can't move through that as a champion. Wait, what? <gasps> you already made a mistake. You already made an oopsie. Resistance against dark is adrenaline. <sighs> Evolution, Dobermoon. Let's see, can we actually hit him? No. And then that means I'm gonna move this way. Myself. I'm going to destroy her. Yes, that's what I'd like to see. Actually, now I think about it, we might be better off destroying this thing here first. The chance that I get healed is not that high. I'm just gonna keep Agumon over here for the time being. Or should I move him upwards? We'll see. A bit of luck he goes after Doberman first. Um in a room. Evolution. Walk this way. Destructive war. Assist. Critical. 600. Nice. 
Someone is gonna evolve at this point. Pretty sure. What's going on? Our attacks aren't working at all. He's pushing us back. I can't take this. Why did this thing have to turn out? Why did things have to turn out this way? We're all friends. Why do we have to fight? This is bad. Our spirits will give out before our bodies do. We have to turn this around somehow. <laughs> Listen, Takuma, he's crying. Crying? It hurts. I'm scared. I don't... It's Lopmon. Lopmon's crying. What's, what's wrong with me? What should I have done? That's... No way, that's Shuji's voice? I don't have any right to live, I should just disappear. It's not true. It's good that you exist. Did Shuji really think that? If so, then we... We put him into a leader position role due to his age and made everything his responsibility. He was suffering the whole time and we were the ones who made him suffer. Let's go Takuma, we should save those two ourselves. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. We have to end this with our own strength. We'll have to convey our feelings to those two. We'll need even more strength to get through. Your heart's giving me power, Takuma. Your strong feelings towards those two. <laughs> ah, Takuma, it's happening again. Aguma can't be. Aguma? Did I just say Aguma? Agumon can't be. Agumon Digivolve 2. These be Metal Greymon. Yeah. That's what we like to see. Metal Greymon. Ultimate Ascension. That form, are you? Now our feelings will reach them. Come on, Takuma, let's do it. Raise damage dealt by fire attacks two ranks and fire resistance one rank. Alien Destroyer, that's not great. Anyways. This should... Oblivion. Yordimon is okay, he's just heating up, like always. Actually, stand here. Throw the cord. And finish it with Metal Greymon. Whipped Wendigo Moon.
perfect enlightenment slab. Ooh. That means some of us can go to ultimate. Well, not some of us. Some of them. We did it. Yeah, it's over. Do you think we saved them? Sure, we've saved them. Did we really? In the end, all we did was attack Lopmon. Well, we could still be okay. First, we should check on Lopmon land. Look, the fog is back. Whoa. Now it's getting thicker and thicker. Um, hey, don't you think this fog is strange? Strange, the fog surrounding us, but it's not getting any closer. Wait, that's not it. It's swallowing up Lopmon. Yep, I'm scared. What's going on? It can't pick on... Pick and choose what it goes after? It's like it's alive. Wait, wait. Give Shuji back, dammit. Hold on, idiot. You can't do anything now. You just get caught up in it to it. Get away. No way. This can't be true. It is. <laughs> Truly a sight to behold. Watching a heartbroken... Watching a heart break into pieces is absolutely amazing. You you did this, didn't you? Why, yes, indeedy. Wonderful show, wasn't it? Give Shuji and Lobmon back, you eight-legged sack of shit. I'm afraid that's quite impossible. Still, you have to feel a little bad for Lobmon, no? Things wouldn't have ended for him this way if he'd never gotten involved with humans. It's all you're doing. Time for talk is over. We'll crush you. I could play with you. If you like. But no, perhaps I'll call it a day instead. Fucking Arukin mom. Don't you dare run! Damn it, she's gone. Is this real? Aoi. Shuji, look mom. Don't believe this. Hey, what the heck is going on here? Calm down, just calm down, okay? How can I calm down? What is this? Where's Lopmon? Where's Shuji? You saw it, didn't you? You saw what happened to them. This can be... This can be happening. Is this the type of thing you were talking about before? No way. I thought things would go this far. Damn it! Signs were there that this could happen, and yet we did nothing. There wouldn't be any more sacrifice, but you were the next one, Shuji. Shuji, all together, are we? You can't fall apart here, it's too dangerous. Thanks. Shuji couldn't trust Lopmon, could he? That's just so sad. Still, he said he'd become sacrificed in me. In the end, Shuji was desperately trying to protect us. Yeah, we never saw eye to eye, but Shuji was doing his best in his own way. Always looking for the least dangerous methods to keep us all safe. He always looked... took the lead in our searches and tried to guide us. Even his, first, even his frustrating ways to talk to us was just to keep us strong. Even though things turned out this way, we should always remember that. <sighs> the fact that Shuji worried about us. Oh shit, wrong harmony pick. Always worried about our safety. We should have never forget that. We may have pushed Shuji into a corner without even realizing it. Rely relying on him just because he's old are forcing such difficulty difficult role on him. It so wouldn't have happened if we'd worked as a group, if we'd stuck together. You're beating yourself up too much, Aoi. You'll exhaust yourself again. Yeah, you're right. Ah! Hey, you guys, the fog's coming this way. What? No way! Words, next targets. Gather up everyone. Stay as close as you can. Damn. Now of all times, we don't have the time to mourn. Yo, this is bad. Fog's getting thicker and thicker. Ah, uh, stay away! You- Ah, uh, damn it. What should we do? Is this the end? All of you, over here. What, well, Professor? You're alive? Professor, thank goodness. Look, I like... Like I gave you all quite the fright. But come, you must hurry. We must flee from here while we all haste. I have much to tell you, but that comes after. Let's go, guys. The Professor is alive! Are you okay, Takuma? Agumon. I honestly don't know how to respond. What should I have said? What was I thinking? Shuji's odd behavior, his snapping, then his death. Lopmon's bizarre evolution and the enemy's goals, which we still don't know. 
with all these problems piling on, all we could do was run. Hey, are you okay, Takuma? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. For now, anyway, since the oldest one of us is gone now. You'll have to be the next leader. Everyone seems to look up to you. I'm surprised how much I've come to rely on you myself. Just don't overdo it, okay? Well, that is uh, actually uh, quite open-hearted of him. Part 6. Should you fucking died. Gavimum. Yikes! What are we going to do? We're surrounded. They sure to find us sooner or later. Ah! So, so scary. Um, you're shaking with fear too, huh? Me? No way, I'm fine, don't worry. You stay here, Gabmon, I'll draw their attention away. Don't do that, it's too dangerous. I know it is, but I want you to be safe. Wait! Gabumon was Haru's. I couldn't stop him. Why does he act like that? Who am I kidding? It's because I can't protect myself. I wasn't strong enough to help, I wanted to, but I didn't have the courage. I'm too weak, I can't go on like this. I have to get stronger, way stronger, strong enough to protect him. I should try to rescue him. No, I will rescue him. Uh, what's this? What's this like? Digivolve into... Garurumon! It's not Digivolving, they just call it Shinkai Evolving. My body, it's changed. What just happened to me? I feel strength surging inside me. Is this the power of bonding with humans? I can do this. Now I can fight. Hold on, Haru. I'm coming for you. It's too late. Uh, what is this light? It's getting sucked into the light. Hey, wait for me. Where are you? Go, don't leave me behind. Come on. Why is this happening? Was our bond alive this whole time? We got warped! <sighs> it was all just a dream. A dream about bonding with humans. <laughs> Is that how you feel? Wanna join our hunt for sacrifices? Are you watching me sleep? That's pretty creepy. How many times do I have to tell you I'm not work going to work with you? I don't care about humans. It's not those kids I have a grudge against. Alas, what a shame. I can't just stand here and let those jerks do whatever they want. They're using the human's power to evolve. I'll beat them and destroy all their bonds. So that's what happens. Harry <laughs> Kenny Moon, you twisted bitch. There's the exit. Is everyone safe and... Kaido. Drakmum. Labramum. Aoi. Ugh. I didn't think it goes... I think it goes without saying, but we're all pretty beat up at this point, man. After everything that happened, it's weird if we weren't. Okay, Minoru, we get it. Calm down already. You're not usually so harsh. Harsh? People died! Yo, Shuji are gone! You're the weird one acting like nothing's wrong. Look, I'm not okay with this either. Oh, you're right. Sorry, man. Minoru and everyone else lost their cool from emotional shock. It's not safe to explore like this. We should rest till we feel better. You've got quite to look there, Takuma. Are you okay? I'll be fine, Nakamu. I just need to let my body... We're safe around here, right? Don't sense any enemies. I think we're fine. Right. If you think so too, then I trust you, Agumon. 
You all must be totally exhausted. Don't push yourselves too hard. Same goes to you, Professor. Where have you been, anyway? To tell you the truth, I wasn't sure you'd make it. I'm glad we found each other. Oh, shit. Although I blacked out along the way, so I'm not completely sure. I probably bumped into something as I was falling, and it softened the impact. I apparently landed in the water and was swept into the drainage path. Once I came to, I got to look around for everyone. But then I realized I ended up on a different island, that the fourth. After exploring and figuring out and figuring that out, I went back to the waterway. I assumed that if I made it to the other side, I might find all of you again. And I finally did, so that's what happened. <laughs> but I was too late. If only I'd made it back earlier. I might have saved Chuji, Professor. Alright. You could stay here and rest. I'll investigate the perimeter. But, but Professor, it's too dangerous to go out there by yourself. Oh, I'm well aware. If I find anything, I'll let you all know right away. I may not be able to fight, but I want to make sure myself useful somehow. Needless to say, what you kids need most right now is some simple rest. It makes sense that as the only one with any energy, I should be on patrol. Well, it does make sense. Everyone is exhausted and in shock. We're in no shape to move. The professor wants to look around, so it makes sense for him to do. Guess you're right. Just be careful, okay, professor? Of course, I'll be back soon. It's been a while since the professor left. The professor sure is taking a long time. I'm starting to get worried. I'm worried about us too. No one has said a word. Not that I blame them. Been through long and short, in such a short period of time. What the heck was that? What are you talking about, Kaido? Was the vision from our Moon? No, it can't be. Shuji was eaten by Wendigo Moon, and then Wendigo Moon was swallowed up by those hands that came out of the fog. Yeah, he just disappeared like Ryo. Disappeared? He didn't just disappear. Shuji died, just like Ryo did. I mean. Drugmon, just what are you guys? What was that thing we saw back there? I... I don't know. I've never seen anything like that before. You have to know something. Our lives are on the line here. Kaido's getting worked up, but I understand where he's coming from. Everyone's shaken up. They don't know what to believe anymore. Hey, Saki, if we don't do something, everyone's going to... No, stay away from me. What, Saki? It's out of line, Saki. Foramon's just worried about you. Right, Aoi? You think so too, huh? Maybe, I guess. Kinda get where she's coming from. Just to be clear, you guys all are on our side, right? Of course we are. Of course? How can you even say that? Can you prove you're truly on our side? Doesn't the fact that I fought at your side this whole time prove anything to you? It's true. You've always been there for us, like friends, partners even. We really trust you. How do we know you're not lying? For all we know, you're pretending you're worried to trick us all later. Calm down, Minoru. I know you are concerned, but bullying is not the good look on you. Excuse me? Tell me what to do? It makes you guys so different from everything we fought so far. Allow me to make something clear. If we hadn't uh, accompanied you children, you'd all be long gone. So what? You're saying you can just get rid of us anytime you want? That is, why do you keep assuming the worst about us? Enough, Minoru. I understand how you feel, but this is getting us nowhere. Okay, okay. I'm um, sorry, Takuma. I just don't know what to do, dang it. Minoru is really confused. I wonder if I can make him feel better. 
If he can calm down, that might give him some time to figure out what he wants to do. Or if I can suggest what we should do, that might make him feel better too. Now is not the time to think about what to do. Everyone's in shock and tired. Overthinking will only lead to trouble. Rest your body and your mind will feel better too. You should see yourself right now. Don't get carried away. Who's talking? Whose fault do you think this is anyway? Stop it. Why can't you just get along? Thought we were partners, and I'm mad that it could all be a lie. You're assuming it's a lie. Exactly what the enemy wants you to think. Stop fighting, both of you. Shut up, Mew. Why, you don't like what I said? You wouldn't say that if you knew what happened to Ryo. Shakamo might try and eat you one day, too. You never know. Can you say that? Shakamo would never do such a terrible thing. She's right, I'd never hurt Mew. If I were you, I'd be thinking about your own partner instead. Yeah, Kaido, you were way too mean to Drakmon. Apologies in order, we're supposed to be on the same side here. Oh, come on. I said that because I'm worried about you. It's bad, I won't stop the fighting, but it's only getting worse. Enough, this is just pointless if you're just gonna be stubborn. Well, come on, hey, where are you going? Come on, don't go. But you gone, who knows what will happen. Can you at least wait until the professor gets back before deciding, please? Yeah. It's not too much to ask, is it? Come on, Falcomon. Right. I suppose I may have been too hasty in my distress. If only Minoru and Falcomon could get along, like Mew and Shakamon. Free time action. Holy shit. Yeah, they're all fighting, and it's not good. <clears throat> What's near city? The boots unlocked. Shopping district unlocked. Free battle unlocked. Let's go talk to Agamon and the professor. Where's the professor? Should I say something to him? First, we'll have a look if we can find anything to grab. Giant mushroom. Hey, Spirit Away, Chapter 3. I met a strange monster while lost in, in the mountains, and together we somehow made it back down. Even so, what greeted me in foothills was not a village I knew. A, what? A different cliff? There shouldn't be one in a place like this. Did, did we come down the wrong side of the mountain? <laughs> That's right. That's it, right? Sorry. I was yesterday, you had fun. Yesterday was okay, SQ. It wasn't really that great, but it was okay. The monster regarded my confusion with a vacant stare of its own. Uh, I'm not sure what the problem is. Hasn't it always been like this around here? But what about my village? Forget the village, just take me somewhere with people. Hey, just calm down, okay? There's no village in these parts, and I'd never seen a human before you. Come again? According to the monster, this area is teeming with creatures just like it. On rare occasion, humans wander into this place. Some of the monsters believe that human children have mysterious powers and kidnap them for it. But don't worry, I'll protect you. If a bad guy like that comes around, I'll send them packing. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> In other words, this is another world. I really have been spirited away. So does that mean I'll never go back to my own world? Hey, don't cry. It'll be okay. I'm here for you. 
After that, I languished day after day, doing nothing, passing my time in a despondent daze. The monster stayed at my side, giving me food and teaching me about his, this world. It was pretty irritating at first, but perhaps it was the only reason I retained my sanity. Back where I come from, everyone treated me like a nuisance. I always, always lived with a bitter taste in my mouth, so that's how it was. But this place is different. There's plenty to eat, no one to resent, and most of all, you're here. I'm going to live here now. There's nothing for me to return to back home. I want to forget everything and stay here with you. Okay, if that's what you want, let's make it a happy life then. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. I'm going to live here, me and the monster together. Let's see anything else? Nope. Wait, I thought I didn't see anything else. Apparently I'm just blind. But uh, yesterday was okay. I'm glad that my parents are back home. Look at all these buildings. Could this be a human city? Maybe there are people here. I doubt it, but it's worth checking out. Talk to Agumon. Hey, Takuma, what's wrong, Agumon? Your voice sounds really tense. I'm starting to feel a little uneasy, too. It's just, I don't even know what I'm supposed to do. No clue. Somehow, I knew that you would appear, Takuma. I don't know why, but I did, Agumon. And I don't just mean that I knew some human kids would come along, either. I knew that it was going to be you, that one day, you and I would meet. I trusted you would come and wait it and wait it, so... You think you can trust me? Poor Agumon, he's anxious because everyone else is on edge. I don't think Agumon would betray me, letting him know that should ease his mind. But if I'm gonna tell him, maybe I should really open up about my emotions. You waited this whole time for me, eh? Thank you, Nagumon. I'm glad we met each other. Yeah, me too. One looks really happy. It felt awkward, but I'm glad I said it flat out. Hey, Takuma, here. I found this a second ago. Think it'll help? Large sincerity melon. This looks like it come in handy. Professor, I didn't realize you were here. Oh, is that you, Takuma? How's everybody holding up? Uh, honestly... Or not doing great, but should I really say that? The professor has been through a lot, yet he's working hard so we can rest more. Might not be a good idea to stress him out with honest truth, then again, being dishonest might cause us for trouble later. I think... I'm okay, don't worry. See, everyone seems very tired, yeah, but how do you know? Let's say it comes with age. There is no need to lie to prevent me from getting worried. I'm an adult, and my age means I must use my experience to protect you. Trying to hold yourself back won't help. Please rely on me as you need to. I don't want to see another young person lose their future. I don't want that regret. What happened to Shuji was my fault. I'm the adult. I should have done more. Well, Professor, you can't blame yourself for what? No. I failed to notice Shuji changing. That alone was a grave mistake on my part. I should have talked to him more. I might have figured out what was bothering him inside. Lopmon had never transformed in that matter before either. Manner? What manner? What are you talking about, Professor? The Kei reflect our inner state and change accordingly. I believe so, at least. That's why Lopmon reflected Shuji's confusion and transformed into Wendigo Moon. But even with my theory, I was unable to do anything to help poor Shuji. And at the end of the day, that is something I must take responsibility for, Professor. Oh, that reminds me, Takuma, I found this over there. I feel you should keep it. A crunchy apple. On that note, I think I'm going to look elsewhere to confirm some other things. Be careful, Professor. I think I have to put on some effort in both Saki, uh, Kaito, and what's his name? There's Kaito. Should I call him out? Call out him? Yeah. 
Yeah, I didn't expect Haru to be here. Ice cream bowl. It's something with metal puffer. Barber shop. It's a red and blue thingy, Takuma. That's a barber shop sign. Usually it turns around and around. With that twirly design, it bent did make my head spin. That's the point. It says Fifth Avenue. Must be the name of the shopping district. Sounds like a name you'd hear in my world. Oh yeah, you're in you still eating apples? No. Not as often at least. The name of a run of a mill. I can't glean any info from it. So these are shopping district rooms. We'll have to stay sharp while we're here. Okay. What is it? You want to talk about something? Hey, Kado, everyone seems to be on edge, but how are you doing? Okay, enough, I guess. Rockman was really yelling. It must be all the stress. Who knows if Kaido will tell me straight how he feels, should I ask? Maybe I should ask in an unusual way or surprise him. And see how, how he reacts. Just be direct, I guess. Did you get mad because you're worried? I just want to ask. You see other people as your little toys, don't you? It's not what I mean. I was just worried. But you might be worried. I know you didn't mean anything by it. You have no reason to worry, but I do want to thank you. From now on, I'll speak my mind more. That way, no one gets worried about me. I am on the lookout for traitors, but I'm not mad. Not worried, neither. If he does decide to fight back, I'll make sure he regrets it. Kaido, how can you say that? I don't trust Rockmon, not at all. We have no idea whether we can really trust him, you know? And don't act like you understand when you don't have a monster following you around. Right, I just feel sorry for them. Sorry if I hurt your feelings. <sighs> don't think of it, neither Haru or Miyuki have their own monsters. What's the difference between us and them? Something to do with the shrine? Kaido. Drakmon, hey Takuma, you look pissed off. You look desperate, depressed. Are you okay? Never get depressed. You should be more worried about yourself. He strikes act off. But making him recognize that he's sad won't necessarily change anything. You have to keep an eye on him. I mean, you already know why it happens, so. Let's go talk to, uh, there's me and Saki, should I talk to them? I should go talk to Saki for sure. Saki has me worried, like really worried. Yo, 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 good afternoon, Mr. J.P. He knows. He knows. Dave knows things. Uh-oh. You know, it's kind of crazy how quickly and easily people can die. Where the heck did that come from? Yes, yeah, Saki, why would you say something so sad? No reason. It just popped into my head. Why did I say something wrong? It's not a problem, really. I just want to know what she's thinking. Everyone's depressed and or upset, but Saki seems somehow different. It's like she's not really feeling anything. Like, all she had was a bad dream. It's not healthy. It could build up and get worse. What's she thinking, and why? Would she tell me if I asked? Let's try this. To help people in times of need. Can you tell me what's on your mind? Uh, I think that's impossible. Possible? Why? Sorry, Takuma. It's not your fault. I'm the problem. It's not any deeper than what I said. I just spoke my thoughts out loud. They're not particularly meaningful. Are you sure about that? Oceans and words must be out of balance from the shock. I might be overstepping my boundaries a little by saying this, but like you were just thinking things over in your own way. 
Yeah, so I just hope you can rest up and feel better, and then you can get back to being your normal carefree self. Is that how I seem to you? <laughs> I don't mean to. <laughs> I'm joking. Anyway, I'll try to feel better. Hmm. Nobody! Everyone is gone! They're all dead! <laughs> That's not true. I'm just joking around. Professor isn't here anymore. Let's go talk to Mido, Mido, Minodu. Anyway, maybe I should say something. I should probably look at every location as well. Oh, there's no timer. Is that Minaroon Falcon over there? I hope they're patching things up. Come on, Minaroon. You really trust us that much? Yeah, I do. I don't trust a single one of you things. After seeing the same thing happen twice now, how do you expect me to trust you? Alright, let me ask you this. How do you intend to fight the enemy without us? Your children are powerless. You're bound to lose immediately if you fight alone. Are you so proud of that monster-like strength of yours? Would you be so insulting about a power you reliant on upon that to know? You truly wish pain upon yourself? You can't survive on your own, then by all means. Think you're all hot stuff, do you? This isn't good. I have to stop them, but who should I stop? Rune's the one belligerent, but he might be more pissed unless I hear him out. Whatever I have to say, something before they say something they can't take back. Home advice. Yeah, of course I know Death Note. Guys, calm down. Fighting here is going to make anything better. Hold on. Minoru here is the one who's trying to pick a fight with me. It's not my fault. Your friends are the ones who keep attacking us. Associate me with them. You should know better as a human. Stop. If you two keep this up, it will only get uglier. Falcon, I need you to back off. Right, if you insist. Gee, sounds like you make a better partner for Takuma here. Minoru, cool your jets. What good is it going to do to come after Falcon? Fine, starting to make a guy wonder if you're really on the monster side, man. Minoru, he just refuses to back down. I'm gonna cool my head, leave me alone for a bit. Alright then. Wow, this, um. But it said there are two people here. Dave, you should never trust the viewer count in this game. Oh, he's not around. I heard that she and Labyrinth will take walk around here sometimes. I thought I'd run into them. Oh well, I had a question, but I guess I'll ask later, huh? Oh, there they are, Aoi and Labyrinth. Aoi looks kind of upset. I wonder what they're talking about. You need to be stronger, more reliable. I've been thinking that a lot lately. You're reliable already. I know you better than anyone, and that's what I think. No, it's still not enough. I'm still not enough. Are you worried about being a burden to the others? You know that's not possible, right? Thanks for saying so, Labramu. Still, that's not what I'm worried about. Of course, I don't want to hold the others back or be a hassle, but I'd like to be, become more reliable for myself, that's all. I want to be someone who can protect everyone. That sounds wonderful, Aoi. Hey, I want to help, okay? Go ahead and ask me about anything. I will, thanks, Labramu. It's kind of strange. Strange, what is? No matter how worried or depressed I get, walking in these woods with you always clears my head. If it helps you, I'll walk with you as much as you want, Aoi. <laughs> Thank you, really. I think apples are evil fruit. Ryu loved apples, and I'm pretty sure I saw another anime where the demon loved apples. Apples are socio, but Ryuk was neutral. Ryuk was not evil. I see, so Aoi always been discussing her worries with Labramon in these walks. Be that as may, she's trying her best to change as well. Better do the same. Now is not the time to butt in with my question. 
just sneak away for now. What? Who's there? Shoot, they noticed me? Well, I'll just come out and explain what... No, is that an enemy? They really never show up before. Come down now, we leave this to me. Don't let anyone lay a finger on you. Wait, what? Ah, this one is tough. Are you alright, Labramon? Kind of. But if I'm honest, I don't think I can win this one. Well, I hate to admit it, but I agree. They're working so hard to protect me and the others. The power that only protects isn't enough for us to stand up against this guy. And more power. More power not just to protect, but to overpower. It's frustrating, but it's true. We need more power. Power to defeat our enemies. I want to be more than damsel in distress. I want to defend everyone. To do that, I need power. Labramon going ultimate! What's wrong? I feel you're carving for power. It's all rushing into me. The strength of your resolve, that courage you use to stand firm, they give me strength. <clears throat> what is uh, Labramon going to turn into, I wonder? Nice. This game is getting more interesting. Only now? This game has already been amazing. Phew. Oh. What's happening? Sorry for the wait, Aoi. Don't worry. I won't let you down again. Now watch and I'll show you what it's like to have all the power you were hoping for. Defeat all the enemies. All annihilated. Let's see. Severus Moon. She can go one or three of three paths. Sick. Bad dog fire! Oh. That doesn't have much of a reach, does it? Guard break, then. Wagamum. Scissor small. It's pretty strong. Wait, what? Labramorn turned into Severus Moon? Yeah. <laughs> It doesn't make much sense, because he, uh, Severus Moon also turned, uh, or Labra Moon also turned into the, uh, other evil dog-looking thing. Are you Labra Moon? Not anymore. The name is Severus Moon. The strength of your resolve transformed me. The strength of my resolve? So those long claws, those fangs, are they the result of the strength I dreamed up? Does my appearance frighten you? Well, a little. But it's not your body that scares me. It's the sharp, monster shape of the power I carved. Can I truly master such a power? Don't be afraid. As long as your heart is true, even great power will not be astray. You can handle this, Aoi. I believe in you. Cerberus Vong! Yep, cute doggo turned into big ol' boy boy. You're right, power won't hurt people indiscriminately if I use it properly. I'll do what I can to live up to your faith, so please stay by my side. Sure, that's my line. Owie. It seems she's taken a big step forward. I can't fall behind. Ugh. Perfect enlightenment slab. World map. Saki, should I say something to her? Oh, we're gonna try to say the right thing to her, because... What's this? Power Pineapple! <sighs> I'm 
Sucking floor when they're talking over there. Feeling better. More than in our world. Really? That's great to hear. Yeah. We're okay without still have more time. Can't hear well from over here, but they're facing each other talking. She said, great to hear, so maybe their bad blood is gone? But something seems off, they're not always making eye contact. Hmm. It's like Saki's giving Florimon a hard time. Her emotions go straight into action, so she's mad one minute, calm the next. Wonder how that's playing out in the current situation. Hey Lizzie, new Lightyear movie is on Disney. Pretty optimistic. She just rejected Formal once when she got scared for a second. She doesn't really believe they'll betray us. In that case, she's being manipulative for Formal. So Formal, are you listening to me? Oh, yes, yes, what is it? They may be doing better than the others, but they still don't seem comfortable. Is there another thing that I can do here? So did you watch it yet, uh, Lizzie? Let's go talk to uh, Kaito again. Here's Kaito, should I talk to him? Not yet. It's a shame, I would have loved to see Lokon evolve. Don't worry about it, SQ. We're most likely gonna do multiple playthroughs where nobody dies. Hopefully. Are you okay, Drachmon? Oh, what do you mean? I'm tip-top shape every day. Wish I could say that, actually. I can deny feeling a little loud. Thought so. Kaito's been really cool to you, huh? Her bond is so strange. I know he keeps treating me like crap. But still, all I want to do is protect him with all my might. I know what you mean. I'm pretty sure I'd still want to protect Takuma even if he said something mean to me. I guess it helps that I don't take things too personally. Shouldn't be more scared of bigger things than me. Bigger things? He must mean Falcomon. This Falcomon is so serious and focused. He might be taking Minoru's words to heart too. Thanks, I'll keep that in mind. Please do. Alright, later. Didn't actually want to talk to Dragon, but to Kaido, but it's fine. I see Kaido and Drachmum over there. I wonder what those two are up to. I do things look over there. Some stuff washed up in the waterway, but it's all useless junk. Wait, what is a Drachmum? Actually, this might be something we can use. Whoa, you're right. Nice find. It's pretty nice, if I say so myself. <laughs> so Kaido, you and Drachmum are back on good terms now? Say what? Oh crap. Now they might remember all the fighting. Do I do? I can't let this spin out of control. I apologize or change the topic, or maybe hold my ground. Just double down, let's go. Can't undo what I said, so I have to stick the course. It's like you're back to good terms, like the old days. Not gonna back down, huh? You wouldn't put it like that, though. Yeah, our bond was strong before. It's not what I meant, either. I just don't care about trust or bonds, just getting back to our world would mean if this thing ever turned against me and put me in danger, I wouldn't not hold back, put it that way. Look at Kaido's face, Takuma, it's scary. It really is. Just like the time he blew up at Drakamon. Look, I get that you're worried about us. I'll try to be nice while we're still allies for now. Having toast, cream, cheese, strawberry jelly. Interesting. Please need picks needed. Let's start. Yeah, it sounds very. Uh, uh, what's it called again? No, we already spoke to Kaido. Okay, who else do I want to talk to? I know that talking to these two is not going to do me any good. Maybe try Miu, Miu here. Oh, hey, Miu, should I talk to them?
Power Pineapple. I have a piece left, and I'm not taking a picture of that lol. You know, it's strange. What's up? You see, there was a TV show that used to be on back when my dad was a kid, and this place really reminds me of that. Oh yeah? I can see that. This place has a really retro feel to it. Look at this menu. I think it'll help us out somehow. Ooh, what? Gimme, gimme. Oh, nice find, my dude. You take it. You all can use it together. Oh, thanks, Shakamon. Is it really okay for me to just take this? Why not? It's not like we know how um, it owns, who owns it. That's true. Might as well keep it then. Those two sure are close. That time everyone was fighting feels like ancient history. I hope the others can come to get along as well as me and Shakamon do. Uh, maybe everyone should model themselves after them. Should I take the chance to ask Mew to play Peacemaker? But how do I convince her? How does Digivolution work in this game? Do you get to choose your party? Okay, let me uh, let me explain that in a bit, real quick. <sighs> hey Mew, I've got a favor to ask of you. What? You and Shakamon are really tight, you know? I like you to use that as an example to help everyone get along better. Oh yeah, does that include Kaido? Why wouldn't it? No way! <laughs> Don't know about the others, but it just make him worse. You're being tricked, he said. Now that you mention it, no good, huh? Guess that means I can only watch over them from for now. It's a bit irritating. Okay. Uh, Dave said go get a chalky milk. Let's go grab a chalky milk. Digivolution in this game is fairly easy. There are, like, moments where you get a, a choice option. And this does not go for every choice option, by the way. At certain moments in time, you get a choice option as the main character between... No, I can't see the C. There's no C here. I wish there was a sea that I would not be streaming, because I'd be in the sea. Anyways, yeah, so there's a triple, there are sometimes triple options. And these options very lightly glow into a color. These colors represent moral, wrathful, and harmony. The path you take on these quests, on these uh, things, so I'm currently going for moral because I went with harmony before by accident and I thought that would lead to a gray moon, but that was not the case. So I decided to change to moral. And uh, depending on which of these choices you take, often which one is the highest and such, at certain integrations of the story, your Digimon will Digivolve into uh, and no, I'd start either Greymon, uh, Tuskmon, or Tyrannomon. Yeah, uh, and that's pretty much it for the Agmon line for the main character. He can, he has like three different paths due to the questions. Uh, but for example, Kaido. Stigmon, which is Drachmon here, 
will follow a certain line at all times until the last one. Yeah, then it'd be already swimming. And the same for them goes. You need a certain amount of affinity with them to actually uh, have them digivolve at some points at certain integrations of the story again. So you don't always just like have them evolve like Agumon would, for example. Uh, and I don't know what the deal yet is with the final evolution, if you can choose which way to go. I don't exactly how that... don't know how that works yet. But you also have three Digimon who can actually Digivolve into whatever the fuck they want, depending on their class, obviously. Or their, uh, what Digimon they are themselves. You can find a uh, free Digimon in uh, free battles mostly, which is okay. Swimming stream sounds like fun. Yeah, how the fuck am I gonna do that? I think we should be well rested by now. Uh, Drakmon, everyone's here, but it feels different than before. They're just tired, Takuma. Yeah, I guess so. So much has happened, plus all the fighting, we can't expect to recover overnight. Looks like we might have trouble getting along. Things were rough, but we got along fine until we escaped that underground waterway. It might get emotionally overwhelming to stay here with everyone in such a bad mood. Can I try to force everyone to feel better? Can everyone still walk? We can't keep exploring this area forever. It's time we meet up with the professor. Okay, okay. Ugh. I wonder if we're really in any shape to head to the enemy's base. Hopefully, getting our bodies moving will at least distract us. Minoru, angry still. Falcomon, angry still. This isn't good. Everyone looks on edge. Takuma, is it just me, or... Do things feel tense around here? Yeah, I guess so. It feels grim. What can I do to make people feel better? Maybe it was a bad idea to make them walk. Do I try and lighten the atmosphere? Like, for example, Dave, these, for example, you can barely see, like, a, a reddish glow on this option, a greenish glow on this option, and a yellowish glow on this option. Not fully recovered yet. How about we rest some more? We shouldn't do anything too rash before the professor gets back. What's the point of resting more? We've already covered as much as we can. You must be in shock like the rest of us, though, Taki. Sitting here just thinking is killing me. Resting won't bring back the dead. Saki, it's better to be safe than sorry. Now, can we explore this area a little more before the professor gets back? More sitting and thinking and isn't healthy at this point. It'd be better to keep moving. True, seems safe enough to explore around here, right? Takuma, look over there. Trap enemies are coming. Just look at us, what are we gonna do? Don't hold back now. Like I said, I'm on your side here. Gonna fight for me, Floramon? Of course. Be relentless, everyone. Terrible time for an attack, but it's better than keep being caught alone. You've gotta pull through somehow. Alright, Falcomon, show me what you can do. Afraid of our power, but then you want to use it for your own protection, huh? Ah, shut up! This isn't time for bickering. Stay focused or you might end up dead. Let's just get this over with.
10 SP turn. In the chest. Ripping nets obtained. Constitution, power through the motion. Something, something. Poop throw! These guys are pretty tough, not gonna lie. Um, Mantle Fire is an AoE spread? Did not know that. Agumon too strong. I gave him all the boosting items <laughs> that I found. It's like we managed to win. Yeah, although, is it just me? Or are those monsters acting weird? For sure. They're definitely different. Maybe because they're pulling something with our allies here. How many times do I have to tell you? No, absolutely not. You really need to shut your mouth. We're out here getting hurt fighting for you. 
on down. We're joining by powerful bonds and share our one fate. You've forgotten that? That's what I thought about this fated partner stuff. Weren't Shuji and Lobmon fated partners and Ryo and Kunimon too? I mean, if it's fated, then tell me what this fate really is. Why did they have to die like that? Answer me, Falcomon. I do not know what happened to them or why their fates played out that way. I wish I knew, but for some reason I do not. Exactly. So who's to say you won't do the same thing to us too? How do we know you're not you're on our side? That you won't attack us as soon as we slip up? In other words, you do not trust us. Got it all wrong! I would never hurt Takuma, never! Miyuki. What's wrong, Miyuki? You look sad. If you're feeling sad, just ignore them. You know how they can be. Slow down, Agumon. Can you really say that's true? Yes, I can. I will always protect Takuma. I feel the same about Aoi. All I want is to help her. I know you do, Labramon. I know. That's why I'm so sorry. Don't say that, Aoi. Drop it, Kaido. You're putting everyone on edge. You were so worried about me. You should rethink your priorities. But have you said enough? I've heard enough. I'm done here. Falcon, where are you going? Somewhere far from you. If we cannot trust each other, there is no point in being together. Goodbye. Wait, Falcomon? There you are. I've been looking all over for you. Went beyond the shopping district, but all I found were more rooms. To avoid lots of enemies, but it's pretty much the same as our island. In any case, all I did was look. There could be things lurking out of sight. If you're done resting, I recommend heading to town to discover new things. Right, sounds like it's worth going. It's the direction Falcomo went to. That way would be perfect. Alright, everyone, let's explore and look for Falco. Still looks bad, Takuma. What should we do? We can't give up. Search for Falcomon. Happened to Falcomon. Uh, about that, he ran off. I don't know where. He had a difference of opinion? No. Not really. He just took off. Let's see. Been through a lot, so a disagreement would be understandable. She isn't mentioning Shuji. And Lobmon, Oreo, or Kunamon by name. But we all know what he's talking about. Speaking of which, I know things are rough. There's something we need to talk about. We need to talk about something. What's that? Something I've been thinking about. There have been tales of Kenamagari who ward off disasters and protect their masters. This sounds an awful lot like the monsters accompanying you all now. Didn't you call the enemies Kemonogari too? They did. The enemies are different, Kenamagari. They may sound all powerful, but they're not gods. More like low level spirits. Though the way they exert power based on your feelings is somewhat divine, to be sure. Could you explain that again in layman's terms? Well, is there something particularly you'd like to know about? Ask me anything you like. I might make it easier to explain. Let's see. Why do some attack and why some don't? Good question. That is because can Gary reflect their master's heart? Huh? It describes in ancient mystical texts. And Gari are like mirrors. And Mugari transform based on the feelings of their partners. A pure-minded master leads to clarity, while instability causes complications. Your monster evolution represents your own eternal state. Our eternal state. So Agamon is a reflection of how I feel. Maybe I should take this chance to ask something too. I'm curious about one thing you said, how our feelings transform them. Agumon reflects my feelings, then what does the professor think of him? What about Agumon? Agumon did transform that one time, so that reflected my inner state. How does Agumon seem to you, professor? It would be wrong to say anything unfounded, but based on my impression alone, I feel that he is still in a develop developmental stage. So he's still developing. He may have some latent abilities that have yet to emerge. Yes, I can feel it. All the staring is kinda creepy, guys. <laughs> Sorry, Agumon. He's still not fully developed, so if I grow on the inside, he might transform too. Should a Kenamgari be mishandled? Their master will ultimately pay the price. The interstate of the human they protect 
their partner. This is what determines the fate of each Kenamgari and human pair. So my inner state determines Agron's future. But why are we bound together like this in the first place? I'm sorry, but that question I cannot answer. Okay. There must be a reason why we all ended up at the shrine, right? Most likely, yes. It doesn't explain everything, however. That doesn't explain everything, however. Miyuki, Haru. Professor staring at Miyuki and Haru. Is something wrong with them? No. Phew. So going to the shrine wasn't all my fault. Right. You didn't cause this, Miyuki. Yeah! If instability makes them change, that means what I did to Falcomon. Are you okay, Minoru? Takuma, I think... You wanna go search for Falcomon? Yeah, I said some pretty mean stuff. According to the professor, Kenamgari attacking humans is their partner's fault. So all my negative feelings and words change him to for the worse. That means if he evolves into something bad, it mean it is because of my own issues. He didn't do anything wrong, but he had to put up with my Kiroldi. I was scared of him, but he kept helping me anyway. Can I ever face him again? Just thinking that my problems could make him turn into something bad. It makes me sick. I don't think it's too late. You can still make up with Falkmon. Falkmon will be happy. I'll help too. Me too. Me too. Let's go. I'll go look for Falkmon. Thanks, guys. I'm coming, Falkmon. Exploration! Rune apartments unlocked. Residential rooms unlocked. Far rooms unlocked. Certain room unlocked. Complex far side unlocked. Jesus Christ. Free battle unlocked! That is a lot of searching. Jesus Christ. Let's just slowly go through all the areas. It's Miu, should I talk to her? Yes, talk to Miu. Big bandage! Bandanos! Have you thought of any way to get Minoru and Falcon back together? Besides doubling down on effort for pers uh, persuade them, no thing. Falcomon's been through a lot of pain. I can't imagine he'll just snap right back. I agree, I'm not good with this kind of stuff. Saying I don't like that or stop, I'm sorry or forgive me. It's hard to believe in that sort of thing or to get people to believe in it. You, she got a far away look in her eyes. I wonder if she's thinking of something. Should I even ask? I get the feeling I'll make her cry if I respond poorly. Believing is hard, isn't it? It's hard to believe, yeah. No telling what really what real intentions lie behind someone's words. There's a possibility you can't accept their words at face value. Yeah, some people apologize after the fact even though they are not sorry, uh, not sorry at all. Human relationships are stupid. <laughs> We're not all human out here, you know. We've got personalities of our own too, so what's the difference? I mean, you, I might not need to tell you at this point. I'll always tell you exactly what's on my mind, okay? Did you get the chocolate milk they've redeemed? Yeah, look, I just... Like... Chocolate milk glass. That's right, we're best buddies to the end. Okay, Shakamon, let's take a look inside those bushes next. Don't go too far. There's no guarantee or we are alone out here. Got it. Come on, Shakamon. We should go to Agamon. Yeah, be safe, you two. You does a lot better when her brother is not heaving behind her neck. Oh, come on, you don't go off, go off running off ahead. Yikes. What? Jeez, don't yelp like that all of a sudden. Ooh. Is this gonna lead to a Mew evolution? Bad guys, Minis, those jerks again! Place like this, stay back, Mew! Ooh, this is gonna lead to an ultimate evolution for Mew. 
I think. Maybe. Oh. I guess I was wrong. Bring Flora and Shakamun dies. Shakamun. Never mind. Things happen in front of me and I forget. Yeah, sure, as cute like I've ever been that. Do I go for that chest there? I think I am gonna go for the chest. Can I hit that from here? No. And turn. Move. Attack. Poland Rain! Gets. Can't hit it from here. You say so. No! Flora Moon died. How could you do that to Flora Moon? Speed charge obtained. Okay. He got this. Crystal, Alacrity Crystal. Woohoo, we did it! You alright, Mew? You? you know it, no one can stand up to a pair like us. Man, Kaito's such a dummy, isn't he? How could he be such a meanie when he's got an awesome critter like you guys with him? If he has time to care about me, he should give half of that care to Drachmon. Seriously? He's helpful and decisive, but it waste, it's wasted on his personality. <laughs> you said it. I'm glad I got you, Shakamon. It's so great that we can talk like this. Oh, for sure. I feel the same way. Your gears are always turning, so you're fun to talk to. Let's keep talking about all kinds of things. Ghost stories, urban legends, you name it. Oh boy. Don't you have any cuter things to talk about? <laughs> is there any difference to talking to her again? Takma, here it is for you. Attack break plus. Let's pick this up. Some enemies came through before. One of them dropped this. Wait, what? Are you okay? I'm great. Shakamon cleaned their clocks good. Oh yeah? Good to hear. Oh, but don't tell Kaido that part. I don't even want him thinking about what he say. You got it. Still you too. Hmm? Is it just me or are you guys on a better wavelength than ever? Oh yeah. Level up our buddy rank again. Yep. 
hope Falcomon and Minoru can meet each other halfway soon. We wouldn't have to worry if they talked and became buddies, so good, right? That's a simple way to put it. Still, I get what you're trying to say. I can say I can say I trust Agumon and that connection helps keep me calm. Wanna follow my buddies in religion? Can promise to find protection, but it's still fun. <laughs> when the heck did you have time to found a religion? <laughs> This is why I like games like this, right? It just gives me all the time in the world. There's Kaido, should I talk to him? Dave, I just drank 30 minutes ago, chocolate milk. I don't have that much milk left. Baka. Hey, we got all in the seasoning, chapter three. I learned that humans have things they can and can't eat, seeing as how this child can eat her fill back in her world. I want to give her a chance to do so if I can. And so I set off with the girl to look for food even humans could eat. Oh, I found something good. Here, try this. Uh, what's this, your holiness? It's green and round vegetable, maybe? I've never seen this before. Here, first you. Hmm. Split like this, then eat it. Oh, this one's nice and ripe. Here, try a bite. Don't, don't, blah, so nasty. Really? It's no good? Yuck, so sore. My tongue's on fire. Ooh, gross, you think? Can't get enough of this flavor. Okay, on to the next one. How about this? Hmm, this thin orange thing. I think I've seen it before. You can make some rare medicine out of it. Is that right? We just up and eat it. Carrot, like this. Munch, munch, crunch, crunch. Hmm, the chewiness, the faint bitterness. So good. Okay, down the hatchet. Your holiness, it's so bitter. Oh dear. I guess it doesn't suit you. Just spit it out. Pfft. My mouth is all itchy. Hey, there's no poison in this, is there? Ah, I see. Some of the stuff we eat might be poisonous to humans. I'm just glad none of what we... of what she ate had bad effect on her. If we're not careful, we might put her life in danger. I'm sorry, your holiness. You're trying so hard to get food for me and I... Don't sweat it. If I learn what you can and can't eat, that way I won't feed you something bad by accident. Well, you got sure a generous bunch. Oh, hey, the leafy parts aren't bitter, chomp chomp. Hmm, pretty sweet, actually. We don't eat that part. Still, if this child likes it, I'll feed her all the leaves she wants. Hmm, hey, your holiness, what's that over there? The girl sets eyes on the most dangerous thing we know. Hold on. Can't you see the fog over there? It's really dangerous, the fog. What's so dangerous about it? Well, if you touch it, it'll mess with your head. They say you get swallowed up by the fog, never return. i never actually seen this fall fate befall anyone. Still, if it's even possible, I can't put this child in harm's way. You say so. I'll be careful, your holiness. All right. What are that white... What are that white stone over there? Those are just brackish rocks. They don't fill your belly or provide any nutrition. Totally useless. I think I've seen it before. Just a second. Hey, don't go off on your own. Like, I knew it. It's salt. Salt? We don't make kids in my village, but it adds flavor to anything. I'd never seen such an exciting look on her face before. Somehow, just looking at it got me all excited. Baka, he wants you to drown in milk. Why, if he apologized, he wouldn't even lie. He would rock broccoli. Why does SP need to apologize to me? In about an hour or so, I need to pause the recording so that I can make some dinner.
Yeah, I don't apologize. Well, maybe you should, but that's not why I- Nah, never mind. Who cares? Uh, let's see. Let's see what else we have. Flame bur burst flame. These are just actual attacks, aren't they? It's pretty nice. Takes heal, restores HP, slightly restores HP, aura. Got more learning crystals. Two potency crystals, stamina. Speed up, taunt. Hmm, interesting. Um. I think changing this one to not speed break. But to acceleration charge is probably better for more movement. Uh, you stamina and potency. Vexing ages and stamina. Oh yeah, I know why, because Lopmon died. Of course. Um, I think I'm gonna lower your defense so that you level up a little bit faster. Okay, let's talk to Kaito. Stay alert, yo. Can't let our guards down here. If that's what my fated partner wants, then I guess I got him. You're exaggerating. Enough with all the fate crap. I thought this for a while, Kaido. Aren't you a bit hard with your words? Takuma. It looks like you're taking advantage of the Drachmon's temper or lack of thereof. Can't say it sits well with me when I see it. We've got our own way of doing things, pal. You may be right, but it just makes Drachmon sad. Should I keep going here? I could tell Kaido to ease up when he talks to Dragon. Maybe I should back off, leave this to the two of them. Ask Dragon himself. Dragon, if it hurts, then you should say something. This is between you two. So go better if it came from you, my my feelings. Open my eyes, man. I'm gonna talk with Kaido mano a mano. Sounds like a plan. Let's get out of here, Agumon. Yeah. So, what do you want to talk about? Do you think you're being... Don't you think you're being too soft on me? Excuse me? Who's being soft? You did the same thing Minoru did. Worse, actually. Since you ain't shown no remorse. You're trying to pick a fight? You bet I am. You're making it easy as pie. If you think I'm sticking to you because of fate or whatever, it couldn't be more worse. Wrong, I should say. You're saying you're gonna sell us down the river? Don't think you'll get away clean. It might just turn out that way. I ain't in no mood to take this guff for another second. Fine by me. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Why don't you? Shit, Drachmon behind you. Don't gotta tell me. Fine, truce for now. That's my line. Get your ass in gear. Weak. Can't believe you actually apologized.
Got the message loud and clear, babe. Don't worry. Honey, I'll cook some macaroni and cheese for you. I don't get it. Dave, why are you weird? What are you talking about? Dave, you're confusing. Gotta see it to believe it. Yeah, I'm sorry for not being sorry. That does that's not how Askew, that's not how this works. <laughs> I'm sorry for not being sorry. You can't be sorry for not being sorry. SQ logic is flawed. Cannot let that go by just like that. Does that mean Dave likes being screamed at? taken care of. Weren't that many to begin with. I think they were a couple of scouts. Maybe they showed up to stop us from fighting. Stars don't just align like that, man. Anyway, seems like you're back to your old self. That foul mouth on you in ages. Oh me, oh my. I wonder might have been raining on my parade this whole time. Hmm. <laughs> Keep it up. You better not betray me. When it comes to fights, ain't no one a better match for me than your ugly ass. So if you say you ain't gonna be a traitor, I guess I can trust you, maybe. But if you turn on us, you better expect a knuckle sandwich. I do you little... We'll see if I... We'll see if I even feel it. That soft fist of yours, you push over. Oh, I can give you a sample now if you keep on talk up. Ugh, excuse me! In that fight I fell at, man. I really do want to protect you, Kaido. I get it, all the trash you talk is your trying to cope with feelings that freak you out. Sorry I can't always pick up what you're putting down. I'll do better next time. You hot that little push over you? Shut up and give me some skin. <laughs> Just leave SQ and SQ logic alone. No. Wait. He's there and he's here. Oh, that must mean that Kaido's Digimon is gonna evolve. Nag, did you two make up? Just back there, when we exchanged a look that could 
curdle milk, right, Kaido? You ain't learned a damn thing, have you? <laughs> Dragmon sure looks happy. Isn't that great, Takuma? <laughs> sure. Could be I was worried over something that those two consider a minor spat. I'm grateful to you, Takuma. Yeah? And you didn't do anything to help in the end. Nah, man. Things would have gone more complicated without you, for sure. Really? You were the bridge as pair of schmucks needed to meet in the middle. Who's the pair of schmucks? Still, Grakamon's on the money. Our vicious cycle would have gone on and on without you. This jerk's a loud mouth and mind and body, so it's impossible to take him at face value. How do I put it? It's okay to have doubts, but we shouldn't hurt family, right? I lose sight of that somehow. Kaido looks like a new man. He really must have made his peace with the whole thing. So, how are things going with Minoru and Falcomon? We're just about to go after Falcomon again. We'd better talk to him as soon as we can before any enemy show up. Yeah, man, we'll take a little look around and we'll let you know if we spot him. Oh, and take this. I found this during our last poll. All-purpose ointment. It's a pain in his own right. Good freaking luck. Leave to us. We'll get into makeup with Minoru for sure. What about Sama's behavior and logic? That her logic isn't logic at all. What's there left to say? That's a scary look on your face. Did something happen? You get it, don't you? Why me is being all pissy with you? Brush your teeth this, stay warm that. What do you expect babying her like that? Shut up, I don't need you to tell me my own business. Well, you ain't wrong about that. I don't know what's up with you guys. You won't tell me a dang thing after all. I just don't want to see you get all butt hurt when she gives you the cold shoulder. I ain't butt hurt. You want to act tough? Act tough. I know a hurt butt when I see one. Hmm. Then let me tell you this much. I ain't buttoning to Mew's business to get her to like me. I want to protect her and that's a fact. Saying you don't care if she can't stand you after all that. I mean, I don't want her to hate me for no reason or nothing. I do whatever it takes for her, even if I gotta play the bad guy. She can say I'm annoying and hate my guts if she gets a peaceful life out of it. Haito, he really does worry about her. Still, I get the feeling his intentions aren't getting through to Mew. Is he really alright with that? If he told her all this, I'm sure she'd get it. Oh, whoa, what the? Takuma, yo, behind you! Damn, it's the enemy. Takuma, get behind us here. Let's do this, Drakmon. Hear you loud and clear. Let's mop the floor with those jokers. Yeah. Drakmon is going into evolution. Also, what the fuck is this wifey talk, Dave? Hey, Drakmon, I thought you said you were gonna mop the floor or something. Jeez, these guys ain't make it uh, easy as they I thought they would think saying sorry is gonna make a difference here damn if only had more power this rate I ain't gonna protect me much less my own skin now what are you gonna do about it freaking what no got the power so you just gotta give up or what that ain't funny even as a joke no way I'm gonna give up I'll protect me and I'll grab hold of any power I can to do that and that's a risky way of thinking. Still, I like your spirit. Kaido, ugh. <sighs> Dragon, wait, don't tell me. If that's... If that's... If that... If your heart's the real deal, those feelings wanting to protect the girl you hold there are the real deal, then I gotta answer in kind. <sighs> He's turning Super Saiyan. My Yoda's Mon! That form, what happened to you? We can talk later. Now let's try that again. Behold, the new power you've grasped, the power of my Yoda's Mon.
All enemies defeated. Start battle. Oh, this thing is fucking fast. Night raid. Night raid. Pummel Puck. Track mom, you evolved in response to Kaido, didn't you? Yes, my Yodis mom, that is my new name. His desire to protect Mew caused me to reach this new stage. My desire to protect her. Yes, from the bottom of your heart and towards that end, you saw power. You, your wish is so pure and unclouded a raw desire for power to protect and to live. That genuine longing transformed into genuine power, provoking my evolution. I get it. Got my hands on power stronger than I've ever had. Indeed. But a word of warning. Use them properly and my power will surely rebound back onto you. Do not forget that true desire in your heart. Heck, I'm gonna forget that for. What I want is simple, to protect me. That's the long and short of it. Hm. Very well then. So watch over the path you tread going forward. And I'll bring that power of yours to bear. You best do your job to the letter though. Great, a slave driver. <laughs> this should be interesting. Aito's acting pretty high and mighty, considering this guy evolved for him. Takuma's portraits and name are not shown for this line. Wait, what? <laughs> what the heck was that? Was that some developer note? Jeez Louise, yo. SQ is dead. <clears throat> There's something here, I can feel it. That shadow, do you kill it? Sure. Let's do something about that shadow. Ooh, Renamon. Even QB Mom and Leo Mom. That's kind of a nice setup, though. Power. So in this game, you have to be a bad tamer to get the bad Digimon. No, that's not how it works.
honestly don't even know if you can get Skull Greymon in this game. Yeah, see, you can these two down here are Giga Dramon and I don't know what the Trihorn dude was called anymore. Let's go talk to Saki and Floramon. Where's Saki? Should I say something to her? All in due time, all in due time. What's this? Bandage. Uh, honestly, I do not know. car only has three wheels. Yeah, is that unusual? Never seen one, at least. Maybe models like this were more common in the past. Hey, Saki. Did you find anything? Eh! Oh, don't scare me like that. Did I take you by surprise? Heck yeah, you did. You think I'd react if someone snuck up on me like that? Sorry, sorry. Didn't think you'd get so scared. Of course I would! Something could kill me in the blink of an eye here. That is gonna happen, Saki. I'm here to protect you. If you say that... Hey, don't tell me you're still scared of me, are you? Yeah, sorry. I'm honestly still scared. I mean... You have enough strength in that little body to kill a man. Saki... Saki's anxiety and her cold treatment to Florimon both stem from her fear. Still, if she can overcome that fear... And maybe they can open up to each other again. Towards that end, I should be Saki, or maybe persuade. What can I say? Saki always acts on feeling. Maybe I should appeal to that instead of using logic. Thormund's power is there to protect you, not hurt you. You shouldn't have to fear it, should you? What scares me, scares me. If a knife was sitting here, you'd be scared of it, wouldn't you? It's the same principle. It's not about logic, you can't help what you're scared of. I get what you're saying, but... Thormund... Oh, wrong answer, I guess. Thormund, I'm really sorry for being so scared of you for... When I saw that, I wasn't sure whether I could still trust you or not. I mean, Lupmon used to be so cute. How did that happen? I'm not sure. But I could tell the voice in his heart has gone really quiet. It's hard to put it into words. It's something that we just understand naturally. But unless we and our partners both trust each other, our hearts, they die. Your hearts die? I'm so sorry, Florimon. I can't believe I almost killed you. Saki, why are you still shaken up? 
course I am. I mean, you'll die, won't you? Just because I don't want to die, I have to kill you, Florimon? That's just wrong. See, Saki's not just scared of her self dying. She doesn't want any of her friends to die either. I think she lets some of the tension out of her shoulders. You're right. Come on, Agma, let's go. I think those two need us to make up now. I really don't get it, but I hate the idea of saying goodbye so suddenly. Because I don't want to label someone bad when I don't know anything about them. More than anything, I can't stand the idea of others disappearing because of me. <laughs> Jeez, tell me something you can stand. Still, all those things seemed like real possibilities. I don't know what to do. Don't worry. None of those things will come to pass. There's always a chance I'll hurt you, Saki. But I'll do everything I can to prevent that. Formal. Huh? I guess Takuma and Agmu left. Yikes, Formal, we got enemies. Hide behind me, Saki. Thing that I wanted to do. Well, what's done is done. Giga Destroyer. Evolution, evolution. Oh, I didn't even realize there was a chest there. Do we pick it up? Yeah, sure. Mature Enlightenment Slab. We should be safe now, thanks to you telling me the enemy is approaching. But I didn't do anything, I just noticed them coming, so I told you. Thank goodness. Your power really does scare me, Florimon. If you ever turned it on me, I'd be dead. Still, I don't think you would do that to me, probably. After all, you just protected me all on your own. I can't change the fact that I have a scary power. All I can do is promise that I'll never turn this power on you, Saki. I can only ask you to trust me. So if you do, I'm super happy about it. Thanks, Saki. Takuma, sorry to worry you back there. It's nothing to apologize for, I totally get why you were scared. You say that, but you don't seem all that scared to me. Oh, you think? <laughs> nothing wrong with that, right? If you get caught up in your fear, you can't even think. My fear prevented me from thinking about how I was hurting Formal. It's fine, water under the bridge. I'm glad you feel that way, Formal. Keep sticking with me. You know it. Come on, let's shake on it. Whoopsie, I forgot I still had this. I know, I'll give it to you, Takuma. Guard break plus. Bet. I'm busy enough as it is holding on to Saki here. 
<laughs> what a little weirdo. Moon's gone lighter. I'm glad to see those two have chilled out. Fitting moments to chill out. There's Aoi. Should I say something to her? I'm telling you, you worry too much, Aoi. I don't want to see you like that. Yes, I know. Still, I can't help but think. What am I giving back to you, Labramu? You do practically everything for me and fights during conversations, but you're still worried about that stuff. I'm sorry. I try not to think about it, but that just makes me think even harder. Are you sure you're not just putting up with me? You suffer through so much for my sake. You're overthinking this, Aoi. She really, she's really all caught up on this. I get the feeling all this mental strain won't be good for her. What can I do to get Aoi to relax? Maybe Labyrinth can lend me a hand. Aoi, what do you think Labramon would like you to do? What she'd like me to do? Yeah, you said that you thought she might be putting up with you. Labramon herself is saying you're overthinking things, right? Yeah, I'm not putting up with anything. I'm not lying for your sake either. Since the day we met, I haven't hid a single thing from you, Aoi. I'm happy you can depend on me from the bottom of my heart. Can't you see that? You know, Aoi, Minoru changed after he mustered up some courage. He did. Minoru gave in to his anxiety and ended up saying some awful things, but he regrets it and is trying to start over, to restore their bond through trust. Through trust. You should believe in Labramon a little more. <laughs> I'll think about it. Sure, go for it. In the meantime, I'd better get going. We have to look for Falcomon after all. Bye-bye, Aoi. Later, Labramon. Yeah, see you two later. I think Takuma's right, Aoi. I wish you'd trust what I say. I don't tell lies or misrepresent myself for your sake. My wish is to fight by your side. I want to get you back to your world. Labramon. Wait, this feeling. Enemies. Oh no. Are there enemies nearby? That's the Takuma and Agumon left. Don't worry, I'll protect you all by myself. You'll see. I'm really doing my best here for your sake, Aoi. I'll get you to see that for yourself. Grandorok. Dog of Fire.
Smack that on the floor, smack that, give me some more, smack that till you get sold to me. attack from here. Oh, oops. Wrong side. No crit. Sad face. Destruction grenade. Anti-confusion crystal, anti-sealing crystal. Lapramon, thank goodness you won. See, just like I said, I protected you and all by my lonesome. I don't tell lies, Aoi. So go on, believe in what I say. Yeah. Yes, that's really true, isn't it? You always speak so kindly to me. And you fit me so well. I wasn't sure I could really trust in that. The truth is, the one I couldn't trust was myself. Howie, I'll change too. I want to treat myself the way you treat me. I hope you stick by my side, Labramon. Yeah, of course. Talk to Aoi again. Takuma, I'm sorry about before. Ah, I guess I should say thanks for the advice instead. So, did you make up with Labramon? I did. It's like nothing happened in the first place. All the more reason I'm worried about the others now. My words got stuck in my throat and I couldn't help mediate the situation. But from now on, I'll try to stop any fights that start in front of me. As long as you don't overdo it, then by all means, I'll be there to help too. <laughs> Alright, I meant to give this to you. Clean dressing. Found it while looking for Falcon Moon. Oh, he here found it, not me. No mean feet, don't you think? <laughs> You're right about that. I'll put it to good use. Oh, it's Minoru. Maybe I should say something. No, never say something. First, explode. Even talk to the old man. Okay, now we need to talk to Minoru. Minoru, over there. There he is, Falcomum. What do you want now? I came to apologize to you, man how unstable hearts can have negative impact on your evolution. So if you ever attack me like I feared, that's just be my fault. You ain't done a damn thing wrong, so... You truly act on your own convenience. Sorry, can't make any excuses. Still, I hate the idea of you turning bad because of me. Well, he's not saying this in the spur of the moment. It's how he really feels. And you find it hard to forgive him? I cannot return. What do you mean by that? Farewell. Hold up, Falcomon. He didn't say he won't return. He said he can't. What did he mean by that? Hey, Professor, you found anything? Here? Ah, yes, here. What are you saying, Professor? We can't hear you if you mumble like that. Oh, sorry, don't mind me. It's nothing for you to concern yourself over. It was some time ago, so my memory is fuzzy. Even so, this is the place. What's with you? Come back to Earth, please. 
My apologies, I'm simply absorbed in my own concerns. Would you give me a moment alone? I need to put my thoughts in order. Got it. Concerned myself, but if that's what he wants, I should leave him be. Does he appear? Ooh, he actually appeared there. It does mean that both ways should be fine, right? Let's talk to Falk Woman now. You two again. I believe I expressed my intention loud and clear. I won't go back. But you didn't say that, did you? You said you can't come back. I simply misspoke. Something going on. If so, we can talk it through and... No need. Turn to your other comrades. Just talk to me here. If you refuse to withdraw, then I shall take my leave myself. Welcome home. Guess an apology is enough for him to forgive me. Hey, Minoru, it doesn't sound like he's actually mad at you or anything. Really? But then why? Oh, crap. The reason you can't tell us, huh? Can't think of anything. Machindramon. Machindramon is dope, let's be real. Okay, obviously Cedramon to Mega Cedramon. This is all for later, by the way. Varo Durumon, Phoenix Mon. Still low level, though, but it's better than nothing. Let's see, where to next? Near the woods. Let's go talk to uh, Kaito and... Right, I'm off. Mr. Lending Strip Dave, thank you very much for chilling, my dudes. Hope to see you later. Shota is trending on Twitter, uh-oh. Kaito and the professor, maybe I should talk to them. Talk to Kaito. Man, it'd be way better for everyone if those two just buried the hatchet already. Here you of all people saying that. Talk to the professor. Miyuki, Haru. Oh, Miyuki. The fog's clearing up. The fog in my mind. Not here, not here. The big building. Akuma, the professor is talking to himself again, yeah. I know he said he wanted some time, but... Okay, he's really starting to worry me. Maybe I should say something. From what he said before, the professor may not want to talk till he sorts it himself out. Maybe I should ask what he's mumbling about. I'm curious about it. Ask about that at least. I want to know he's doing okay. Okay, this is not... this is, uh... You're still on later, I'll be back, just pop into the shop. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Are you worried about Professor? Uh, no, it's nothing, my apologies. 
It doesn't look like nothing to me. Please tell us if something's bothering you. I want to know what you're worried about. Hmm. Still bothering you all with... Uh, hypothesis of mine goes against my creed. Please wait a little longer. Perhaps I'll learn something more soon. Something, he says. Takuma, may I ask you one thing? What is it? Miyuk and Haru. Just what are they? Ah, no, forget I said anything. What? You're stopping there? This topic is too uncertain. There is no basis in my unreliable memories alone. Your memories? Truly do not wish to worry you. Speaking with such ambiguity would only sow confusion. Allow me to talk once I've come to a solid conclusion. I apologize for worrying you. Oh no, in the end I missed my chance to ask why he was acting so weird. <sighs> a certain room. Agamon. I'd say we searched this corner of the apartment complex, top to bottom. We didn't spot anything that looked like enemy base, huh? Yeah. Oh, well, but there's still the other building to investigate, right? That reminds me, the professor mentioned something about that other building. Something tells me I should check it out. You coming with, Agamon? Of course! Let's go, let's go! I bet it'll be fun to compare this building to the other one. <laughs> I swear, I've seen this apartment complex before. Fucking my head is clearing up. Do I remember this place? Who's there? Garuru mod. Whoops, looks like you caught me. I thought the humans were all children. Didn't expect an adult among them. Bad break for you to come across my path, you. Hmm? Wait, it's you! You, yes, I do remember you. All the rotten luck. Still, this isn't the time for me to kill you. I'll curse those children before that one makes things worse. First. I'll disavow uh, those fools who obtain fake strength through bonds. Stop it, you can't mean to lay hands on those creatures. I am no obligation to wait. Don't worry, I'll be coming to crush you soon. Please wait. You'll be the one waiting, Professor. What? Aru, it's dangerous, get back! That monster's long gone already. Ah, this is bad. He must have gone off to attack all the kids. I cannot let that happen. I'm going after him. Sorry, Professor, but my matters, matter comes first. What? What in the world are you? Mew is hanging out with Minoru. Should I join them? Falkamon, I beg you, hear me out. I will not. Enough of your self-indulgence. I shall depart. Expect no quarter from me if you if I see you again. That's a bit extreme, man. Farewell. All that Falcomon. Well, when did you get behind me? Don't run. You need to hear us out. You don't really hate Minera, do you, Falcomon? There must be something you can talk about, so you're just trying to run away, right? Do not pressure me to tell to know my feelings. Do not pressure... Do not presume... I can't read for shit. Do not presume to know my feelings, Pokemon. How lackadaisical can you all be? I do not hate him. What a feck jest. He heaped verbal abuse upon me. He ignored my heart. He used me for whatever he wanted. How dare you get it? Takumon, I can let him through. I haven't had a chance to have a proper talk with him. It's okay. I saw how he acted, so I thought he didn't hate me. I thought Falcomon still held some compassion for me. But I was wrong, wasn't I? So I gotta admit that. There's nothing to talk about. If you understand, then I shall depart. Goodbye, Minoru. Falcomon, his voice was shaking. Minoru, you can't give up. 
I can't tell heads from tails anymore. Of course I want him to come back. That won't change. I really want to apologize to him. But if he hates me, I just force him to hear my apology. That's not right. That wouldn't be... F it wouldn't be for Falcomon. I'd just be... To make me feel better. Inner lost all confidence. He thinks that Falcomon hates him now. But that can be true. If he was saying goodbye to a guy he hated, he wouldn't look so hurt. I have to give Minoru some courage to fight his own anxiety. <sighs> have confidence in yourself, Minoru. It's true that you said some awful things to Falcomon, but that's not enough to make him hate you. You open up to people quickly, you might get carried away. But no one can stay mad at you. I'm sure Falcomon loves that part of you, man. Loved. Past tense, right? It's probably not the case anymore. After everything I said. If you're going to give up, might as well try everything you can first. But it's still too early to give up, I'm sure of it. Okay, I'll try harder. I won't give up, and I'll go f go after Falcomon. Sounds good, you can do it, man. Yeah. Minoru's with Saki, should I talk to them? Doesn't really look like Saki is with them when she's looking the other way. Wait up, Falcomon. You are incorrigible, I think that's what it says, right? Say what? Dang it, I'm gonna chase that featherhead down until he hears me out. That's why I called you incorrigible, incorrigible. Now I'm being a pain after putting you in such a crappy position. That's why I can't just let you off with so long, not like this. You must have a reason that you can't come back, right, Minoru? The reason, the reason I cannot return. I cannot tell you, be silent and get out of my sight. That Falcomon looked like he was worried about something. I don't trust myself here, if I say something messed up, Give it to me straight. I think you're right on the money when it comes to Falcomon's feelings. From his attitude, I don't think he's keeping his distance because he hates me. Yeah, I think it's also something else. Me too, Falcomon looked like he was holding back. I think so too. I knew it. If it turns out he really can't stand me, then I'll back off for real. But if that ain't the case, I can't let things end like this. I'll draw it out to him. The secret reason he cannot talk about. Even if he want... Even if he wants to, something like that, and English. The big building the professor mentioned was this building. Parents wise, nothing changed since we explored before. Agumon, you sense any Kenemogami? Hmm, I don't know. When I sense something bad, it's usually really strong. But sometimes enemies appear when I didn't sense anything at all. Guess his senses aren't on point every time. Gotcha, thanks Agumon. It's unsettling not knowing what will pop out, not to mention how old this place is. Who knows why the professor was so interested in this building? Maybe there are some clues about our enemy, or this world. Or how to get home. It's no time to be a scaredy cat. <laughs> I gotta be brave to make sure we don't lose anyone else. Let's go Agumon, and be ready for the enemy to appear at any moment. Yeah. I hope we find something useful. There you are, Falcomon. What do you want now? Well, um, hear me out just one more time. I haven't apologized properly yet. I'm sorry for being so mean. I was suspicious over nothing, I'm sorry. I can't apologize or fix my mistakes if you're not here by my side. I know I'm just rambling. Please come back. No. Are you still angry? No, it's not that. I just can't stand being around you anymore. Because I'm not dependable? What makes you say that? The only difference between me and the others who still have their Kamonogami is that I'm weak. Everyone else thinks for themselves and decides what to do. 
But I'm a careless coward. I don't have the pool waters do. I'm scared. What if my decision leads to something bad and everyone gets mad or fed up? Thinking about that makes me too scared to decide anything on my own. But what if I trust you and something bad happens? Worst case scenario, everyone dies. The thought of dying like Shuji and Ryo is bad enough. But if you turned evil because of my issues, then you kill other people too. That just terrifies me. That makes it hard to trust you. I don't want to be like that anymore. I want to protect you from now on. No more doubt, no more suspicion. So please, Falcomoon. No, I still refuse. Why? Look, I want to be with you. If it were only your fault, I would have come back by now. But I cannot be at your side. This is my problem, not yours. Tell me why. Why is it not my fault? What's holding you up? I cannot tell you, Minoru. I am sorry. You really trusted me to the end, though. Thank you. I will not forget this. The hell? Why can't you tell me? Are you trying to act like this? It's not my fault to make me feel better? I have to change myself so you'll come back. I've got to become stronger. seem like it's changed much at all. It's as dusty as ever. Look, toys! Must have been some human children in here. Yeah, books too, and an old TV, and... Whoa, what's this? What did you find, Takuma? It's an old photo of Miyuki and Haru? What is it doing here? You think it's their house? Their old house? Their house? This old place, their house, that's what it said, did not... <laughs> that can't be right. What the heck is doing on here? Agum, someone's coming. We have to hide, quick. What? Where? Uh, under this table. No, in the back room, this way. Welcome, Professor. How's your head? All better? It's cleared up a bit, but I feel so confused. Simply have to know, what are you? Unless my memory fails me, you shouldn't be here right now. How can this really be you? I'm sure you've developed the theory about that, no? And it shouldn't be here right now. Doesn't the same go for you? Uh, Arisa, okay, wait, wait, listen, guys. This is my theory, real quick. Before I say anything else, before they spoil it, this is my theory. The professor is Haru, and Haru is Renamon. Would make sense, right? Because Haru went back. Haru got teleported back in time. Or back in time, back to her his own world. And Miyuki stayed. All that time in here. At least that's what I think. And that's why... Miyuki has been without a partner, and Haru has been without a partner, because... Renamon is Haru. Okay, enough. We'll get the answer right here, right now. Haru sounds more mature somehow. Like, he's talking to an equal. But what are they talking about? What do they mean that they shouldn't be here? It's not like I came here by choice. I will protect Miyuki, so long as I remain in this world. You have nothing to fear. As for you, Professor, we don't need you. You should go back where you came from, the sooner the better. And if you let any harm come her way, I won't hold back, I promise. That's all I wanted to say. I'll be leaving now. Wait! Rawr. What was that, monsters? Crap, I have to protect Miyuki. Uh. They both ran off. Let's go, Takuma. Yeah, after them. Okay, I kind of hope that they would tell us at this moment. Takuma, over here. Miyuki, are you okay? Miyuki's been caught by an enemy. Still, she doesn't seem scared at all. Garurumu, let her go. 
It's your fault for being so careless. Leaving a defenseless girl all alone when you're surrounded by enemies? Miyuki, what the hell do you think you're doing? Let her go. Huh? What are you doing here? Good! Very, very good! Another one is ours! Uh, not you. I'm not in the mood today. Not in the mood? Whatever do you mean? Aren't they on the same side? Something's weird's going on here. You need to stop dwaddling and capture those children. And you need to stop being so arrogant. Whatever. It's not like I have a choice. Anyway, I've been wanting to teach you all a lesson. Bring it on, kitties. Here he comes. Get ready, Agumon. I'm on the Takuma. I'll protect you. Room on all annihilated. Start battle. All annihilated? I'm all fucking on my own, mate. <laughs> ah. Okay. I also need to remember that I'm still playing on hard. Waiting for this. Kaito and Dragmon, awesome, thanks for coming. You should have seen his face when he heard the sound of battle. He was worried sick. Do you really need to bring that up? Don't make me kick your butt, Dragmon. <laughs> like to see you try. Okay, I was about to say we better not have to do this all on our own, mate. God destroyer! And turn. Drachmon, I have Lucian. I got double the amount of uh, SP that Drachmon has. Super hilarious. Electric stun. Another one, and another one. Takuma, you should have told me there was fighting. Ugh. Sorry, I didn't have time to tell you. Oh well, we'll work extra hard to make up for coming late. Good luck, Floramon. I'll be cheering you on. Thousand critical hits, Jesus Christ. I might actually kill Flora Mom before she gets a turn. Oh no, we're fine. Unless they crit. Or stun walk. Either one kinda sucks, so uh rather they don't. Help them off, Agumon. Yeah, I successfully protected Takuma. The enemies look tough. We'll help them too. Yeah, I don't want to be dead weight. Uh, let's see. Attack charge again. Attack. 
He toss! Toss the poop! Annoying thing is that Shakamon's evolution is kind of gonna get herself or himself ass kicked, but who cares? Pedro Blasted! Ooh, nice. Okay, here comes um, Aoi. Hey, Takumon, everyone. Sorry we're late. It's fine. So you're gonna help fight right too, right? Of course, I'm not scared of fighting anyone. Right, Labramon? Show them what you can do. Can I hit from here? Stand here. Probably can't hit from here either. Night great. Nice and clean. you stand here because you can't finish that. Severus Mom can't finish this though. And can at least hit you. Karumon dies. Wait, dies? This protection nonsense. Water bonds. Enough wasting time. All you do is talk. Let's see some action. I don't want to weaken my fighting force, but so be it. Go! More enemies, but they'll never be enough to stop me. Are we gonna ditch Wolf again? Thinking real quick to myself here, right? It says Garurumon dies. But what if we do not kill Garurumon? What if we fight him or beat him uh, after defeating everyone else? Floramon evolved, like, way, way back already. Floramon turned into Vegemon. is not really a great digivolution if you ask me for uh, Floramon. Dummy, 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 yum, dummy, dummy. 
Dummy dummy. Dummy dummy. Tsuki tsugi de. Dore do ke. Attack charge. Items. Now we can kick Gurmon's ass. Daneyon, Dane, Daneyon. Or not. I'll fight for us too. It's too dangerous, Minoru. Stay back. You can't take risk without Falcomon around. Falcomon, right. I'd still be here if I hadn't given in to my fear and lashed out on him. Fear, yeah. I was afraid. Always so afraid. I was held back by the fear and it stopped me from trusting Falcomon. I'm sorry, Falcomon. I'm the one who should apologize. Falcomon, you're here. You had a change of heart, overcame your fear and decided to trust me. In the end, I was the one who refused to trust. Let us try this again. This time, with trust. Trust on both sides. Falcomon! Here we go. Time for a counterattack. Good. Okay, talk. Boost the stats. Let's do a regular attack so that I don't instantly kill him. See if we can wait another turn. What happens? Okay, there's nothing else that we're killing. Perfect enlightenment schlep. Nope. Miki over here. Got Miyuki back from Garurumon. Damn it. He's still standing. Don't let your guard down. You, why did you do this? Weird. Garurumon is staring at the professor. Hey, where do you think you're going? What's he trying to do? If he messes with us again, I'll really let him have it. Remember this moment. The next time we meet, you die. He got away. If you ran to the west, maybe that's where their hideout is. Looks like there's a factory or something across the forest. That must be it. We know where the enemy is. That's great news, Takuma. Yeah, now we can get into the enemy base. You guys saved my sister, thank you. No biggie. It was the least we could do. We're friends, aren't we? Friends, huh? I feel so stupid, Minoru. I honestly felt so relieved when Falcomon came back. Never really strong at all, and now I regret it. I feel just as embarrassed as you do. I demand that you trust me while failing to even trust myself. You didn't trust yourself? What do you mean? I was terrified, just as you were. I might hurt you the way Mobon hurt Shuji. I might disappear without being able to protect you the way Kunimon did. I did not know what I was or what might happen. And if I stayed at Minoru's side, you might turn into something evil right next to him. Exactly. And so I was too fearful to come back. Is that why you couldn't tell him the reason earlier? Yes. That was the reason. 
If I told him the truth, he would tell me to come back anyway. I had to hide the truth to protect him, that's why I ran off alone. I was terrified deep down inside, just as you were. Pokemon, to be honest, I'm still scared even now. I see it every time I close my eyes, Ryu and Shuji's last moments. What happens when the hands grab you in the fog? What's it like to die? That's all I can think about, and it makes me so scared. I always joke around, but really, I'm just weak, totally weak. But if I want to survive, I gotta stop being such a coward, I know that now. Even if I know I might be wrong, I have to find the courage to step forward and go on. Not being able to fight doesn't mean I can't keep being weak. I trust you, Falcomon, and I want to survive this together with you. So I want you to help me, please, very well. I trust you now and myself too. I will help and protect you as I swore to do when we first met. Falcomon. Yay, they're friends again. Congrats, Minoru. I'm glad you're back on track. Ah, <sighs> right, thanks. I think this calls for a handshake to seal the deal. Go ahead, shake, shake. We shook hands when we made up, didn't we? We sure did, so they should too. Uh, okay. Look forward to working with you again, Minoru. Yeah, me too, Falcomon. <sighs> I'm feeling tired, though. Don't tell me we have to chase them now. No, we're too exhausted. Let's check our equipment and rest. Cool, let's head back then. I was feeling hungry anyway. Yeah, I can't wait to get back. Partners deserve a nice meal every now and then. What do you mean, every now and then? You get mad, I'm joking. It's like everyone's back to normal. Better than before, even. I think so, too. What a relief. Professor, tell us, what is this you hiding from us? I'm tired. That was a tough fight. Everyone else must be tired, too. Hope they can rest well. Glad everyone everyone's back on good terms. That was my biggest concern. But a few things are still bothering me. What's with Haru and the Professor? And Garurumon's attitude, what's going on? I have no idea, but we're definitely getting closer to entering the enemy base. Takuma, you look like something's bothering you again. Yeah, things happen every... <laughs> things about every... I can't read. Yeah, thinking about everything going on makes my head spin. I know I should get some rest, but I don't feel like sleeping. Huh? You're here? Oh, Kaido. You couldn't sleep either, huh? I fell asleep just fine, but when I then I woke up, that's all. And when he woke up, you were gone, so he came looking for you. That's not how it happened. <laughs> Kaito argues more quietly at night. He's more considerate than I thought. If you can't sleep, eat something. And at least lie down. If you're too hot or cold, then add or remove some blankets. What's with the silent act? Hmm. Nothing. I'm just a little surprised. Surprised by what? You're fussing over me so much, I thought you must really be worried. Me? Yeah, right. I'm going on to bed. Tomorrow we head to the enemy base, so get some rest. Alrighty, good night and sweet dreams. Good night to you too, and thanks. Good night. Once we get uh, into uh, free time, I'm gonna turn on some auto battles with everyone every single time while I'll make some dinner. And turn the recording off, by the way. He's right, I shouldn't waste energy thinking. I should get back to bed. My head feels better too now, thanks to him. I feel like I'm gonna sleep well. Part 7. Suddenly the chapters are moving a lot faster than before. I am ready for the report. Arcanimon, what of the Maiden? Wait. Well, you see, Garurumon captured her once. Then he met, with fierce resistance, the Priestess. She has escaped. The enemy revolted against my plan. It's all because Garurumon let her go. Her plan was fall out. That's all that needs to be said. So the one who screwed the strategy up wants to m make it my fault? I had pacified the children, they were easier to hunt. You wasted all that. Enough with the excuses. Ugh. Collecting sacrifices are true calling, we shall see how dangerous they are. Do not lose sight of our priorities. My master seeks the priestess. I care not how it is done, 
bring the priestess to me. Here, I shall not tolerate any another failure. Do you understand me? Ugh. Yes, my liege, absolutely. The priestess shall be brought here. The priestess is gonna get her... Um, no, wait. The priestess is most likely Miyuki, so... <laughs> huh? Oh, you're finally awake. Good morning, Takuma. You're the last one up. Pretty amazing how well you slept in spite of everything. Minoru, <laughs> what? Um, hey, are you still half asleep? You okay? Come on, tell me. How are we doing today? Today we are... The enemy base. Oh. Uh, wrong moral thing. Today we'll go to the enemy base. According to GG Moon, we're searching for someone who knows the border between worlds, and that would have to be the enemy monsters. So we'll go to the factory they use as a base and force it out of them. In other words, this is the day of the final battle. Well, it's a little bit too early for a final battle. Uh, ground beef with wraps and sauce. They went for a walk when they woke up. They are free to do so until breakfast. Once we eat, we shall leave. Oh. In that case, we should tell them that Sleepyhead is awake and see how they are. Let's leave him be. We're going to take a look around too. A hearty walk before breakfast. Come on, Takuma. Okay then, see you at breakfast. Reaction! Yeah, it's time to make fucking dinner. Deep woods unlocked. Ooh, that's new new. Is that now? Nah, well, first let's go check it out. A fe Never fear, Minoru's here. Two cookie cutter, but hmm, familiar ain't bad either. Is that Minoru? What's he muttering to himself to? Maybe you'll rue the day you cross paths with Minoru. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Then again, maybe a superhero name would be better. Still can't think of anything that make for a good logo. Mm, Man. Everyone's a critic. Why don't you go blog about it if you're such a hunt? Hey Minoru, we got enemies. Yo, Takuma, did you hear all that? Who cares about that? Look ahead. They're coming right for you. She shot. Oh, jeez. Look out, Minoru Falcomo. You came for me, buddy? Wandering off on your own like a lost lamb. Of course I found you spacing out here. Hey, come on, man. You're making me feel a little sheepish over here. Clearly, this is no time for a spat. Stand beside behind us, Takuma. And you, Minoru, stand somewhere safe. Okay, come on, Minoru, let's back off. But, but, Falcomo's fighting. I can't be the only one out of harm's way. I mean, Hero would never do something so lame, would he? Minoru, didn't say anything. And anyway, I may be able to do. may not be able to do anything, but I can't just stand back and watch. <laughs> then do as you please. Here they come. Whew. Ah, talk about strong. Don't overdo. Oh, don't go overboard, Falcomon. I have no choice. No one else here that can fight. Let's hold my ground somehow, even if it looks hopeless. It was more like if I was more like a hero, maybe things wouldn't be like this. Minoru, there's no point in saying superficial crap like a cat phrase. Catchphrase it was more incredible on the inside, where it counts. I could deal with problems. It's not true, Minoru. Heck, it isn't. If I was more useful human being, then... Here's the thought, my boy. You have already begun asserting a strength all your own. Assert what thing? I want to be someone. I want to be strong. Such pure desires. These are feelings that will call strength to you. Call strength to me. And I make you stronger like Takuma did with Agumon? I believe we can do this. I, like Agumon, and you, like Takuma. You and I possess the power to soar. Falcomon? This is our time to shine, Minoru. We are just getting started.
Ah, well now, this will do nicely. Rome on that form, sorry about the wait. Now it's our turn. All annihilated. Start battle. Holy shit, the travel distance is insane. Deals light damage to target with a more chance of reducing their physical than. I should be able to hit from here, right? Savage Emperor! as well. Sag. But he missed. Destruction Gunido! Missed again. Rogmon has insane traveling distance. Incredible, Falkmon's this strong after evolving. Alright, Falkmon, beat them to a pulp, that's my boy. Hold on, you ain't Falkmon, you ain't even a boy. What am I supposed to call you? You can call me Chromon when I look like this. Romon, my bond with you helped guide me to this form. You had it in you all along. The power to take flights, the strength of hearts to soar towards the heavens. The strength of heart. I'm not sure I get it, considering how I was freaking out just a second ago, but I think I've got strong enough to help you change like that. I honestly can't see it. <laughs> well, it isn't as if you lack room to grow. Ah, <laughs> well, yeah, sure, I get that. Still, I believe you've gained something from this predicament. A reason to grow stronger, perhaps. Or some goal that requires power. Some goal, huh? I'm certain that you figure out the type of person you want to be in that crisis. Knowing one's own desire will become the courage to embark towards greater heights. This form is proof of your courage and the start of that journey. Hmm, I think I get it. Thanks for backing me up, Promon. No need to thank me. I believe that you and I shall be as one someday, soaring freely through the ether. Uh, plain English, please? You don't need to understand. What do you mean? <laughs> Soaring freely through the ether, I can see that. Two wings on the same great bird. Back Rogmon is trying to tell Minoru how far they can go if they work together. I had my reservations about those two, but I'm glad to see things worked out. You, why are you so bad with these timings? Can you not be bad with timings? Pretty fucking please. Didn't I like just tell you I was gonna go do free battles on auto while I go toilet break and make food? Yes, that's what I was gonna do as soon as I turn on the auto battle and turn off the recording. So, people on YouTube, I'll BRB. Okay, and we're back. I have my dinner. Now we can do some exploding. First things first, though. There's nobody here, so let's check the woods. No, wrong button. Crisp apple. <clears throat> that shadow. Do we fight it? Do we run? We've been fighting all the time. Let's just run from it. <sighs> huh? What the? Why here of all places? Drachmon? Just Drachmon? Oh, wrong.
Okay, let's talk to Brockman. We got seven moves, so we got fine. Hey, got a second? Dragmon, sure, what's up? It's not a big deal, but I want to ask you to keep an eye on Kaido. On Kaido? You know that my faded child is unusually unruly? And something is on his mind, he never asks for help, he just cracks. He's a real pain in the ass, but he's not a bad kid. I know what you mean. But I guess you and that pain in the ass seem to get along pretty well. Really? Yeah. Which is why if anything happens to me and I was separated from Kaido, let me say that. We're going to finish this thing together safely. Just listen to me. You're my insurance, my plan B, just in case. Rakumo is pretty serious about this, but I don't want to think about bad scenarios. But I should put his mind at ease. Maybe I should tell him how I feel. I know what you want to say, but it has to be you, Dragon. Kaito trusts you on a totally different level than he trusts me. Maybe, but if I can no longer help him, there might come a time when you will have to be there for him in spite of any differences. I'm sorry for talking so much. Here, take this. Meteor fall. I swear this is some kind of bribe. Please, Takuma. Dragon. this? A crisp apple. Oh, wrong button again. <clears throat> Yordi's always pressing the wrong buttons. Takma, I'm getting kind of an odd feeling from this place, really. Doesn't seem all that strange to me. Still, I guess I wouldn't hurt to be careful. Maybe if we had some other way to investigate, we could find out more. Hey, let me try using my camera. Takuma, there, that's it. That's the sort of the weird feeling. Ah, ah what's going on, y'all? Country accent. I'm just passing through, y'all. Leave me be. It's not attacking, not an enemy. It might be friendly if we say the right thing. Hey there. It's dangerous to stay here. The enemy might attack at any moment. And me? What are y'all on about? Who are you all anyways? Ooh, I'm just a human, and I'm supposed to trust a human who just pops out shouting at me? Oh yeah, guess I can't blame you. Forget y'all, I'm seeing myself out. There he goes. That might have gone better if I'd used a different approach. Or, you know, not. Seemed like a fine approach to me. Now then, what to do? A crunchy apple. A crisp apple. Gold and silver. <laughs> Akumon, what are you acting so giggly about? I was thinking back on all the things you told me. You've made me so happy. <laughs> oh jeez. Don't start thanking me all over again. Or are you gonna make me blush? So Takuma, like Falcomon was saying, I don't know what's gonna happen to me. None of us monsters do. But please, no matter what happens, keep believing in me. I don't mean the real me. The idea of me in your mind. Keep that alive. What are you talking about, Akumon? What's he trying to tell me? He wants me to believe in my own version of him? What's my version of Agamon like? Outgoing, supportive, kind? He has many sides. But if I were to choose the one that stands out most... <coughs> dependable. I believe in you, Agamon. Especially in how dependable you are. Dependable, you say? Take the lead and are always doing everything you can to protect me. No, I can depend on you for that. Yeah, I forgot to gift this to you, Takuma. Here you go. 
The perfect enlightenment slab. I'm just go doing my best to keep you safe. And I appreciate that, Agumon. We should be able to find some clues about how to get out of this world soon. Without Agumon having to fight, hopefully. This is it. Laugh or cry, do or die. Is that Mew? Maybe before I talk to her. Bef Maybe I should talk to her before the final battle. What the fuck do you mean? This, we're nowhere near the final battle yet, game. Don't make me sound like it sound all depressed. Do you think our strategy for today will work out today? Okay? Why would you ask that all of a sudden? You were raring to go earlier, like, on to the final boss, stuff like that. It's not that I think our strategy won't work, it's just. It's not the enemies that scare Mew. She's scared her brother might do something crazy. Why is that? You know how he is, right? He doesn't just go into things. He really gets carried away. Like he said he was gonna run ahead to the forest to warm up. I'm afraid when it comes right down to it, he'll mess things up. This time, it's about whether or not Mew can make it back to your world. No wonder her brother is more pumped up than usual, maybe too pumped up. You should go remind him to keep his cool and not get out of control. Who, me? Kaito's definitely liable to do something wild if he thinks it'll help me. But I doubt it'll change anything if I tell him to calm down. That's still better than saying nothing though, right? Or is it? Gotcha. I'll try to have a talk with him at some point. But I can't make any promises. It's all about timing, after all. I'm sure he has his own line of thinking about what he's doing. Okay, that's fine. That works for me. I'm just relieved to know you'll be keeping an eye on him. I'm glad you trust me. But I still feel like I'm being pressured. Gonna talk to Minoru. Minoru is fine. Do we talk to uh, Haru and Sorch? It's Miyuki and Haru. Got a fight coming up. Should I talk to them beforehand? I have been talking to them every single time though. I honestly don't know, should I, this time? I kinda wanna put as much points into Miu and Saki as possible. Oh, we should be fine as well. Oh, it's Saki. Is she exercising? Crap, wrong button. Holy shit, Mew jumped from low to fucking 32? Jesus Christ. Takuma, why are Arakenimon and them guys after us? Why well, think of that now? I was talking to Floramon about it. Don't you think it's weird? Why do they think they have to attack us? If they left us alone, we wouldn't hurt them. She's right. Why are they after us? They must have some clear reason for doing so, though. It's scary to be attacked, and it's not like we want to beat them up for no reason. Could it be Saki doesn't want to know the reason? Maybe she just wants to talk about how she hates being attacked.
Absolutely. Gives them the right to come after us like this, right? It's not like we're out here fighting just for the fun of it, right? That's true. Is that what you think, Tutakuma? <coughs> Might find a reason why they attack us today. That'd be great. It sucks not knowing what's going on. You already picks the right answer right away. Oh, hey, I think that's Mew and Shakomon over there. Oh, but something's not right. Shouldn't use the but Mew seems pretty lost and thoughtful last time we met her. I admit I'm curious. I'm pretty worried. I don't know what I'm going to do when we all go back. Mew, why is that? Because it'll mean I have to say goodbye to you, Shakomon. Then I'll be all alone again. That's not true. You'll have your brother. Right, I'll have Kaido, because he's the only one who have even... Shh, Mew, that's enough. Hey, let me finish. After all, I... Be quiet. There's someone else nearby. Who's there? Show yourself. Oh, I'm nuts. Did they notice me? No, evil has appeared. Oh no, Shakamon! Figured they'd be around. Enough talk. Let's take them down. Just me? But I can't... It's okay, Mew. I promise. I promise I'll protect you. <sighs> the heck? They're so tough. Shakamon. Oh no, we're going to lose. Should I? What can I do? I knew I couldn't... Kaito? No, I can't keep relying on Kaito forever. Still, I need to do something, but what can I do? What can I do? Uh, I feel so frustrated and confused. Don't panic, Miu. You. you gotta keep calm. Shakamon. I'm sorry, you're right. I freak... If I freak out here, I'm just making things harder for you. Just whining won't help us out of a mess like this. I can't stay holed up in my shell. I've got to stand up for myself, look to the future. And if I don't know what to do, I just need to struggle that much harder. Otherwise, I'll be stuck like this forever. Ah! Ooh, ah! Shakamon, what's wrong? Is it happening again? You're gonna change shape again? You, that intense desire to look ahead, even if in the face of pain and struggle, it's swirling inside of me, Mew. I, I'm gonna... <laughs> Shakomon, Digivolve 2! Wait, I thought that Shakomon was a he. From Shalomon into fucking boobed mermaids? Sure. Pirate mermaids, even. You look so different! Whew. You, sorry that took so long. Now it's time for us to strike back. I'm going to give this all I've got. All the enemies defeated. Northern Cross Bomber makes it easier for allies to provide battle backup and increase its effect to ranks. Meteor Wing! Yes, we won! But I am beat, phew! Jakumon, this is you, isn't it? Uh, Mew, alright, you wouldn't know, would you? <laughs> it's a pleasure to meet you again, Mew. My name, my new name is Mermiamon. Mermiamon? That's right. I was able to take this form because how you changed, how I changed. What do you mean? Well, basically, how now you're that much closer to being an adult. Me an adult? Wait, for real? Yes, indeed. That's why I'm here, you see. Have more confidence. But that's true that I'm super happy. Anyway, I'm excited to keep being your friend. Together forever, right? Yeah. Yeah! 
So are you gonna stand there forever, Takuma? Uh, you noticed me? So of course I did, peeping at us from that tree like that. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to sneak, really. Well, I don't mind if it's you, I guess. Still, you're better than not say anything to Kaido. <laughs> Why not? If he knew I fought against such a tough enemy, I'd never hear the end of it. <laughs> oh, you. Professor? Let's see, Saki is still only 20%. I need to pump her up a little bit. Professor? Where are you going? Ah, yes, to the shrine. Okay, Monogami Shrine? Yes, this is a critical moment and I realize I better check something before we leave. For example, Agumon, one of the murals in our world had an image of you. About me? The form and name written there match your information exactly. So, if the names of the other Kenomagami are also written on that wall, it might help us when we face them in battle, yes. But I'm not certain that the wall in our world is the same as in the shrine. And I'm not sure I could even read the marks. Yet, I need to be certain for you and for those Kenomagami. Professor? Ah, thanks. I already had breakfast, so no need to worry about me. I'll be back later, okay. Professor mean the room one when he said those can no Mogami. What should we do, Takuma? Should we join with the others? Yeah, we need to get ready to leave soon too. Let's leave the professor alone for a bit longer. Still got three moves left. <sighs> I didn't actually go to the woods. Yet to check if there was any items. Uh, why in the world all of... feel like I'm gonna get an item from him. Should I take it? Yeah, sure. Let's take the item. Hang on, Takuma. I found something you could use. Gale Storm. Thanks, welcome home. While Minoru is not here, could I speak to you? Hang on. Are things still bad between you and Minoru? It's not that. I trust him completely now. But as I noticed before, Minoru has a weakness. Even when frightened, he tries to fool everyone until he explodes. He pretends everything is okay, but this is hard for him. I'll keep an eye out to make sure he doesn't lose it, but I can't do that alone. Minoru trusts you very deeply. You... you really think so? I can see it. Minoru relies on you. That's why I want you to keep an eye out, too. He trusts you. You can do that. Trust me, really? Would I be able to keep Minoru strong? Okay, but I'm counting on Minoru too. I'll help him out, but there will probably be times when we need to help each other out. Sounds right to me. Minoru can be stubborn, but he's not the type to be mean to someone he trusts. With a little more maturity, I'm sure he'll be a fine human, just like you, Takuma. He will support you in turn as well, I believe that. That's all I came here to say. I'll leave it to you, Takuma. Takuma Deska. Hi, right, Saki. They're getting ready for the final battle. I should talk to them. Hey there, Aoi, Saki. Getting our things ready? Food! Food! Yummy food! Hey, no snacking. I'm not. <laughs> hmm, is this bag low on nuts? All of the sun? Oh, you're right. Maybe someone ate some. Don't look at me. Never said I suspected you. It was me either. Yeah, I can see that. Hmm? Takma, what are you doing there? I was just passing by. Wait, was it you who ate the missing nuts? What? No way! Seems like something you do. Wow! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Don't be so serious. Always joking. I was just teasing. Don't take it the wrong way. Oh. Have the rest of the nuts as an apology. Come on, Takuma, take them. We don't need to add that bag on the pile anyway. 
So it's special, just for you. It look good. Say they were a gift, let me save them for when I need them. Oh, that was kind of disappointing. Now, let's go talk to... Uh... Kaito and Minoru. Oh, Takuma, hi. Don't tell me you're lazying around. Are you ready to leave? Oops, not yet. So you're just out on a walk? Must be nice to have all that spare time. Why are you fooling around now? Can't you take this seriously? If you've got time to wander around, you should finish getting ready. Oof, totally got yelled at. Want to see how everyone is doing. But you have to walk around to do that. Maybe I'm just nervous. Seeing their face is reassuring. Well, I feel better if I talk to them. I hope I'm not leaning on them too much. I'm actually nervous. Before the fighting. I just start walking around. Really? You get nervous too? Don't judge him so harshly. Takuma is a human child too, after all. Just relax. This battle is not that big a deal. We walk to the base, and if the enemy comes at us, we defeat them. Simple, right? Do some stretches, gets the tension out. <laughs> kind of to me than I thought. Thanks everyone, I'll stretch and then start getting ready. That was delicious! Now that we're done with breakfast, it's time to be moving out. You're right. At long last. Is it cool if I bring a banana or something? Are we allowed to have snacks? What are you blabbering about, you baby? I thought we could use some comic relief. Bananas ain't snacks and a battle ain't a field trip. It might be a battle, but we're not meaning to utterly But we're not meaning to utterly defeat them, right? You're right. Of course are we. If we can get the information without fighting. That'd be great, but based on their actions up until now, I think that'll be difficult. We need to be ready if it turns into a fight anyway. No, you're right, sorry. I know we already decided that. This ain't the time for gap fest. Let's get a move on! Yeah, is everybody ready? Yep, yep, the professor's not here. What? Come to think of it, he's not back from the shrine yet. Well, I better go look for him. Can all of you head to the underground waterway? I'll take Agumon and find the professor. We'll meet you there. Got it, we're off. Then hurry up and join us, Takuma! Takuma! Hang on, the professor's not here. Where did he go? La la la... What's that noise, humming? I've heard that tune before somewhere. Hey, Takuma, over there, I see something. There's a hidden path all along, those stairs head down. Were they always there? The professor might be down here. Let's go find out. La la la... Hmm? Oh, it's you. Don't tell me it's time for us to go already. Sorry I'm late. Came into the shrine and found those stairs. I went to look inside. Seems like I lost track of time. These murals on the f this floor, too. Ah, new discovery like this is enough to get any scholar worked up. I'm more It's more abstract than the one upstairs, so it's hard to decipher, too. The professor seems excited. It's like he's both worried and happy at the same time. But why have we never seen those stairs before? We must have missed them somehow. Or maybe someone cleared the way. It would have been recent. There must be been some connection. Don't get lost in thought again, Professor. Right, we just came to get you. But hang on. Professor, did you figure out what you were working on before? Hmm, yes to a good degree, but... It's just the three of us here now. This might be a chance to ask something I couldn't have in front of the others. I still wonder about Haru and that mystery. What was he talking about in the apartment? There was some connection to Garurumon. Why though? Garurumon is our enemy. 
And that humming. Why was he humming Miyuki's song? So many questions. Where should I start? That song you were humming just now, what's it called? You know, I don't actually know myself. What? But you're the one who was humming it! How can you not know what it is? Yes, I know it's from somewhere, but I can't re recall exactly where. Music is said to li be linked with other associated memories in the mind. But only this melody remains in what's left of my old brain. But if you've forgotten it now, then... It must have been years ago when you learned it, yes. You would think so, but it's possible that I didn't just forget it due to my age. What makes you say that? I lost my sister when I was young, oh. I don't mean that she died, but rather that she was spirited away. They tell me I was with her when it happened, but I have no memory of it at all. When something terrible happens, sometimes the mind blocks the memories as a defense. But this is what I think. That tune has something to do with my sister. And it might be a small clue as to how I could recover the memory of her loss. It's less of a theory and more of a desperate hope. Clue to a lost memory. This is no ordinary tune for him. It might be very important. There's more. Haru. Professor, can you tell me what you meant when you spoke with Haru yesterday? With Haru, what do you mean? I'm sorry, I saw the two of you speaking yesterday in the apartment complex. Oh, that. I do want to answer your question, but honestly, I am just as interested in finding out who he is as you are. What do you mean? It would have been many years ago, I can scarcely recall at this point. But there's something about the way he, he appears, I... Professor, what are you talking about? No, no, never mind. It's hard to find the words. It would have been easier when I was younger. I sure do hate getting older. Hmm. Seems like the professor is confused too. He doesn't seem like to be hiding anything. He might simply not know. <clears throat> he is Haru, 100%. He is the Haru that actually got sent back through Portal. Have you met Garumon before? He seemed to be pretty concerned about you yesterday for some reason. You doubt me? You think I'm working with the enemy? No, that's not it at all. I was just wondering. It's fine, Takuma. I'm sorry for being so blunt just now. Believe me, I have no intention of hiding things, or otherwise deceiving you. It's just, my memory is so vague, there is so much I can't be sure of. Can't be sure of, but wasn't it just yesterday? Oh no no, I think I've met Garurumon when I was quite a younger man, I think. What, you met Garurumon when you were a kid? Indeed, among and among my memories, I think he was beside me in my fear. But was Garurumon and me back then too, or was he a friend like Agumon? I wonder, I don't remember a thing, and yet, yes, I'm sure I know him somehow. Rumon certainly seems to remember you. Did you do something that might have made him angry? I don't know. If I could remember, it wouldn't be a problem now, would it? The professor looks pretty upset. He must not remember. I wonder what the heck happened with Garumon. I think I've asked enough for now. Takuma, why don't you show that thing to the professor? That thing? Oh, the photo. Photo? It's something I found back in that room. I grabbed it because it caught my eye. Please tell me your thoughts, Professor. Here it is. This is Miyuki and Haru? No. Oh yes, maybe? Professor, are you okay? I'm sorry. A partial memory surfaced. When the Professor looked at the photo, some memories started coming back. This photo, I see myself as a child and my sister, I think. Say what? I don't know if you will believe me, but Haru looks exactly like me as a boy. And Haru was the nickname my sister called me when we were younger. You mean... Your sister? My sister's name was Miyuki. Yes, I remember now. That room in that apartment complex is where my sister and I grew up. What, seriously? But what does that even mean? What's going on here? I too have absolutely no idea what is happening. I wish I could remember what the memory might signify. I... Why... Who are these people I don't know, and yet, who resemble my sister and me so? Professor, his childhood was a long time ago, the resemblance might be a coincidence. But then, why would Haru want to speak with the professor in the exact room? He's gone all pale. More questions might be too much for him. It's pointless if he doesn't understand, I should let it go for now. Is there something else we can talk about? Let's go back there. 
We should pass the apartment complex as we head west to the factory from here. Let's check it out one more time. It might help you remember something else. Yes, it might indeed. With the right stimulus for my memory, everyone seemed to know Haru, Miyuki, and the Professor. There must be a big secret that involves all three of them. Everyone might be waiting for us. We should hurry. You're right. Can you walk, Professor? Oh, I'm fine. I'm sorry for- uh, sorry my behavior has been disgraceful. If my memories return, I will tell you everything. Alright, please take it easy, Professor. Yeah, the further we go in, the more I'm convinced that the Professor is Haru, and Haru is... Renamon, who is Miyuki's uh, partner Digimon. Hey everybody, sorry it took so long. There you are. Man, that took forever. What gives? And that goes for you too, Professor. Apologies, I lost all track of time. I'm starting to get bad feeling about our chances. Sorry, sorry, but we're all together now. We're off then, into the canal. It's a little scary being back here, but there's no point in whining about it. Are we ready? Let's go kick the crap out of them. Yeah, let's go. The only way out is forward. Kicks in the door. Ow. Don't kick your desk, Yordi. Drachmon, are there enemies here? Not a one, not even the faintest whiff of one. That's good, come on everybody. Thanks for keeping an eye out, Drachmon. You were great work. You were great working so hard. We need to know if the enemy is out there, but maybe the surveillance is too much. We lose nothing with such surveillance. But we cannot relax just because they are not here now. Got it already, especially here. Especially here. We're, n we're near where Shuji died. Try not to dwell on it, Saki. It's just, forgetting what happened doesn't seem like the right thing to do. You're right, it's not like we can pretend it didn't happen. It's natural to feel that way. It's not a bad thing. We couldn't avoid it. Anyway, it would be silly to look for another route. Yes, you're right. Let's keep going. It's fine. We are different today. If the same thing happens again, we won't hesitate. That's true. But still, let's hurry past this place. World map. Waterway unlocked. Seen enemy any enemies yet? It seems safe so far. One more push forward. Can't wait to see some sunshine again. <laughs> yeah. Aoi, did you just laugh? Me? No, I didn't. Was it Saki then? What's there to laugh about? But I certainly heard laughter. What do you seek? For I am here, yes, here. It's behind you! Are we Kenny Mom again? Yow! Where did it come from? You didn't notice, Drachmon? Hang on, there's no way it was in front of us. What magic is it using? My, my, aren't you cruel ganging up on it like that? I could easily slip past your vision if I chose to do so. You understand this, right? Kenny Moon, you finally decided to take us on directly? <laughs> Perfect timing, too. I'd just been thinking of heading your way. Uh, here you were, plodding along, coming to capture me? How foolish in the extreme. For being attacked? As if, get behind me, Mew. Let go of me, Kaido. Hang on, our Kenimon? You said you wanted to capture us. You don't want us dead. You plan to capture and use us in some way. That was perhaps a slip of the tongue, but aren't you clever, little child? Your inexplicable knowledge has continued to befall my plans. That's not our fault. You only have yourself to blame. You attack indiscriminately and then deny responsibility. That is why your plans fail. How very dare you? How very dare you? Well, I've never heard that line before. You think it will be that easy? You're all go about to disappear. Just as the other two disappeared, begging and crying as they went, I don't think so. You seem awfully calm about this. You did take us by surprise, but we are not yours to command. What? What is happening? But this was my last chance. My very last chance. 
Your last chance, it's your fault. My life, my world, I cannot let you escape any longer. For life and world? Is there a reason why our opinion has attacked us? If so, then maybe we can negotiate. We don't have to be friends, but we might be able to avoid battle. Should I try talking? You tell us what you're after. Ma, are you thinking uh, you can negotiate with our Kenimon? Be quiet. When I draw our attention, all of you are going to escape. What? But wasn't it you who said you didn't want to stay here? Our Kenimon is tough. We need to f to fight from a better tactical position. Aren't we past the time for negotiations? I don't know what you're up to, but I have nothing to tell you. Damn, here it comes. Get ready. Definitely could have used a better... Wait. I only had five slots? Shit. Our Kenny Moon defeated. There's a chest all the way here again. Are you fucking kidding me? All the way over there. Okay, I'm gonna have... Let's see if I can fly over there with... I can, I think, actually. I'm allowed to move twice. Sick. Okay, my amount of movement slots is not going to improve with this. So we'll just stay with this for now. You on the other hand are going to able... Thousands, it's not too bad. Critical Sonic Void. Let the talk of fired and turn. Metal Greymon can actually move up twice. Giga Destroyer! Wow, it survived. Cringe. I forgot about him. Evolution. I hope we can still pump up Saki a little bit with Infinity. So that we can get her ultimate. The fact that I can move twice with Chromon is super insane. Nice. 
nightmare of teens. Something seriously wrong with you. I thought children would be easy to handle. How adorable. You thought I was only after you. What? Dokugamon. Ah! Miyuki, look out! I won't allow this. Professor, there's no way you can fight without any weapons. I'll be fine. You can take care of the rest from uh, of the rest of them. Hurry, Takuma. Have to hurry up and defeat our Kenimon to save the Professor Miki. Okay, no more time for diddle daddling. Actually, better to move here. Oh no 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 no. Go back. Move. Savage Emperor, 4% crit chance. Don't know how many turns I have to hurry this up. get these guys to stand in a specific pattern I can do more damage. Okay. Um our Kenimon's actually going in for an attack. It's not a spider threat. Five hundred. Clean. Let's take these guys out while close to them. <clears throat> Give movement boost to Takuma. In turn, talk. Step boost. for as much damage as possible. <laughs> I can OTK! That's what I like to see, bitch! Fuck you, Adukenimon! Victory. Void deals wind damage, low chance of inflicting paralysis. Nightmare, 70 SP. <laughs> what are you? You, are you okay? Yeah, I think so. Thanks to Shakamon. Glad. Now then. Go any further and you will lose. Retreat while you still can. You stop now, we'll spare your life. That's the deal. <laughs> what do you children know? 
How unfortunate for you. You will regret underestimating us. Yeah. Oof. Professor? Yuki! We gotta save Yuki. <laughs> the maiden is mine! Stop how naive you are to think you might so easily capture me. She'll get away with Miyuki by the walking across the ceiling. So that's how it appeared all of the sun was hiding above our heads the whole time. Never mind that right now, it took Miyuki away. What should we do? This happened. What? Hang on, Haru, it's too dangerous to go alone. You think I'll be safer with you, Haru? The enemy was right in front of you, you hesitated. You had just done your job, none of this... Damn it! Calm down, Haru, we won't go after her. If we go now, we can make it. No more arguing. You're right. But we won't make it with these slow pokes. It's harsh. I'm saving Miyuki, I don't need you any... I don't need any of you. What's wrong with him? The Captain Yuki's in danger, but he's just unhinged. For now, let's follow them. We can't let our Kenningon get away. You're right. Please be okay, Miyuki. She'll be fine. We can get outside. Where did Haru go? Takuma, I understand your concern, but try not to be so impetuous. Right, because the enemy might suddenly appear again like before. Yes, it's hard to imagine that our anyone will simply leave us alone. Miyuki taken from us and with us in such a panic, she might seize on our panic and lay traps for us. In other words, no more rushing blindly ahead. But we gotta hurry. Miyuki and Haru are in danger. Those two should be fine. Why is that? Our won't refer to Miyuki as the maiden and took her without killing her. I doubt she was taken merely to panic us. They have some plans for her. In other words, they won't kill her as long as he is useful to them? Yes, and as long as Haru knows Miyuki is fine, he won't do anything foolish either. I don't know. It's his sister who's in danger. His sister in danger. What is it, Professor? Oh, sorry. <coughs> uh, it's nothing for you to be concerned over. I understand what you mean, but after seeing how furious Haru was, you doubt his judgment. You doubt his judgment, right? Like Kaito when he was in danger. Well,. Yes, well, if Haru remains upset, I can not guarantee how fine they'd be. But we mustn't let haste lead our dis to our demise. We need to proceed quickly and carefully. Isn't that a contradiction? At the very least, we need to watch for traps. About that, could we use the camera to check our way forward? That might work. If they leave traces, the camera might pick it up on it. Yeah, let's try Aoi's plan. Use the camera to look around as we go. We'll save Miyuki and Haru together. Okay, let me uh, spam more training items on Agumon because why the fuck not? The fact that I one-shot a whole horse just now, that's fucking hilarious. The Metal Greymon. I doubt they'd have laid traps this close. There were traps before we entered the chat panels, there might be some here too. It's all down to how much planning Eric Anyone put into the attack. Should we check and see? There's a lot of noise. This this is Pokemon. Do you know what's happening? This indicates a corpse, one of us. A corpse? You mean a dead body? Yes, but it's fading. How awful. 
who would dare do something so terrible? It wasn't a trap, but we might want to exercise more caution from now on. Shopping district. I'm sensing nothing else now. Um, it's wrong, Labramon. I have a bad feeling, like a creeping chill when we stand here. I can't sense anything, but I think there's something here too. Let's check with the camera. There must be something here. There's a lot of noise here, too. Same as before. No, worse than before. You didn't see this last time, right? It must be recent. Yeah, something is lingering here. Something strong in addition to the corpses. Are you sensing the thing that made the pile of corpses? Not sure. I think it might be, though. We can sense something, an overwhelming feeling of power. We should keep moving. Miyuki and Haru's lives hang in balance. Yeah. At least it's not traps. Yet. The air is pressing tighter around us. What on earth happened here? This is where we fuck a room on, right? I wonder if there was another fight here. A room on in this apartment complex. I'm afraid something terrible will appear, but if I don't check, we can't move forward. I shall act like my normal super weirdo! Here too. They killed their comrades to advance. Who would do such a thing? What unnatural thing could have killed so many? Powerful monster? Arikanimon? Yeah, maybe. No, it's Kunimon. Not Kunimon. Uh, what's her name again? Renimon. Arikanimon could barely handle us. Could she have killed so many enemies here? And why would Arikanimon want to kill these creatures? Look, everyone, that noise is more distinct over there. It must have been a recent kill. The sense is strong and seems to be moving in that direction. Further into the complex, away from the factory we're headed to. We don't have time for this. Let's follow the traces where they lead. Ooh, we can actually do free battle here. Moise. I'm surprised that I got Mew so fucking high, though. <sighs> what the- what's this? All these dead bodies, weren't they servants of Arakanimon? If they can see them, if we can see them with our own eyes, then they might just have died. Takuma, look over there. It's Renamon. Are Kenimon standing off against them? Is that Renamon? Renamon, does the professor know him? Or her? Does that thing seriously take out all of our Kenimon's servants by itself? It's overpowering. All of this destruction was wrought by him alone. Release the girl. You cannot have her. I will not allow it. Renamon is truly trying to save Miyuki. But why does Renamon know her? Ah! Stop interfering and die already! Renamon looks pretty beat up. He doesn't stand a chance. Should we try and save him? What do we do? We can't let Arakanimon leave with Miyuki. But what should we do? Draw Arakanimon's attention to save Renamon? Or forget about Renamon and save 
and just save nuking. Obviously help run more. Let's work together. You don't interfere. Back off. You're obviously hurt. Let us help you. Ha! Interfering humans. Do not get involved. Had enough of this. Spare the maiden and kill the rest. Uh, we can only summon four at this point. Uh, you, 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 and we'll use Drakmon, because we're most likely all up against Virus anyways. Carrying Mon. Evolution. Can we heal right now? Um, probably can. That matters at this point. Okay, evolution! Go in Chromon. At least I can instantly grab the chest. Which is a fucking lifesaver. First, I have to attack. I can't move twice and attack at the same time. Okay, it's not just virus. It's also vaccine. I wonder how fast Randomon is, because that could actually prove to be a uh, something that gets in the way. Not that fast. Diamond Swarm. Randomon is a neutral type, so that is good. Not strong and not weak against anything. Gonna up movement on Metal Greymon instantly, actually. <sighs> actually, moving. That's not so bad. Holy shit, poisoned and in the back. Acceleration charge? Yes. That will definitely put me in go modes to murder. Actually, that is surprising. I didn't realize we could just hit with regular attacks. Damage your animal is taking is the same. Diamond to Storm. Assist. Okay, we'll just leave our candy moon to Metal Grey. And this time she lives. Oh, I forgot to do the boost. That's why she lives.
fine potency crystal. Ho oh, ho, Agumon is gonna get even power. Ah. Yeah. Red Renmon has got a Mewki away from my Arcanimon. Mewki! Can you hear me? Are you okay? <sighs> Finally, our connection with you is cut. But I'll give you one last chance to avoid having to experience the truth. No. Tell us everything you know. How do we get home? Why was Mewki your maiden? What were you planning? What? What was that? Speak up. Couldn't hear you. I said you can go you can go to hell. <laughs> Maybe not here. Maybe not now, but this world will eventually consume you all. Just like the two already taken by the mist. Monster. Okay, don't let her get to you. Takuma, say something. It's Arakani Mum, the one that understands the boundary between worlds, as Gigi Moon said. I don't think so, but still. She seems to know something we don't. I need to hear what she has to say. I have to at least try ask the most important remaining questions. Who knows about the boundary between worlds? Ah, who indeed. So you know then. So clever, but why would they tell you that? Tell them. Don't tell them. Either way, you shall be silenced. Who's that? Pedemon? Fool to the end. No, no, I don't want to die. Help me. There can only be one punishment for failing in your duty. Death. <laughs> no. Hey, aren't you on the same side? It's very simple. A useless pawn is to be discarded. How heartless. And now, one more stands in my way. Shall I at least be done with you? Ah, <sighs> Renamon? Miyuki! Damn, Miyuki slipped away from Renamon, but people grabbed her. Come, maiden, for my master. There, there are a few details in this game that really piss me off. As as a artist myself, I should say. And I'm honestly gonna write them down. Because so far the game is great. I have no issues with the gameplay. I have no issues with the story so far. It's doing a very good job. Ugh. But, the first issue that I have with the game is that there are so many translation errors in here, and dialogue errors. Close. Dialogue. That's the first thing. Secondly is the PNGs of the characters and such. Like, they did a terrible job on keeping the colors within the borders of the line arts, right? Uh, P and G colors between the line art. So, I've noticed a few times, especially when you like zoom in on the Digivolutions, when they're standing there like this and you're looking from down below when they Digivolve, and suddenly they zoom in. You can see like the edges at some locations are not filled uh, correctly, more or less. The base color is like edging over. And just now with Piedmon, you could see that so clearly before he disappeared. 
types of don'ts. What? Dark Moon? Agamon and Labramon too. I'm shaking. That guy's too much. I'm serious. He's just too strong. He's not like anything we fought before. I don't see any way we can beat him. You're not going anywhere. I'll protect her by myself. Renamon? You can't. Not when you're injured like that. You need to rest. Let me go. I'm going. I will get her back. You're shaking too. Can't you see there's no way to win this one? We need to find a new strategy because we have to rescue Miyuki no matter what. Shut up, I can't trust any of you. You'd only end up abandoning her again. That's how it always goes. I'm the only one who can truly protect her. Renamon. Should we do Takuma? We can only go forward. They might know about our world, but we can't ignore the fact that they have Miyuki. He was heading west towards the factory. We're going... Uh, we were going to from the very beginning. It's simple. We just need to keep going towards our original goal. Yeah, maybe. Whether we decide to learn more about our enemy first or attack immediately. Either way, we still have to go the same place. The factory is to the west. Finally, we're finally here, but it's strangely quiet. We're not going to find the entrance just standing around here. They're coming in and out. We can probably sneak our way in. Let's check it out. Takuma, look, we can get into the factory through here. Whoa, well done, Agamon. Only found the entrance. It looks really big inside. It might be dangerous. Should we split up? Yeah, this is their base. We have to assume there will be traps. If we all, if we are all captured, we're done for. You're right, let's split up. Fine, but no heroics, okay? Even if we find Miyuki and Pete, don't rush an attack. Yeah, let's search the area. Exploration! Factory exterior unlocked. Factory unlocked. Factory floor one unlocked. Factory floor... Factory, sure. Floor two unlocked. Factory... Floor 2, South Unlocked. Free Battle Unlocked. Okay, we need to go every location. Good to know. The fine potency... Wait. Physical tech... Plus two physical tech. Oh wait, no, I get it. Never mind, I said nothing. Oh, we don't even get Viking Moon? That's kind of cringe. Thinking, do we go Fang Moon? Let's go Wendy Go Moon. No, yes. Let's go Fang Moon. I don't really care. Once we start a new game, I'm gonna capture a lot of these guys anyways to make up for the... Other evolutions, Marine Devi Moon and Arikani Moon, because I think it's fun to have Arikani Moon as well. I'm we I find it weird that Doku Gamon doesn't turn into uh, Arikani Moon though. Ooh, Bolta Boat Moon, nice, and Bielsa Moon.
It's kind of a shame that we can't see what their megas are yet. Oh well. Let's just take it step by step. As Minoru, did he discover anything? What's this? Fiendages! Big bandage. I like that, uh... What's his name? Bean one is big bad again. Minoru. Did you find anything? No. I just got here. Nothing yet. We both sense something suspicious here. Piedmon? No, something different. Different. We can't see anything. Oh, hey, yeah, Takuma, check things out with your camera. Why do I have to check with the camera? Mature enlightenment slap times three. It's our evolution energy and so much of it. What? Well, that's great. If we use this power, we might be ready for Piedmon. Well done, Falcomon. I knew we could count on you. It was nothing. Don't be so humble. It's really impressive. Minoru and Falcomon are back to their old selves. Yeah, or maybe even more so. But it was good of Falcomon to find a reason to check things out. And if Minoru... And it was Minoru who suggests we use the camera. Thanks to you too, Minoru, you suggested using the camera. Yeah, well, anyone would have. We've been using it since we got here. It's only natural to think of it. Are you embarrassed? He is. I I'm not embarrassed! Mm hmm. Sure, Minoru, sure. Let's see if we can gain some affinity points with uh, Saki. Uh, Saki, did she find any clues, I wonder? Saki? I'm sorry, Takuma. I haven't found anything yet. Checking with the camera, but nothing is standing out. It's fine. Don't rush. You're right. You need to cal stay calm. But the panic never goes away. Really? I couldn't tell you were panicked. I'm impressed, Saki. Impressed? With what? Compared to the beginning, you become less emotional, less of a victim. You've learned how to think more calmly, to take stock of the situation. You think so? I didn't notice. She really is different than she was before. She still speaks casually, but I can see how much she worries about everyone. She doesn't seem to be aware of the changes, though. Grew up? Ooh, I wonder which she'd like. Less selfish... Well, she does always think she th thinks she's selfish. Kinder... Mm, ugh, this is hard. I have, I have a hard time figuring uh, Saki out, because... She's really good at masking herself. She grew up, she's less selfish, she's kinder now. I mean, she's definitely less selfish. Let's go with she's kinder. What's the worst that can happen? It's like Saki is kinder now. How can I describe it? She's not selfish anymore? What do you mean? Still me. You're the selfish one. <laughs> what? No, that's not what I mean at all. Maybe you're right. So rude. You are right, though. Guess I always thought things would work out. After talking with Hormon, I thought I could just let go for it a bit. Instead of hoping things work out, I make them work out. Saki. Uh, that would make sense. Oh, if affinity did go up. You think so? I don't really see it. Okay, that's what I like to hear. Oh, 24. I think I need, like, at least 30 before she will get her ultimate. And if I had to guess, everyone else, the for the Mega, they need, like, 50 or something.
Oh, there's Miu. Has she found any clues? I forgot to look in uh, Saki's area. What's this? Clean dressing obtained. Oh, Takuma, look! Ta-da! Whoa, what is that? It's the shredded cable I just found. It's like a snake. Were you scared? This is a terrible time for surprises like that. I'm sorry, Takuma. You was really scared too. Sayako, that was a secret! She tried her best to pretend there was nothing wrong. She's battling her fear, so go easy on her, okay? Uh, just tell him everything, why don't you? <laughs> well, Mew's doing great, so problems on her own. Trying to not ask for any for my help, even though she's still so young. Look out, a snake! That's great, Mew. Oh, great job, Mew. She's kicking butt! Stop, you're embarrassing me! Sayako Mom shouldn't surprise me like that. I embarrassed her, but I really did think she was great. Uh, probably going in with the joke would have... Oh. Okay, no, we're fine. We're not fine. Fuck my life. Should I talk with the professor? Always talk to the professor. Professor! Learning crystal. Oh, shit. That's good for when the other partners appear. Have you found anything, Takuma? No, nothing. Well, I'll say it again. We have to be very careful. If we get hurt or defeated, there'll be no one to help Miyuki. About that, why was she targeted? Why are they calling her the Maiden? They seem to see Miyuki as a special somehow, Maiden. It's not a word you'd hear all that often back in our world. You will sometimes see Shrine Maidens at Major Shrines selling amulets, yes, but that was not the original role of the Maiden. Maidens were said to be in service to the gods, appeasing them with music. The Maidens could hear the gods, the gods would possess them to speak to the world, the gods, and if this world has gods, could Miyuki be a bridge between those gods and the creatures here? Are the enemy expecting her to intercede on their behalf? And why would they need her to do that? So they want her to sing for them. To hear the words of the gods. Is Miyuki abducted to hear the voice of the gods? What? Well, Miyuki has some special maiden like abilities to hear the voice of the gods. And if the enemy knew that about her, maybe I'm just imagining things. No, that that might be it. Listen here, Takuma. Back home, I was investigating the Kenamogami faith. At the time, there was something about a bloodline that served the Kinomogami. A family who served the Kinomogami, and that family's name was Minase. My sister's name is Miyuki Minase. Miyuki Minase? Yes, oh yes. You've helped me start to remember. That song Miyuki was singing, the one I was humming but had forgotten about, that was a traditional sacred song for the Minase family. Miyuki was a maiden in service of the Kinomogami shrine. She wasn't that special. Haru, what happened? You're a mess. That's not important right now. I need to talk about Miyuki. She was just a girl, afraid of being lonely. She was neither powerful nor special. That was why I promised to help her and to always be at her side. And yet she always sang that song. The sacred song. The song tells of how two separate worlds become united once again. It might be that her thoughts beckon you to this world once more. It might be that her thoughts beckon you to this world once more. What the heck do you know, Haru? I can't tell you. You need to ask that old fool there. But I will say this. If you refuse to accept your reappearance as this mo at this moment, I and no one else will rescue Miyuki. Uh, wait, Haru! Was I summoned? Summoned again. I... Pull yourself together, Professor. It's fine. I'm fine. Is it true? Is Mu Miyuki really my... Why have I forgotten this? You're very pale again, sir. Let's sit down for a bit. I'm sorry. Just a little more. And it'll all come together. 
When all the broken fragments in my brain can reunite into a single thought, I will at last have an idea how to get us home, but why? Is it something I have to remember? Is this something a part of my returning memories? Or is it fear? What am I so afraid of? Calm down, Professor. Just rest for now. Yes, you're right. Let me rest here for a bit. Professor, the final battle is nearly upon us. Without you, we can't win. You have to take care of yourself. You're right. Thank you, Agumon. Both my mind and body need to rest. Hated that he's not telling us what he already tech what he secretly already knows, right? If she found any clues. Well, if I miss something, I must have missed it really bad now. You might be heading home soon. It doesn't seem real. I had been so focused on wondering when I would die. First things first, Saka, we still don't know if we can even beat Piedmont. Sorry, you're right, but it's important to try and stay positive, right? To imagine what we'll do once we get home. It helps me feel braver when I need to. It's definitely better than just being depressed. I hope we can all be together when we're home, Akamon for me and everyone. But I might not be able to join you right away. Uh, why not? It's normal, right? I have things to do, people to see. Things to do? That's weird. Maybe I should ask what she means. We're better friends than we were before, but a personal question. I think not going into it is better with Saki. It doesn't have to be right away. It never works for you. Takuma. We got through this craziness together, so we'll be friends even if you can't join us. Yeah, that figured that would be the better option. That's true. Thanks. So I'll see you when I see you then. You're a treat, right? Until then. Hang on. I didn't say I treat you. <laughs> Don't be such a tight wood. I'm looking forward to it. There's Mew. Oh, think she found any clues? Let's see how much that up does to 28. That probably just means one more good reaction with her. Mind if I say something, Takuma? Hmm, what? Would you mind looking after my brother? Looks like he's ready to explode at any second. I can tell by the look on his face. Sure, okay. Why are you asking me? I was thinking of watching him myself, but, well, he keeps looking at me. I don't want him to start getting suspicious. Can't they just get along as brother and sister? I don't have any reason to turn him down, other than the bad timing, really. I don't mind helping out. Can't have Kaido going off the deep end. Thank you. I've been so worried. If you're worried about him, don't you think he'd be happier if you stayed close? If I did that, I wouldn't be able to complain about how overprotective he is anymore. Is that what's going on? The distance between them is hard to figure out. All that matters is that she cares, Takuma. Plus, overprotectiveness is fucking pain in the ass. Is that Aoi? I wonder how her search is going. Vroom vroom vroom. Hey Takuma, look at this. Mark on the wall? It seems more recent than the other damage. People might have left it. He could have scrapped the wall. Even still, you did a great job finding that little mark. Well, I have to give it my all. I'll keep looking. Let's pray his confuser. That didn't seem like an embarrassed reaction. She found a great clue. Don't want her to change attitude, though. Should I ask if uh, something is wrong when they believe me? I think telling her to keep it up is probably uh, the best answer, because she is not great with compliments. Thanks, Aoi. Keep it up. Keep spawning these clues, and we'll definitely find you. Yeah, I figured. You're right. I'm glad I'm helping. But, I'm sorry, now's not the time to be happy. Wait, does this mark make it look like they're heading north? To the north? I can see a building there. I haven't found a way to get there yet. Let's look for one. I'll be quick, wait here. Aoi? 
Let her stay focused. I'm sure the fear is keeping her moving like that. Alright, yeah, I see what you mean. It's fine, as long as the fear pushes her on, but I'm worried she'll explode. Oh yeah, I wonder if the professor's feeling any better. I should go check on him. No! Ooh. Should I talk to the professor? Talk to the professor. Takuma, do you have a second? Are you okay, professor? Yes, well, even when I try not to think, my brain won't let me stop. Never mind that, look here. The debris in front of the wall, doesn't it seem like it's being piled up? There's a thin line in the wall. Yes, I think this might be a door. The debris has been moved. Maybe people want to throw us off his trail. By sealing the door. Yes, that is possible. Takuma, Agmon, help me move these debris. This debris. Wrong, Professor. I'm helping too. Three of us will make it easy. Alright, let's go. Ready, and... Ah, uh, we moved it all, I think. That took more effort than I expected. Be back. But just as I thought, this wall was a door. And from the angle of it, the door leads to a building to the north. We've looked and looked, but have not found people or Miyuki yet. They must have passed this door. They have to be in that building. Oh, we should go check it out. But we need to let everyone know what we found first. Are you okay? Are you okay, Professor? Can you move? Yes, I'm fine. Sorry, I worried you so badly. That wasn't the good look. I'm better now, though. I can move on my no problem. Good. Well, have you remembered anything? It's starting to come back. Different memories of my childhood, but the memories are still a jumble. I wouldn't know what to tell you first. Let me try and gather my thoughts as we move. We could let you rest some more. No, I don't even know if these memories will help us get home. And if that's the case, I prefer to use what feeble strength I have to rescue Miyuki. Can at least explain things better now. If we need any information to get home, I will tell you about it immediately. You'll tell us? You are wise and trustworthy. I would want you to hear this, yes. You're right, Professor. There's so one thing I can tell you now, though. A theory based on my memories is that the song that Miyuki, that Miyuki here and my sister Miyuki Minase both sang. Get out of my way! Is that Haru's voice? It's hurry, Takuma. Get out of my way, Gurumon. Miyuki's ahead, right? How foolish you are. Are you still obsessed with that human child? As if a thing like you could un as if it a thing like you could understand. Neither I I neither understand nor trust humans. You know how I was betrayed, and yet you still expect me to trust a human? Miyuki has nothing to do with the cold-hearted human who betrayed you. Of course you were betrayed. What do you think was going to happen? Thought you'd say that. What has your favorite human ever done for you? He has returned none of your kindness. You have earned nothing but pain and suffering. But no matter what becomes of me, there is no value in protecting humans. What's your point? I should help you? I'm saying to... I'm saying to reconsider your allegiances. Is the master worthy of your trust? Can you really save your world with a sacrifice? Does the master have such power? Is the master a god? I know you have doubts, Garurumon. Shut up! Shut up! You're only thinking of revenge. The world, the master, none of that stuff motivates you in the least. If that's true, then... Guys... Garurumon and Haru? Stand down, Haru. If you injure yourself anymore, don't tell me what to do. What's you? I was hoping I would have to see your face again. Garurumon, it is you. For all these years. You said it, didn't you? You don't trust humans. Now we only want revenge. Revenge? Well, look. The one you want vengeance on is right here. Kill him now and be done with it. What? 
Both Haru and Garumon are looking at the professor. They want to murder him. I can't let that happen. Please, Akron, stop the Rorimon from attacking on it. Hang on, he's not attacking? Ugh. Why won't you kill them? You had a perfect chance. No, that's not. You're still confused. You don't hate them enough. Silence. You hate them enough to kill them, and yet you hesitate. You have no idea how your hesitation confounds the Master's plans. I said silence! <sighs> Haru! Just shut up, all of you. Don't let me... Tell me about bonds, about destiny. You all still cling to it. Even my past self clings to it. It's all worthless. I will annihilate all of it. Okay, Garurumon 1v1, me bitch. Takuma, are you okay? You all okay? We heard a massive argument, of course we came. Haru collapsed. He's badly hurt. What did you do, Garurumon? Got in my way, but it's fine. I will silence you all. I'd like to see you try. How many? Three. Uh, obviously go with Lokmon, with Hawkmon, and like always, just this group. Defeat all the enemies. Start battle. Let me have a look at my entire surroundings here, actually. <laughs> Lol. Okay. Uh, there's a chest there, which I can only reach through climbing. There are so many chests. Jesus Christ. <sighs> okay, Agumon. Actually, uh, yeah, Agumon. Evolve. Much more Move. Attack, you get destroyer. Nothing sad. Uh talk. Minaru. Evolution. Vertical movement three even, that's so fire. Why am I still so fucking hot? One, two, oof. Evolution. Acceleration charge plus. That's sick.
Ist dann eine Blaster! Second, is he actually going to attack? Of course, he wasn't. Crystal taint. Does that uh, do more damage with light? Battle metal. Oh, wait. This one, right? Attack. Yeah. Attack charge. Ready, Falcon? One. Let's push forward. Leave it to me. You won't escape me. Escape this time, Garumon. Why would you help these weaklings? Minoru's strength lies not in his muscle, but in his heart. Our bonds sustain him. Falcon, you jest. Weakness is unforgivable. How dare you, insects, think you might eat, might ever be stronger? I can't even cross this bridge. 
didn't even notice. Critical, nice. Team attack, double nice. Just gonna stand here because it's not gonna, not gonna be fast enough, anyways. Resistance, sleep resistance. Oh, that's just two different things. Cool. Damn it! No, how can weaklings like these? Garum, and you finally understand now, don't you? What? There is a reason why you cannot access the full power within. You deny your own heart. You think that you were betrayed. You were hurt. But who is really betrayed? Are you sure you want vengeance? Your heart isn't in it, no matter how much you say you need revenge. Silence! In silence! He betrayed me without a doubt. He left me behind. You were lonely when you were left here, right? Isn't your loneliness proof that you cannot fully hate him? What? I don't know what happened, but did you consider how he must have felt? Hear what I think. If you tell him how you feel, and if you hear how he feels, you might be able to understand each other. For us, our destiny is to share the hearts of the humans we are bound to. Get real. You know nothing. But why does my head spin when I talk to all of you? I think Arumon is on the brink of a breakthrough. What happened between them, we still don't know. Arumon really wants to hate him, but there is no real hatred there. You need to believe in your destiny, Garurumon. I don't know what happened between you two, but think hard. Do you really want revenge? Aye. Destiny. Bonds. I. Enough. That's enough. You can try and deny it, but I lost. To the delusion of your bonds. Iris seemed to have fainted. Let him rest. We need to hurry on. Is it safe to leave him here? If we make it obvious that we're moving out, the enemy w should leave him alone. I already got too worked up and fainted. Let him le let's leave him. We can't leave him anyone here. hate having to say this, but we should just let Harris sleep here. Erumon, do you think you know where they are keeping Miyuki? I'm defeated, so it doesn't matter if I tell you. At the top of those stairs in the back. Hurry now. Thank you, Garumon. Let's go, everyone. to hurry. When the battle is over, you and I should talk. About all that has happened, about your feelings, I want to hear it all. And I, I will make it up to you, at the very least. Garumon. 
<laughs> what the fuck was that? You already. What is this place? It looks really dangerous. Is this an altar? Takuma, over here. Nick is tied to the altar. A special sacrificial ceremony is underway. You will not interfere. Yikes, Piedmon! He's like a creepy clown. You can tell how powerful he is just by looking at him, though Piedmon is strong. Sacrificial ceremony? Can't let that happen. Give her back! Your voice lacks conviction. I can tell how much you fear me. Ugh. His powers are immense, but we can't just flee. I don't know what the ceremony is supposed to be for, but you can't sacrifice one of us. The weakest dogs always howl the loudest. You are pitiful. But weaklings have their uses. We shall sacrifice you to the master as well. You're going to kill us too, not just mutiny? Why is a sacrifice needed? What is it for? To cleanse the impurities that spread across this land, the master wished it. You ignorant weaklings! Curse your idiocy as you are consumed! Okay, we got some enemies there. We can only take four, though. Obviously, we're just going with the regular crew, right? I really want to bring Saki, but Saki is the only one that doesn't have an ultimate yet. Piedmon defeated. We'll start. Okay, um... Speed chart, holy shite. Oh, hey. Fucking... Wasn't Dave just talking about that guy? <laughs> uh, and I was like, yeah, I don't know if he's actually in the game. But there he is, right there, in the game. Okay, I'm gonna send... Metal Greymon up to chest... A... Hawkmon to chest B. What is, what is Pigmon actually? Pigmon is okay, so we should be fine. Okay, move. Do I savage M? Oh, I can't hit him. You're right. Well, then we're moving. Do gotta be careful a little bit though. Though I don't really expect too much difficulty from... I think we're fine. Evolution. I think I'm sending my Yodas Moon this way as well. Evolution... Evolution, because you're just turning into data, so I'm sending you this way as well. Attack, what is your attack? North and cross bomb. Hit. Not close enough. And turn. Oblivion Birds! Oof. This should 
kill, right? Nice. Critical. Brilliant. Destruction Guardian Needle. Special defense up. Critical up K. Oh, another one? Another one! Can I fly from here to the other side? I can. Sick tits. Wait. No, I can only go this attack from the front. I forgot to give uh, Severus more the uh, plus one. Yeah, some large range, yo. Team attack! That is super cringe. We got this on! Anti-freeze crystal. So I'm gonna have to move up fast. Chromon. Speed charge. He got this boy. Oh. Well, that sucks. Let's see, do I survive? The oblivion bird from this guy. No, I actually got confused. That is not great. Give it a needle. You got destroyer. Okay, I'm gonna de digivolve real quick so that I can recover some SP while I gather everyone up to a little bit of better spots. I was heading into the wrong direction for the chest anyways. That's really bad, by the way. I 
Freedoms. Clean dressing. Attack. Perfect enlightenment slap. Shit sticks. Well, let's move. Regular attack, nice. Does that, do I hit? No, I can't hit him. I'm sending... You back towards... The digital view because you don't need anything currently. It's a good moment for you to gain SP. Defense went down, that's nice. HP up, SP up. Critical again, fuck my life. Items. Which is the all purpose ointment healing? Dressing. <sighs> and turn. Come after me anyways, so that's fine. Ikakumon! Wait, can I even move over that? Speedback. Does that mean we can kill this fuckface finally? In turn. Really hunting Chrome now. Attack, night raids. Go out. Items. Clean dressing. And our boom torpedo. Just move here and speed charge. Which 
I like. Scope Raymond out. I need to give myself some. SP. I should have de digivolved actually. Turn. Big bandage and turn. Should have given someone uh, healing abilities actually. Big bandage. Uh, bullocks. Well, at least we can start moving in that direction again. Right, slowly. Attack, pepper breath, sleep and kill. So I'm just gonna evolve. And then do we get destroyed, kill. And turn. Big bondage and turn with this way. She's now fine, so we're gonna keep on moving. Nice. Uh, and my evolution. And and turn for a bit. And turn. Evolution. Oh, I didn't think my Yotas won't fit levitate up here. I guess that would make sense now. And turn. Get you there. Evolution. And 
turn. HP back up, SP up. And turn. And turn. Evolution for a little bit more movement speed. Until we're next to the others. Missed the speed boost. Move. Evolution. Okay, we just have to wait for Dracon to have more SP. out. And turn, and turn, and turn, and turn. So I think I'm gonna keep Thingy a little bit on the far side, so that I can use her as support. In the meantime, I'm gonna talk Takuma for all stats boost. Evolution U. You to be around here. Same assist SP. Drachmon into my Yodismon. Move to look off the field. And an evolution. Move into this. That she, the chance that you get one shot gets diminished. But keep you on a distance. He has quite... no, he's not have that much reach, reach apparently. Can't reach him. Neither can I reach him with... Romo. Attack 10%, we get the slaughter. Half his HP. Uh, he's too strong. Wait, everyone, there's no time to bulk down in the fight. Look over there. That mist, it's the same when Shuji disappeared. That mist is getting closer and closer to Miyuki. They will cover her soon. We have to do something. Won't let that happen, Miyuki. Professor's trying to save her? You can't do it alone, Professor. You think I would allow you to touch the maiden? Ugh. Professor, we have to help him. Professor! Be gone. From swords. Grumble protected the Professor, but why? Grumon, what are you doing? I can't forgive this old geezer. I can't forget my hatred. And so I can't allow you to die like this before you receive my hatred in full. So you have joined these fools? Then join them in their fates as well. Become prey to be devoured by these wor this world. Grumon, please. Just once. 
One more time is all. Lend me your strength. For Miyoku, for Renamon, for you. I never wanted you to suffer ever again. Fine, just this once. My fate with Kemonogami, that the bond we once shared return to us one more time. Grumon Digivolve 2! Garumon. Garumon evolved? He evolved for the professor? Let's go, Takuma, everyone. We need to get to Miyuki before the mist takes her away. Hurry up and defeat Piedmon. And rescue the maiden. Hurry, Miyuki. Hurry to Miyuki. The mist hasn't reached Miyuki yet. If we beat him in time, we can still save her. It's good because he only needs to take one more hit from my sorry ass. Um, well, I can't really do anything here other than just attack. Savage Emperor! Well, that was a miss. Cringe. Uh, not attack. Item. Big bandage. Just gonna heal up my Otis Mom so that he doesn't die. Item. Uh, big bandage. Holy shit, he moves fast. He's speed charged. Good. Serious? Talk about cringe. Of course he's running after this dumbass again. But your fate is sealed. Pummeled Piedmon victory. Vexing potency crystal, nice. Did we do it? Did we beat Pete Mom? We did it, Mew! We won! We won! It's amazing, you're incredible, Sakyo Mom. You would have me kneel before you, Grumon Traitor! You want this world in, to end in darkness too? You need traitor? I never really believed in the master the way you did. I've been wondering what exactly this master. Right, why would we need to sacrifice and why do they call Miyuki Maiden? <laughs> you expect me to just answer your questions? Rotten loser. You lost. I could still beat the crap out of you. I lost. <laughs> me? I lost? You still under understand nothing. Ignorant fools. What does he mean by that? Oh, Mew, get behind me. When is this? The world suddenly shook. What is it? What is this? The air has changed. I don't like this. No, Miyuki! Miss suddenly is suddenly everywhere. It's much faster than before. Everybody run! Hang on, Minoru. Miyuki's still on the altar. Now to begin the ritual. O oh, great and mighty master, accept that which we offer thee. The sacrifice upon this altar, this child. No. Takuma, 
We're gonna shoot you or enveloped by the mist and disappeared. If I just stand here, gapping, we might lose Miyuki too. I don't want to lose anyone else, no one. Let's go, Takuma, we need to rescue Miyuki, yeah. Hang on, Takuma, are you going to dive into that mist? Forget Miyuki, you're down too. But I can't just let her die. So you will sacrifice yourself? No way. But Miyuki is my problem, we can't lose Takuma too. I know I might not make it back, but it's better than letting the mist take Miyuki. She can't even move. It's fine, I'll bring Miyuki back with me. Idiot, you're going to your death. Stop, Takuma, no. Sorry, everyone, but I'll be right back. <laughs> That's not how the mist works, though. The mist only envelops those that are, like, at the edge of the world, at world's end. Also remember, no bloody scene. He's gone, this can't be happening, right? Takuma! Takuma! I can stop him, I couldn't. Garamu, hang on, hang on, where are you going? Make no mistake, I have not forgiven you yet. I did help you, but that had more to do with my disgust of that clown boy over there. Then, I don't know what's next. Maybe my jaws will find your throat if we meet again. Ugh. My heart's still confused. I can't be anywhere near you yet. I'm going. Don't try and stop me. Garumon. This isn't goodbye, right? You'll both be back any moment now, right? Yeah. You know it! <laughs> Thirsty. We're okay. We're just in a different dimension. What? Where am I? It's too dark to see anything. How am I able to stand now? Which way is up? Which way is down? Uh, uh. Who's there? I want... I want enough. What is this? It's like it's bubbling up from beneath the ground. That awful voice. I want... I want... What? Something dark and big is headed this way. Power. Knowledge. Existence. Soul. Heart. Bring them all to me! No. What? Don't stay there, come here! What is that strange warm light? And I know I've heard that voice before. Let's see where the light's coming from. We're back in the fucking school? Wait, am I? Takuma! Takuma! Hagumon, I'm so glad you're okay. Me too. Are you awake, Takuma? Miyuki? You can understand me. I'm so glad you weren't taken by the darkness. Yes, I'm happy you're safe too. Miyuki can talk now too? Yes, I'm sorry I was quiet all that time. But it took all I had. I wanted to respond to everyone, but I couldn't. The master of this world took half of my soul, that's why. Master of the world? Your soul? That mist that enveloped you and me? That is one of the master's powers. I was taken by the mist so long ago, I can't tell you how much time has passed. For the longest time, he consumed my heart and will, always feeding off half my soul. But thankfully, half my soul remained mine, alone. The monster couldn't take it. That was the me that all of you met in the Kimonogami world. If Haru hadn't protected me, the Master would have taken that part too. I see. That's why Haru was always by our side. And it's not just me. You were in danger just now too, Takuma. You mean that if I didn't come to the light away from the darkness, you would have been captured, just as I was? No, I think you would have gone even deeper. All of your soul, life and existence gone. Oh, really was a close call then. Thank you, Miyuki. You saved me. What do you mean? When I dove into the mist, my only idea was to keep you from disappearing, but now that I think about it, I had no real way of knowing what would happen to me. Thank you for rescuing me. I'm so glad we're finally able to talk like this too. Oh! I'm the one who should be thanking you. Until now, I was useless to everyone. Even so, you risked your own life to help me. And so I have to thank you. It's because of you that... Uh, 
Oh no, the master knows where we are. We have to do something. Countless stars. Countless stars that shine so bright. Are you singing now? Sparkling with ancient heat and light. Whoa! Are you being attacked? Stop singing, Miyuki. We need to hide. Hang on, though. I heard that song before. It's the same song the professor was humming. Is this the song of the Minai and Maiden? May this world where friends are found with ghostly voices now resound. It's the same dark space before. Is the light getting bigger, though? Miyuki, wait. I need you to... I need to ask you so many things. Oh, the light. Ah! <laughs> The song, the worlds are bound together once more. The maiden must not go, her power, I must reclaim it. Power, knowledge, existence, soul, heart, all shall be my flesh and blood. She must not go! Part 8 Are you sure you got everything, Takuma? Maybe, maybe not. Yeah, Mom, I'm all set. Oh, what about the camp guys? Did you remember to bring an extra handkerchief? And it gets cold so quickly in the mountains. You'll need both a jacket and a coat. I've got all I need, Mom. I went through it all last night and checked again just now. Well, it never hurts to double check. Remember that time you were in second grade? came home from the field trip in tears because you forgot to pack your lunch. Mom, that was years ago! She starts with that story, she doesn't stop. I'll be late if I don't cut her off. Oh, and I don't want you staying up too late when you get there. And try not to stare at your phone too much on the bus. You'll get car sick. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got it. I sued a little good luck charm into your pants. Mom, that's so weird. Why would you do that? If you ever get in trouble and you don't know what to do, I want you to look at it, okay? She's so superstitious. Mom, I'm not a little kid anymore. Oh, Takuma, you know you'll always be my little boy. Man, I don't even know what to say to that. Whatever, Mom. I'm leaving now. Goodbye! I wish she wouldn't treat me like I was still five years old all the time. What's she so worried about anyway? I'm just going on a camping trip. I mean, sure, I'll always be her kid. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to grow up. It doesn't mean I'll never be an adult. See you when I get back! Takuma, wait, you forgot this. You missed something? Well, I'm pretty sure I got everything I need. It can't be that important. Sorry, Mom, I don't want to be late. Takuma, stop! Come back, Takuma! It's gotten into her. I think this was a matter of life and death or something. Takuma! Takuma! Uh, that's all. It's like her voice is getting farther and farther away. Takuma! Takuma! Is that really my mom calling for me? It's okay, mom. I got everything. No need to panic. Takuma, wake up! Huh? That's not my mom's voice. Sounds familiar though, and why does it feel like I'm being like I'm shaking? Takuma, come on! What? Oh Takuma, you're awake, hooray! Agumon? So let's stop with my mom. Guess that was a dream. Dream Takuma, are you alright? Oh uh, yeah, sorry, I got a little mixed up there. But uh There sure are a lot of red lilies in this forest. Where are we? Beats me. All I know is we were here when I woke up, and you're lying on the ground. But why are we in this forest, and what was I doing before? Did you forget, Takuma? Ah, uh, sorry, my memory's fizzy. 
You mean you forgot what happened right before we came here? Right before we came here? That's weird. Everything's all mixed up in my head. I can't remember. What was the last thing you remember? Now, let's see. Went to the abandoned factory to try and rescue Miki, right? Right. And then, oh yeah, we fought Pete Mon and we won. We sure did. Then Miki got swallowed up by that fog. So we went after her and we wound up in uh, some kind of music room where we found Miki. We gotta talk about Turns out you did remember everything. I'm so glad. Yeah, apparently I did. It's all coming back now. I re remember talking with Miki and she was speaking normally. I feel like she did something and then we were all covered in this white light. Hmm. No, that's it. I guess I still can't quite remember everything. Maybe if I could ask Miyuki, she would know. Hey, that's right, where is Miyuki? What happened to her? Don't ask me. When I woke up, everyone else was gone. It was just me and you. Well, we can worry about what happened later. First, we need to find Miyuki. Where could Miyuki have gone? I don't think she'd be too far. Should we try looking farther out? No, let's not get ahead of ourselves. The trees are thicker that way, and you never know what might be hiding in the shadows. Plus, something about this place seems off. What do you mean? I can't quite put my finger on it, but this force, something's... Something about it is different. It's not quite the same as I'm used to. Yeah, I noticed something like that too. So it's not just me. What is it that's bothering you, Agumon? Well, oh. I heard it too, uh, Takuma. It came from over there. Takuma, look, over there, it's Miyuki. Miyuki? Where am I? Miyuki, do you remember me? Takuma? So glad we found you, are you alright? You're not hurt or anything, are you? I don't think so, but what are we doing here? Honestly, right now, I'm just glad it sounds like you really are okay. What? I was afraid that maybe you lost the ability to speak again. You mean, you were worried about me? Why wouldn't we be? After all, you're one of our closest friends. So happy to hear you say that. I've been meaning to tell you something. Thank you so much for being so nice to me and my brother this whole time. There is... There, I can finally say thank you. Is that clear enough? <laughs> yeah, of course. But I mean, it's not like you have to thank us for, for anything. I haven't been doing anything special. Just treated you how I felt like treating you. Me too. Well, I felt like thanking you just now too. So I did. Make a good pair, don't we? <laughs> Yes, we do. You know, I've never had a chance to talk with you like this before, Miyuki. Really? Wasn't she talking like this in that other place before we came here? Well, we didn't exactly have a lot of time there. We never had a chance to chit-chat. Oh, this does feel like a fresh start. I guess I should say, nice to meet you, Takuma. Right, nice to meet you too, Miyuki. Same to you, Agumon. You too, Miyuki. So, Takuma, Agumon, where are we exactly? Oh yeah, we shouldn't just be standing around chatting like this. Sorry, but I have a hard time remembering things from when I was out of it. No need to apologize, and to be honest, we're still not entirely sure where this is either. But we do know there's something off about this forest, it's not normal. Oh yeah, we were talking about that earlier. What was it that struck you differently about this place, Agumon? I can't sense anything in this forest. Like me or the others. You mean nothing like you at all? Right, I can't even sense Falcomon or Dracomon or anyone else. So what does that mean? I don't know why either. If I can't sense Falcomon or anyone else, there's definitely something weird going on. Maybe that means we're really far away from the others. Well, from what I saw, it doesn't seem like we're anywhere near the victory. Probably still somewhere on the weird island, but strange. I don't remember any flowers in that forest. We had to go through to get to the factory. Wait, that's it, the red spider lilies. That's what's so weird about this place. And in this world, red spider lilies only grow in one specific area. Does that mean we somehow wound up back by the school? Maybe. Maybe. No, that can't be. The surroundings don't quite match up. If anything, this is like no. It it can be, can it? I mean. There's no way, right? Things don't just work out that like that. I need to calm down and think this through again. Carefully examine all that I know, one thing at a time, like the professor would. Is something wrong, Takuma? Did you figure something out? No, no, I can't be sure of anything yet. You say so. So what do we do now, Takuma? Uh, right, I've been wondering about that too. I don't see much of a point in staying here. But then again, 
If we just head out blindly and get lost, that won't help either. I don't sense any enemies nearby, but you think I should go see what's up ahead? That would mean splitting up, don't you think that would be dangerous? Hmm, I guess it could be. What do you think, Takuma? Under the circumstances, our options are limited. We should stay here and hope the others find us, or the three of us could go take a look around. And again, we could have Akumon do looking while Miyuki and I stay here. I hate that that's the right option. But looking around blindly could be dangerous, but we can't just stay here. I think maybe we should let Akumon take a look around to be safe. Whatever you say, Takuma. Wait! What is Miyuki? I don't think we should split up. After all, what if, what if we get lost and never see each other again? He seems really upset by that possibility, and she's right. If we do split up, there is no guarantee we'll find each other again. I guess, if we're going to move at all, we should just move together. Thank you for understanding, Takuma. Well, you're right. I'd hate for us to get separated. Let's all look around together. If that fog shows up, we're in trouble, so we have to be careful. Right, got it. So now that that's settled, which way should we go? Hey, Takuma, look over there. Huh? It's all lit up! Sure is. Funny, it was dark until just now. Light shining in just in that one spot is like showing us the way to go. She's right, it's almost like we're being guided down the right path. No, this could all be a coincidence either, though we need to get moving. Alright, let's head to the light. Let's head to the light! Guys, don't you know that heading to the light means heading to death? Follow the li lighted path this way, but it's not some sort of trap, is it? Is it just me, or does this place look familiar? Hmm? So your mind, Takuma. You've been pretty thoughtful for a while now. I don't know, it's just, I feel like I've been here before. But it couldn't just be in my imagination. You see all these red spider lilies? Remember how they grew in the forest near that school? Might be why this place seems familiar. Really? I don't think I've ever seen this place before. I mean, it's kind of like that forest, but it's not the same. Huh? What is this strange sensation? If he's right, if this really is where I think it might be, maybe the place you're thinking of with the red spider lilies somewhere else. There's only one other place it could be, but it's from before I met Agumon, even before I found myself in that other world. That would mean could be a uh, Takuma? You really think where... Do you really know where we are? I think maybe this is... Hey, Zillar! No, it has to be. It must be. Takuma, what's gotten into you? Takuma, wait! Both of you follow me. If this is where I think it is, it shouldn't be much further. I find myself running. It's almost like my body is acting all by itself. I have to know. I have to be sure that that... And that needs... Drives me forward. It's gotta be there. Just gotta be. The tunnel. I knew it! I was right! It's the same tunnel! We came through here to get to the shrine! And then we woke up in another world! Takuma! You mean, is it really true? It has to be. What's going on? What's true? What are you two walk talking about? I don't get it at all! What we're saying is, uh, saying is this might not be your world, Agumon, huh? But if this isn't my world, then it... What does that mean? Where are we? Well, we need to get through this tunnel. That'll clear things up for sure. I'm glad I'm finally finished with the first playthrough of Warriors 3 Hopes. Makes sense. Hey, wait! Takuma, hold on! Is this really? I've definitely never been here before. <laughs> yes, I remember this. This is the road that led to the shrine. That strange mist is gone. I thought it was too good to be true, but it wasn't. This is it. We're back. We made it back from the other world. Wait. What? You mean this is the world where you and your friends all came from, Takuma? That's right. This is it. Whoa. So this is your world. That's great, Takuma. Yeah, thanks, Agumon. Well, I sure wasn't expecting that. You know, this place is kind of weird, but... I'm glad I got to go back with you to your world, Takuma. I'm glad you're here too. I'm so happy it worked, huh? Wait, what do you mean it worked? You don't remember what happened in the music room? The music room, wait. I think back on it. Yes, I remember. You were singing a song and then all this white light started surrounding us. You mean you did that, Miyuki? 
With the other half of my soul returned, it looks like I managed to save you, Takuma. So the reason we're here right now is because of something you did. Wasn't sure if it would really work or not myself. Looks like it did, though. I'm so glad. Wait, what? This whole conversation is unexpected. I'm having a hard time keeping up. If Miyuki brought us back to this world, that means she must know something, right? And what she mean about her other half her soul? And she mentioned that in the music room too. Come to think of it, that was she. What was she ever doing in that world in the first place? And more importantly, does she know what happened to the others? Why were you there? So I could start on some other games in my backlog, like Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Why were you even in that world to begin with, Miyuki? Because I broke the rules. My dad said to never go near the shrine that monsters who kidnap children would get me. He tried to warn me. Wait, your dad warned you about monsters? What does that mean? Was he talking about the Kinemogami? Anyway, I didn't have a choice at the time. We went there on a field trip, and then the fog, that horrible fog, ugh. Was it the same scary fog that we know? Yes, that fog appeared, and oh, it was terrible. Okay, okay, stop. You don't have to force yourself to remember if it's too painful. Sorry, I didn't mean to bring up any bad memories. No, it's okay. If anything, I should be apologizing to you. I feel so mixed up. I'm not surprised. After all, she was pretty out of it by the time we showed up. It's possible she went through a lot more than we did. Well, I guess the big takeaway is that Miyuki is the reason we made it back. Now we'll have to think about what to do and what our next move is going to be. Hey, Takuma, there's something over there. What? More than his cronies, is it? Was I wrong about us being back home? Are we still in the other world? No, it doesn't feel like one of us. I think it's another human like you. Oh, phew. Start to panic for a second there. If you're sensing humans, do you think maybe it's the others? It does seem possible that it could be Minoru or Aoi, or anyone else. What do you think? Hmm, I can't really tell, so it might be the others, or it might not. Am I really back in my world, or am I still in that other one? This should settle things once and for all. Agumo Miyuki, let's keep going just a bit further. And then Xenoblade 2, and then Xenoblade 3. Takuma, look! Oh, it really is a human I've never seen before. Sure is, no, there's no doubt about it. Definitely back in our world. That's true, but... Um, Yuki, something wrong? Oh no. It's nothing, just something bothering me, that's all. I don't know, she looks pretty upset. What could be bothering her that much? Yuki, are you feeling okay? Yeah. It's Agumon she's worried about. Is she afraid of what might happen if he's seen? Or maybe she's anxious about whether Minoru others made it okay. Then again, she could be concerned about Haru. be busy for a while. And Xenoblade Puma? That's a game I haven't heard of. Worried about whether the others are here too? Hmm? She's been... Because that's been on my mind as well. Three of us were the only ones in the music room, so it's probably too much to hope that they'll all made it back to the world too. I... I'm sorry. Oh no, I didn't mean to imply that it was your fault or anything. That's right, it's not your fault at all. No, no, sorry. I was just thinking about something else. Although I am worried about the others too. Get it? Miyuki must be worried about Haru. Makes sense. So when is it right now? Hmm? Oh, you know, I've been out for a while and I've lost track of time. It's kind of been bothering me. I'm pretty sure it's been about a week since we first arrived in the other world, meaning we've been missing for several days now. I'm sure that's caused a big stir. This could be bad, especially since Minoru and the others still haven't been back yet. I'll never be able to explain what happened with the others. Still, in that other world, what am I going to do? Takuma, we might have a problem. What now? Those people over there, they keep looking in Agumon's direction. Alright, Agumon, you need to hide, quick! Huh, but why Takuma? Remember how we talked about there not being anything like you in this world? If they find you, things could get real bad. But do I really have to hide? Just for a little while, stay out of sight, while Miyuki and I go talk to them, okay? Alright, if you say so. But it better not be for long! Or whatever it's called, this DLC for Xenoblade 2, but it's a separate story, I see. Before anybody noticed, <laughs> I think so too. She said you want to go talk with those people, right? What do you want to find out? First of all, I want to know what people in this world think of our disappearance. 
We've been missing for days, and that's sure to have caused some sort of commotion. Yeah. Let's go see what they have to say about it. Maybe I should pump the locals for some info. We're actually back in the regular world now. What do you mean? Have there been any reports of strange things going on around here? It seems like something's going on. Oh, it's been going on, all right. Looks like there's been quite a fuss over us overall. What if the police ask us what happened? Oh, we'd say, you see, a few students who came here to go camping went missing. Everyone's saying they might got caught in the landslide. Please, just left to meet with their teacher a few minutes ago. Just a few minutes ago? Huh? What is he talking about? How many days have passed since the landslide? When we went to the other world. Is this all me, Takuma? I have no clue, honestly. But I guess time passes at different rates here in this world and in the other one. This world? The other one? What the heck are you going on about? Oh, uh, nothing. Just ignore that. Wait, uh, how's the shrine uh, where the landslide happened? Is it holding up? Well, aren't you inquisitive? Uh, inquisitive? But I don't think they've finished investigating yet. The shrine was in ruins already, so they've been telling... The peaceful warrior coming in with a raid. Thank you very much, Burling Man Gaming. What's up, Pharaoh Zooks? Welcome. How is everybody? What were you guys playing and watching and doing? <sighs> so they've been telling people not to go near it. The shrine in ruins. What? That's with Muki all of a sudden. Uh, it's been decades since anyone looked after that old place. Apparently it used to be quite nice. You'd never guess the way it is now, though. Decades? What is Muki? Anyway, it's not safe to go there, so I'd stay away if I were you. <laughs> I didn't expect uh, a raid today. Uh, how am I doing? I'm doing okay. This game is uh, great. I love this game. There are a few issues with it, but they're very minimalistic. Other than that, it's just a great game. How is everyone? How are you guys? I haven't seen you all before. Don't tell me you're missing students. Or are we... Uh, crap, come on, what am I supposed to say? It's not safe to lollygag around here, so get back to your school already. Everyone's probably worried sick. Back to school. What do you mean? Things were shaking so hard it started the landslide. Students went missing. So all students who are still safe got called back to school, apparently. I'd go too if I were you. I'm good, I'm good, enjoying my game. My goodness, are you children lost? Oh no, we just stopped to rest here for a while. Is that so? Well, that's alright then, but many children do get lost around here. These woods have many confusing little game trial trails. And yet, they come anyway. There's some sort of camp or something they have around this time of year. Ah, yes, of course. Those of us who live nearby always get worried when children are around. Only natural after all those disappearances. That would have been 50 years ago now. Disappearances? Oh, there was such an outcry. Who could forget? The children were never found. Never. It was a mass disappearance. Even the famous Minas... Uh, family lost a daughter. No, you don't mean... She was about the same age as that girl over there. Uh, she looks just like... Akiharu Minase. Sister, actually. It looks like a girl who disappeared 50 years ago. And didn't that lady say Minase? That's Miyuki's last name, too. What the heck is going on? Is this... Is it just by chance, or could it be? Doing... Two bad things. All good here. Hungry, so gonna lurk. Enjoy your lurk. Peaceful warrior, son. Enjoy your stream and take care of my warriors. I will definitely take care of them. I mean, um... Uh, what? <laughs> Excuse me, but um, whatever happened to the kids that disappeared? Everyone in the village went out and searched high and low. They never found anyone. No, wait. Now that I think about it, they did find one little boy that was... Oh. Wait, does this mean Yuki was wrong? What? Oh, uh... You're looking quite pale there, dearie. Are you okay? She's really pale. She hasn't been looking great since she hurt 
what the lady said, but why? Uh, what was that noise? Hey, Takuma, is it okay to stop hiding now? Well, Adwum! Ah! What is that thing? A ghost? A monster? No, it's just stuffed animals, see? But I saw it move and talk all by itself. And it's got the computer inside, like one of those stuffed animals that can walk and talk. Right, Miyuki? What? Uh, I mean, yes, that's right. It's all because of computer. But Takuma, what's a computer? See, look, it repeats back what you say. Amazing technology, isn't it? See, technology is getting pretty advanced these days, I suppose. Huh? I have no idea what you two are talking about. <laughs> Love this game. Guess we should get going. Uh, we know the way from here, so... Are you sure? Okay, then. You be careful now. It was harder than I thought, but she bought it. Yeah, she was pretty shocked. But why? What exactly? Hmm. Oh, hey, now I can open that. So the this the main Digimon of the people that aren't currently dead is Agumon, Labramon, which is a new po Digimon. I did not say Pokemon. You can't uh, catch me saying that about this game. A different looking Falcomon, Dracmon, Floramon, and Shakomon. And then we have these five ultimates that are free Digimon that you can encounter and recruit. So yeah, that's it. But by what exactly? Hmm? Like what? Come on, I told you to stay hidden, Agumon. <laughs> Sorry, but you were talk taking your time, so I start to get curious. I guess Agumon couldn't help it. He's so bound to be curious now that he's in our world for the first time. If anyone else sees you, we're gonna be in big trouble. Here, hold my hand and pretend to be a stuffed animal from now on. So, all I have to do is hold your hand? Not quite sure I get it, but if you say so. No, jeez, please let this work. So, where are we going now? The school, I guess. We might be able to find some answers there. About you, Miyuki, are you okay with that? Yes, there's something I want to check on the school. Alright then, let's get going. Yeah! Yeah! Something about what that old man's... Old man... Old woman said bothers me. That Miyuki's reaction. A mass disappearance, huh? Does Miyuki know something about that? Miyuki, something wrong. You seem upset. Oh, it's nothing you need to worry about. Is it something you'd rather not talk about? Well, I'm... I'm not sure you'd believe me if I told you. I believe everything you say, Miyuki. <laughs> yeah, same here. Besides, we just came from another world. It doesn't get much more unbelievable than that. <laughs> I guess that's true. Here's the thing, Takuma. Everything felt wrong to me since we returned to this world. Even though I'm sure it's where I came from, I don't recognize anything about this place. What are you saying? Look, this might be a weird question, but what year is it right now? It's... this year is 2020. 2020? So it's true. It really is a different time. A different time? What are you talking about? This must be a different era from the one I lived in. Huh? Could she really be possibly from a different era? Is that even possible? Are... and... You are sure this is not some sort of mistake or misunderstanding? It can't be. When I lived here, the shrine was in some abandoned rune. And what's a computer? I've never even heard of one... Uh, before. It's all different. Everything's changed, from the scenery down to the people's clothes. Nothing is the way I remember it. So you tell me, Takuma, what do you think is going on? That can't be, can it? That would have me... Is is time flowing differently? What do you mean? It sounds like the flow of time in your world is different than in this one, Agumon. We were in that world for days, but there's only been a f here it's only been a few hours. And it's also an entirely different era than the one I grew up in. What... what am I supposed to do, Miyuki? She doesn't look too good. I think we'd better find somewhere to rest. Good idea. We're not far from the school, so we can head there. Think you can make it, Miyuki? Mm-hmm. So... he's crying. Must be quite shocked to return to this world, only to find it's not really her own. Plot twist after plot twist, guys. Phew, we finally made it. It's funny, after all that time in the other world, 
This school looks wrong to me. This place. This looks like where I went to school, only a lot nicer somehow. Probably another result of how much time it's been since Miyuki lived here. Even uh, having made it back, I still feel like I have no idea what's going on. So what are we do going to do now, Takuma? What do you mean? We came here to rest, didn't we? Yes, but there's still a lot we don't know. I was thinking we should look into things. You mean you want to search the school? Don't know about a search, but we could find a teacher and ask what's going on. In that case, we should probably have Agumon hide somewhere again. Ah, oh, again? <laughs> yeah, the more I think about it, the more I think we should start by finding a teacher. I'm sure they're looking for us after all, and maybe they know something. But if well, that's what we're going to do, sorry Agumon, but you're going to need to hide. And... But I want to stay with you, Takuma! Everything worked out before when I pretend to be a stuffed animal. I'm coming too! No, you're not. The trick isn't going to work if any of the students notice you. I'm sorry, Agamon. Hmm, fine. But you better come back soon! Okay, Agamon, you hide in the bushes on the more shaded side of the building. Remember, that stuffed animal trick probably won't fool students like before. So you'll need to be careful and stay out of sight, okay? <laughs> it's kind of like hide and seek. Hide and seek, huh? Well, I can do that. I'll hide. So good, no one will ever find me. No, Akumon does not look happy. But Akumon is like the best Digimon in this game. Like, I just... <sighs> I just get such nostalgia whenever Akumon is like talking. Alright, now let's head inside, see what we can learn and try and find the teacher. Woo! No Digimon battles, though. We're actually in the normal world right now. Corridor unlocked, cafeteria unlocked, classroom unlocked. Free bat. Wait, what the fuck do you mean free battle unlocked? What do you mean free battle unlocked? What do you mean, good sir? There aren't supposed to be any Digimon in this world. Try to talk to the other campers. Tall boy. Did you hear the people who went camping have gone missing? For real? What happened? I haven't heard any details. A teacher's been running all over looking for them. And we're supposed to just sit and wait here for now. Holy crap, this is worse than I expected. Dakma, they're talking about you and your friends, aren't they? Yeah, I think they are. The teacher and students here still have no idea what happened. I should try and talk to the other campers. Students! The teachers? They all went off somewhere. Maybe they're looking for the campers that never came back. There were a lot of them. A lot of them? Either they got caught in a landslide or they stuck around to check it out. Lots of people still haven't showed up at school. Some people left school to go check out the landslide apparently. The teachers must really be freaking out over this. Ah! Miku, what's wrong? It's nothing. I just got surprised when that TV turned on by itself. Oh yeah, someone must have used the remote. Looks like it's set to the news. You mean you can now turn the TV on from far away? And hey, the image is in color. The picture's uh, even nicer than the one... than on that big one I saw in the electronics shop that one time. Remote controls and color TVs are things most of us take for granted these days. Okay, so... Story gameplay-wise, so most of the gameplay... ...is definitely visual novel style, so mostly you're running around talking to people... Uh, ...exploring your surroundings and stuff like that. Uh, but then you have, like, the tactical RPG side for... Brain? 
for like the battles and just depending on how much you actually do like free battles, shadow battles, etc. and how quickly you actually go through the game, that just kind of shows how much you actually battle. I do think that it's more like, uh, what, 70, 30 percent? One side visual novel and 30 percent uh, battling. If you don't grind and if you don't like uh, go too hard on that. But for me personally, I really enjoy like getting to know these characters and speculating what's going to happen next. So the entire visual novel part for me is not that bad. So yeah. Jesus, sounds like a lot really has changed between now and when Yuki lived here. Though I'm having the opposite experience. It says it's today's news, but the date's the same as when we left for the shrine. So it's true, hardly any time has passed since we crossed over into that world. Yes, but not for me. Apparently it's been ages since I was taken. First, I didn't think it was possible, but I'm sure Miyuki's not lying. Some of the things the professor told me. The photograph we found in the other world, and that incident the old woman said happened 50 years ago. I feel like they're all connected. Could Haru Miyuki have been swallowed up by that other world 50 years ago? Takuma, look, huh? Location are showing for this new story. It's not far from Shrine. It says several students go missing from camp after a major landslide, so it did make news. Oh, this is bad, that means someone could recognize me as one of the missing kids. If they find out I came back, but nobody else did, they'll ask about the others for sure. How can I explain what happened? Takuma? Huh? What now? The story. What story? Is there something else in the news? Huh? That cable car looks familiar. The story of the accident, uh, it's the defunct cable car ropeway? You recognize that cable car. You think it's the same one? It has to be. Sounds like Miyuki's thinking the same thing I am. But wait, what's this next story? Bend factory collapse in landslide, blocking nearby roads. It's the same place. You recognize it too, Takuma? <laughs> oh, hi, dude. Recognize it? We were just there. That's where we fought Piedmont. I knew it. That must be what's going on. Wait, did you figure something out? Landslide that shrine, a cable car accident, and a factory collapsing. What could it all mean? Did Miyuki realize just now? Isn't it all just coincidence, or could she have known everything from the start? Isn't it a coincidence? Hold on, I don't know what to make of it all. Uh, of all this, I feel like my head's spinning. You mean this isn't all just a coincidence, you think? You know what's going on? What do you know? Well, it's not like I have all the answers, but I'll tell you what I know. But first, I think we better go somewhere else. You're right, if we stay here, someone else might overhear us. I came with the raids, but I was doing paperwork with the apartment manager. And how are you, my dudes? Yordi is doing A-O-fucking-K. Having fun with the game, just thirsty and heating up. How are you today, dude? I don't think we need to worry about anyone eavesdropping on us here. Right, I'll start, so I'll start explaining. But you have to understand, this is all guesswork on my part. I think the world we're in right now, this world, and the one we got dragged into, the other world, are connected. That makes sense, otherwise we can travel between them. That's not what I mean. I'm saying, if there's an accident in this world, in the other world, then the corresponding event will happen in this world. Huh? That would explain those accidents we saw on the news just now. But how? Remember what happened with the cable car and at the ben and at the ben factory, Takma? The cable car in the factory. That was it that happened to us there. Wait, I've got it. So what this is about? The site of the cable car accidents where Rio died, and the landslide happened at the factory where we fought Pitmo. So you're saying the two worlds influence each other as if they were overlapping. 
to be precise, I think things that happen in that world have an influence on this one. And there's something else those places had in common too, which could be more proof. They had something else in common, really? What else links those places beside location? A shared feature of both worlds? You mean the fog? Going well. Taking care of a few things, so, so going to leave you up on the laptop. Moise, okay dude. I'm gonna go grab a drink actually, because I'm dying first. back SQ. Exactly, in both those places we had to deal with the fog. Whenever something happens, the fog would roll in and cover the whole area. So in other words, bad things happen where the fog shows up in the other world, and then that has some sort of effect on this world too. Is that it? I think so. But that's terrible, the fog showed up here at this school in the other world. My the others might still be there. What if something happened to them? We're only the only ones who know about this, Takuma. Which means we're also the only ones who can do something about it. So you're saying no. Come on, you can't be serious. But I am. The only ones who can save them, Takuma, is down to us. We have to go back to that weed and save them. But what can we do? We don't even know how to get back. Oh, but we do. Huh? You saw how my song was able to join the two worlds, right? It's an ability. Passed down to the Minasa Sei family for generations. I can join the worlds again. Wait, passed down in the Minasei family. Wasn't that the family the old woman said lost a daughter in the mass disappearances? Yes, that was me. I thought so. Does that mean you and Haru crossed into that world 50 years ago? Apparently. So the two spent 50 years all alone in that world. That's crazy. Man, my head's starting to spin again. We need to stay focused on the big picture. And when you inherited this strange power that could take us back there. Let's say we did manage to return to that other world. What do we do about the fog? The master is the one who controls the fog. The master. The one who robbed me of half my soul. The same being who consumes children in that other world. Come think of it. Arikenimon and Piedmon did say the offerings were for the master. But why did this master steal half your soul 50 years ago when I was drawn into that world? There were many other children that were taken in as well. So at first I thought it was like them. I was like them, brought over by chance. But I wasn't. What the master is really after is the blood of the maiden. In other words, he's after you. Right, the master covets the holy power I inherited as a member of the Misanai family. And he wants to use that power to satisfy a grudge that goes back hundreds of years. So this is all about some ancient grudge, this is insane. Please, Takuma, I want you to help me. I want to bring an end to the Master's hate. Not just for me, but for my brother. For Haru, we need to stop the Master. Stop him. How are we supposed to stop him? I don't know, but we can't just stay here and do nothing. More than anything, I don't want to leave Haru all alone. Miyuki. Besides, if that other world falls apart, I doubt this one will fare much better. You're right. I know you're right, but... But what are we supposed to do? Whatever's happening, it's big. Big enough that I could that it could mean the end of both worlds. To be honest, I'm scared. I can't imagine what I might be able to do to stop it. But Miyuki wants to go. She wants to save her brother. And it's not like I want to just abandon the others. I want to save them too. But I don't see how I can. 
I don't have that kind of strength. I'm just a kid. I don't have superpowers. How am I supposed to save the world? But can I really turn my back on Miyuki? What am I supposed to do? I just feel so powerless. How am I supposed to save the world? What can I do? But Takuma, you're anything but powerless. When we were in the other world together, you were always there for Haru and me. When I was doing... When I was about to be devoured by the Master, didn't you rush forward to save me? How is it any different? I'm not sure I can handle anymore. Can't we think of some other way? What kind of kid like me, What kind of kid like me do? We should at least find an adult we can trust and ask for there. You know that's probably not going to happen, right? I guess not. Besides, if you're looking for a partner you can trust, remember you have Agumon. Don't you two share a powerful bond? He's right. Every challenge I've faced so far has been able to I've been able to overcome with Agumon at my side. Why should this be any different? It shouldn't be really. I know it shouldn't be, but I don't know. I feel like somehow coming back to this world turned me into a coward. Takuma, please. It did turn you into a coward. I just don't know what I should do. Takuma. Takuma, is that you? What? It is you. You're okay, teacher. Oh, teacher. I didn't check in with someone. Do you know how hard we've been looking for you? You haven't heard, but some of the students may have gone missing. It's terrible. Uh, sorry. You were in a group with Minoru, weren't you? What happened to the others? If that's a question that needs answering, then they probably didn't make it back. Not that I had much hope they did anyway. Who's this girl? Oh, uh, I am... Uh... Oh no. Actually got separated from the others. I wound up completely lost and I had this girl show me the way back. Isn't that right? Oh yes, that's exactly what happened. I live nearby, so I knew the way. You see, well... Even if it's just you, Takuma, I'm glad you made it back safe. I hope the others are okay too. The teacher must all be convinced that the others got caught on the landslide. Listen, Takuma, I want you to wait here in school for a little while, okay? You too, miss. It's probably best if you stick around until things settle down. I can't believe this is happening. The landslides alone could have been bad enough. Wait, what do you mean something else happened besides the landslide? Yeah, some talking bear monster thing appears showed up near that old shrine. Apparently it caused quite a scene. A monster? But how? Oh, I'm sure it can't actually speak. That has to be some kind of mistake. Must have been scared out of their minds, considering the timing of those reports, I wonder. Strange monster that can talk. That couldn't be Agumon, could it? No, no, Agumon's hiding nearby. Which only leaves one other option. Takuma, you don't think? Miki's face just went white as a sheet. Oh, this is bad. I don't like this at all. Could this really be who I think it is? Takuma, I have a bad feeling about this. Hold on. We can't be sure of anything yet. For all we know, it could be Minoru and Falkamon, or any of the others. But if it, <coughs> if it were, don't you think they know to avoid attracting attention like we did. She's right. Besides, if we really didn't come back alone, there was only one other monster nearby. Do you, do you really think it's him? It's gotten into you two. If you're worried about something, you know you can tell me. Miyuki, we need to be sure, right? Hey, where do you think you're going? Sorry, but we have to go. First, we need to get back to where Agumon, where we left Agumon. Agumon, sorry that took so long. Hooray, you're back! I got so tired of waiting. We'll talk later. Right now, we need to hurry back to the shrine. What? Why? What's going on? Come on, Agumon, let's go. Hey, Takumon, is that you? You made it. Whoa, what's the rush? This glasses boy looks really weird. Takuma, Miyuki, wait up. What? What was that? That didn't look like a costume. It's a very uh, bad looking. <sighs> what was that just now? Some kind of monster, obviously. It was on a rampage. Takuma, did you hear that? Sure did. Not a good sign. We should pick up the pace. Hey, stop it. You two really don't want to go that way. Takuma, Miyuki, slow down. What's going on? Ah, not a monster! Ah, Takuma, are you okay? It's so worked up, I tripped over my own feet, but yeah, I'm alright. Hey, where are you rushing off to? You don't want to go that way, it's dangerous. Takuma, you have to hurry, or... I know, just a second. You look like you fell. Are you alright? Don't worry, Takuma's got me, so everything's fine. Uh, it's... It's monster, stay back! 
have time for this. Miyuki, Agumon, let's go. What is this place? Where am I? What's going on? Is this some kind of sort of cosplay? Everyone stay back. This area is, un is so unstable that even the inner shrine has collapsed. Humans, so many of them. What's going on? I was swallowed up by the maelstorm and then the master. Did he betray me? Ah, who's that? What's going on? Sir, I'm not sure what you're doing, but I want you to turn around and come quietly. Ah, enough. Ah! Just fucking killed police officer Takuma. Did you hear that? I know this feeling, Takuma. There's an enemy up ahead. Damn it. This is just what I hope wasn't happening. Takuma, look. It was Peakmon. He's here in this world? I mean, something's not right. He's covered in wounds and he looks absolutely furious. Oh, oh no. This awful. The shrine's completely collapsed. The inner shrine must have been destroyed. Inner shrine? What's that got to do with anything? Is there something important inside? I shouldn't get distracted right now. We need to find a way to deal with Piedmon. Hey kids, this place is dangerous. Stay back. Ah. This bad. Back. Everyone, get back. Yep. What can it be? Master, did I not serve you well? Why is it to be... Why is this to be my fate? Piedmon. Miyuki, stay back. He's out of his mind. You're wrong. Wrong? How am I wrong? Your master, he's not what you think. Do not speak such lies. Oh no, Piedmon is going to attack Miyuki. Yep. I don't know if I'm strong enough to protect Niki myself, but I know someone who is. Agumon, please, you have to protect Niki. Got it, Takuma. Do anything you ask. Yeah! <sighs> Over here, now, right? <sighs> Traitorous human lackey. Does your treachery no no buttons? You will pay for thwarting me just now. Please, would you just hear me out? I don't know what you're hoping to accomplish with your trickery, but it isn't going to work. You've got it all wrong. All I want is for you to listen to me. You can stay back. But I need to get through to him. Does she really think she can convince people? I don't think she has much of a chance. I'm going to drag you back and regain my master's favor. That's not how it works. That's what I've been trying to tell you. More lies? Believe me, I know. The whole time my soul was lost, I saw the world as your master did never cared about you to begin with. Lies and deceit. Why should I believe you? You only speak in f you speak only in falsehoods, not a word you say is true. I will not stand for such blasphemy against the master. It's no use. Any more of this will only make things worse. We have to stop people now. Agumon. On the Takuma, ready to fight whenever you say the word. I will start by slaughtering these pests, and then I will return you to the Master Maiden. Here he comes, Takuma. Right, I don't see any way around the fight now. I can save my second thoughts for later. Agumon, we're doing this. Piedemon! Piedemon. We're getting absolutely destroyed here, though. Oh, this is crazy. Can you believe this? You think this is a movie or something? No way, it's gotta be real. That smaller one can possibly be fake. Hold on, let me get some pictures. Hey you three, this place is dangerous. You shouldn't be here. Go take shelter. Are we gonna get War Dreamon? Not yet. Oh, at least I get to... Sort of... Grab backup, I guess. Pseudomon. Piedmon is defeated. Destroyer! 
Spiral Swords! You can't hit it, sad. It's not like you can do that much, right, Sudomon? You're just gonna... That was unreal, so freaking cool. It's like something straight out of the movie. This is the last thing I need right now. Hey, let's get closer so we can take a video. Sweet, this is gonna blow up on social media for sure. Take this! That was a close one, I almost got hit. Yikes. Watch out for the debris. Run, stay back, this is really dangerous, so you need to keep your distance. Survive? Are you fucking kidding me? Homo pack. Attack. That sucks. Side attack. And... See if I can do anything with this Vulcan hammer. That's some damage, at least. way and turn on pack from behind what a dick an item
and turn. Items. Rip choice. Sure, just give it some back. with a regular attack, yeah. Okay, Pete Moon, get a move on your twat. Trumpet sword! Okay, talk. All stats boosted. Go destroyer and turn. Smack that all on the floor. Smack that, give me some more. It's magnet till you get so hard. Wait, can I go further? Or is this gonna get in the way from me hitting 100%? Okay, it's good enough. Drunk assault! Talk about an insta kill, bitch. But here, suck my balls. <laughs> Perfect hydro and traumatic crystal, crunchy clover carrot, super power pinning Nepal. We, we won. Takmai did it. I beat Piedmon. Yeah, way to go, Agumon. Piedmon is absolutely covered in wounds. He probably can't even move anymore. But is it safe to just leave him like that? Again, I don't really want to kill him. Takmai, Agumon, look at Piedmon, huh? He, he actually got back up, even with all those wounds. How does he still have the strength? And some determination. How dare you! I don't like the way he's glaring at us right now, talking about what do we do? What can we do? This might be more than the two of us can handle. Don't worry about me. For you, Takuma, I could keep fighting forever, Agumon. Now he means it, but he can't go on like this. He took a lot of damage in the fight. I don't have the heart to put him through anymore. This is all we can manage on our own? Without the others, are we not good enough? Don't give up, you two, Miyuki. I'm going to open the door. When I do, you take care of Piedmon. Seriously? Cursed maiden, what are you scheming now? <sighs> it's the song, the same song I heard in the music room. Voice so pretty, Miyuki. Uh, the wind's starting to pick up. Takuma, look, some sort of light. Just like before. That's the same white light I saw when Miyuki saved us in the music room. It's growing again. this white light. Is this the power of the Maiden? Takuma, now! I get it, if we can't force Piedmon inside. Ah! Can't you tell? We're sending you back to your world. Stop it! No! We did it. Takuma, are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. Good! That solves our immediate problem, but the doorway is still there. I know what that means, but I find myself unable to say anything. Takuma, I've made up my mind. Made up your mind to do what? You remember what I said when I saw that sh the shrine had collapsed? You mean about the inner shrine being destroyed? Yes, the shrine is very important to the master. His presence has helped keep some of his power in check up until now. 
But if it's been destroyed, it won't be long before that entire island is covered in fog. The entire island? But that would mean our friends are going to get swallowed up by that scary fog. We're running out of time, both in this world and in the other one. If we don't do something, whatever happens is sure to have a huge effect on this world. So what am I supposed to do? I need you to help me. I want to protect this world. I want to save everyone. This world needs to be protected, so do our friend... So do our friends, more than anything, and so do I. After all, I'm sure the Master wants to take me back, Mikiai. Takuma? What should I do? No, what do I want to do? Part of me wants to save the world, like Miki says, but I know that how hard that's going to be. Then again, if I don't do anything, I'll be turning my back on all my friends. They've done so much for me. I'd hate to just abandon them. But am I really up to taking on something that could mean the end of the world? Besides, I never asked to go to that other world. I got dragged in without a choice. And now that I'm finally free of that awful death trap, I'm supposed to go back? For all I know, that could cost me my life. I don't know if I'm prepared for that. Takuma? Agumon, you're right. If I gave up now, I'd also be giving up on Agumon. And that's definitely not something I want to do. He... He means so much to me. The paths... The path branches off here. Save the game. Yes. Never go back again, save the world. Is this the... Oh no, you can't choose the Wrathful Path because I haven't put enough points in that one. Be true to my friends! You know, I've been trying to figure out what to do. I can't leave my friends who fought by my side stuck in that other world. Not while I'm here safe and sound. That just wouldn't be right. And I've decided I can't turn my back on my friends. Takuma, does that mean you'll go back? Every time we've been in a dangerous situation, our friends were there to help. If our friends are in danger this time, that just means it's our turn to help them out. So we need to go back to that world, back to our friends and defeat the master. Faithful decision, yes. Yes, you're right. Thanks, Takuma. It's just how I feel. You've all helped me so much. This time I want to return the favor by fighting at your side. So that we can save the others and protect my little brother. I'll do whatever I can to help. Well, your little brother is now an old man, just so you know. So what's your next step? That's easy, we jump into the white light and go back to the other world. Isn't that right, Mewpeep? That's right, we should all hold hands so we don't get separated. <sighs> what a time to get a phone call, huh? It's from my mom. It's funny, the whole time we've been back, I completely forgot I had my cell phone. This isn't the best time for a call, though. Yeah, it's still ringing, sorry, give me a minute. <laughs> no panic, Takuma. Hello, mom? Takuma, it's me. I just want to check when you're coming back. Was it tomorrow or the day after? Man, remember how I thought she was so annoying when I was getting ready to go? Now it feels like it's been ages since we talked. It's so good to hear her voice. I don't know what I did with that schedule and I was worried about you forgetting stuff. It's tomorrow. I'll be home tomorrow, I promise. But you shouldn't call me. Just check on that. <laughs> you're, you're so hopeless, mom. Takuma, are you crying? Is something wrong? Of course not. Why would I be crying? Takuma, you can tell me. It's okay if to it's okay to cry if you feel lonely. Really, sometimes I think you'll never grow up. Tell you what, tomorrow night we'll have curry for dinner. I know it's your favorite curry. That's right, now cheer up. It's just one more day, so give it all you've got. Alright, I will. I'll come back tomorrow, no matter what, I promise. It's weird, but somehow it feels like my mom really is cheering me on. She sure is something else. My friends mean a lot, but I need to protect her and everyone else in this world too. So that's what I'm going to do. Me and Agumon together. Sorry, Miyuki, I've got taken something back that I said. What? I said I'd help you before, but that wasn't quite right, because I'm in this too. We're gonna save these worlds together. Let's do it. Yeah, and don't forget me, we're all in this together! Takuma, Agumon, I don't know how to thank you. Alright, now let's go. Back to that other world where our friends are waiting for us. Holding hands, we all leapt through into the shining doorway of light. 
Saving the world isn't going to be easy. My legs felt weak just thinking about it. And with Agumon's hand in mine, firmly drawing me forward, I took the first step. She has returned. I can feel it. The maiden steps one more, once more into this world. This time she will become a vessel. Part 9, here we go. Hey, I found them. And my sister. Uh, it's okay, it's okay, you're safe now. Did you and your sister get separated? Yeah, please save my sister. Save her, you say? One of those beasts attack her. No. No, you're wrong. These guys are like fog. I fell in a weird place, that's why... Huh? Just my sister is in trouble, okay. Weird place? Don't take it seriously. People see all kinds of things in moment of desperation. Really saw it, poor thing. Must have been scared to death. Won't they believe me? But at any rate, let's go look for the sister. Yeah, let's go. Why? Why won't anyone believe me? I knew I should have run away with her when I had the chance. Sis, where are you? Professor? Professor? Oh, I was... You were unconscious, like your body was here, but not your mind. Are you alright? Ah, uh, yes. I'm fine, thank you. What are you doing, me? You hurry up and run. I know, I know, don't rush me. Hey, Professor, can you move? Yes, I can. How pathetic, having children worrying about me. Perhaps I could learn a thing or two from that boy, from Ka that Kaido boy. From that brat? I wouldn't recommend it. My brother's a busy bodiness effect that you too. I couldn't take it. Still, at times like this, he's pretty handy, I guess. But only at times like this. I can hear you, Mew. She trusts him despite the rough language in comparison. I'm just. Shoot, Professor? Forgive me for startling you. Well, she has enough energy to talk crash, so I guess that's a good thing. You guys ready? It's about time to head out. Words, let's head straight to the underpass. Don't fall behind. Yes, let's go. What is going on? My mind is never with me. My sister, I... Takma, wake up, Takma. Hey, Takma, wake up. <laughs> Agumon, just bitch slap him. Like, <laughs> Agumon, this is. It's my world. We made it back. See, so we did it. What, what about Miyuki? Miyuki, I haven't seen her. I mean, just look around. With the fog, this thick. We can't see a thing. I don't think it was this thick before. We have to get out of here, Takuma. It's getting thicker by the second. Yeah, you're right. I heard something in the grass. Something there. That sound. Yeah, sorry, Agumon. I know we just got back, but no worries. I'll fight whatever comes at us. Can't let her guard down here. One wrong move can spell the end in this world. It's getting closer and closer. Here it comes. Is someone there? Talking about that voice. It sounds like someone's there. It must be my imagination. Minoru? Ta Takuma, you're alive? I thought we'd never see you again. Hey, hey, you're hugging me too tightly. Tough cookies. This is what an emotional reunion looks like, man. 
What is it, Minoru? Did I hear you call out Takuma's name just now? Oh, it's you, Falcomon. Agumon? And you as well, Takuma? So you survived after all. This is great, really. I, you have no idea. I thought for sure that... Alright, alright, I get it. Hey, where's everyone else? They're all safe, don't worry. Aoi, Kaido, Miyusaki, the Professor, Labramon, and Drakmon as well, of course. What about Miyuki? Um, you haven't run into her? Oh, no. I haven't seen her at all. Let's see. I'll save the explanation for later. For now, uh, let's go meet up with everyone. Everyone's gonna flip when they see you're still alive and kicking. They're back. Yeah, they're back. Renamon, that means you need to go swiftly search for Miyuki. Takuma? Is that really you, Takuma? Oh, you're safe! Honestly, I thought you were kaput. Hidey-ho, guys. What do you mean, hidey-ho? We were worried sick about you. It's great to know the two of you are safe. Looks like I caused you guys some grief. Looks like, he says, where the heck have you been hiding this whole time? She's. And here we were wringing our hands over here. Now, now, the important thing, he's you safe and sound, right? That won't do, right, Takuma? What happened to you after that you got separated from us in the factory? Tell us uh, all about the past 10 years. Wait, did you say 10 days? Yes, that's what I said. Is something wrong? T 10 days? We were only gone for a few hours, though. Does time move that quickly here? Please tell us in as much detail as possible. Give him a break, Aoi. But any detail may be, may be the difference between life and death for us, you know. Um, Aoi? What's this? Insistence. Aoi, have you changed somehow? Understand your confusion, Takuma? Many things have happened in your absence. Aoi has become uh, the a de facto leader, as it were. She's more like a mother hen than a leader, if you ask me. Better than Kaito's usual calling. I feel less hen packed with the mother hen. Quiet, you two. We're having a serious conversation right now. Please, Takuma, your answer. Sure, I'll talk. The truth is... You went back to our world? Yeah, but I was only over for a few hours. That's why I was surprised to hear over a week had passed over here. Time flows differently in this world and the other one. Like the tale of... Urashima Taro. Whoa, so that's how it is. I don't know much about time flowing differently here and there, but if 10 days over here was only a few hours back in our world, that means time flows slower here, right? Well, I think I get it. Maybe that means as long as I stay here, Saki. I'm cool, Florimon, don't sweat it. Yeah, I hear you. I'm happy to see everyone got back safely. Indeed, although to call us safe now is a bit stretch. Things are that bad. The fog is getting thicker by the day, almost as if it's hunting us down. One thing's for sure, it's only a matter of time before it consumes the school. Hey, one thing's bothering me. We were able to get back to our world. Why did you come back here? We saw Piedmon going on a rampage through the other world. What? A jerk screwing around with you guys? World 2 now? The situation is no longer limited to this world, is it? Yeah, at this rate, our world's gonna be in danger too. This fog-covered world is corrupting the world we came from. That's why I came back. I don't know if I can save everyone, much less the whole world, but I couldn't just sit by and act like nothing is happening. That's Takuma for you, my man. Takuma, what a guy. So you... So you came back here on your own? Kaito, not quite. It took a lot to get back here, and I got separated from Miyuki. She holds the key to it all. Miyuki? Miyuki holds the key? What do you mean? Miyuki is already done for, I think. I wouldn't count on her if I were you. Don't say that, we're friends, we have to hear the details. Quiet, Miu, I'm saying this for your sake. Alright, enough of that. Takuma, please tell me what you mean about Miyuki and the key she holds. Um, how shall I explain this? Maybe I should talk about how the worlds are connected first, then ask then about Miyuki's song. Wait, I can't explain her power if I don't talk about the Magnaisa family first. Is that too confusing though? Maybe talking about people in the gate would be easier. It's hard to explain, but Miyuki comes from a family with a strange power. What strange kind of strange power? Like ESAP, <laughs> ESP or something? I don't honestly know all the details, but she comes from a line of shrine maidens who served gods, I think. 
Their power can open gates between this world and the one we came from. We actually came back here through one of those gates. Hmm, I don't know about all these mysterious powers and shrine maidens. Still, you've come back, Takuma, there's no doubting that. All more reason for us to get Miyuki back then. You think you can do it? If we have to, we have to. Why don't you get it? I don't want to put you in danger. Don't you want to go home, Kaido? Because I do, with you guys and everyone. I get it. But that's why I... I'm sorry, Takuma. We're at the end of our rope here. Still, I'm happy you came back for us. We've been very discouraged lately. No idea time flowed like that here. Anyway, I'm sorry I kept you waiting. No need to apologize. Let's rest for a bit, then return to the question of Miyuki. Why don't you get me? You're the one who doesn't get it, Kaido. Come on, Kaido, chill out already. Mew, calm down a bit, okay? Right, you two, that's enough. Why don't we take a break, everyone? Takuma's just got back, after all. I'll put together an extra fancy lunch today, okay? Yeah, uh, right. Okay. Oh, hey, I'll lend uh, you a hand. I'll lend you a hand. Me too, I'll help out too. Ah, well, if Saki's up for it, then so am I. Thanks, guys. That's a big help. Well, then, you all behave yourselves until we're done, okay? Okay? Okay. Something wrong with the Professor? Something is always wrong with the Professor. So, what should we do? We're not gonna wait around for Aoi to finish cooking. Sure, but we should talk to him before that. Him? You mean the Professor? Oh, you figured that out fast. The whole time you were talking to Aoi, he stared at you looking all twitchy and stuff. Noticed that too, huh? Yeah, like when Lebermon's looking for attention, but Aoi's too busy. <laughs> I'm not sure that's the same thing. Well, either way, I have a couple of things to ask the Professor about too. We should find a place to talk to him. Free action! Does that open up any digivolutions, by chance? We have five movesets, that is creepily little. Creepily little. There's something here, I can sense it. That shadow. Fight. Run. Eh, we're not gonna fight, I'm not in the mood. You know what, actually? I think this is the perfect time to call quits for tonight. My sweatiness is insane. Jesus Christ. Eight hour, uh, eight and a half hour stream. I wonder if this stream is gonna be too large to put in on YouTube in one go. I mean, I guess I'll have to figure that out at some point. Right? I guess. So, ladies and gents, gents and gentle ladies, thank you very much for hanging out with me tonight. Hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day, evening, and sleep well. Jordi is uh, poopy. It's way too hot today. I hope it becomes less hot tomorrow. And uh, I'll be back tomorrow. We'll continue our Did Mom Survive playthrough. I won't stream that early tomorrow. <laughs> uh, I got things to do on the day. I should probably start working on uh, encoding the videos. So yeah, ladies and gents, gents and gentle ladies, thank you very much for hanging out. Sweet dreams for later and have a fantastic rest of your day. Adios.